Hello guys, we're about to get into it. Let's jump into the uh, Great One Moose grind, finally. Finally, we can jump into the Great One Moose grind on Medved. Super excited for this. Let's see, I already got all the tents purchased last night. However, I do need to equip them because I did that uh, fox hunt earlier today. Let's get rid of that. Uh, to be honest, I don't even need the 308. I'm gonna go double 300s probably if I can carry that. That's a familiar sound I hear. There we go. Oh, it is! It's wolves! Holy! Um, guess we'll use that. I swear if there's a diamond one here. <laughs> okay, no diamond. We're good. How's everybody doing? How is everybody doing? What does the title mean? So today on the EW stream, it was revealed that all those special fur types they showed off are rares. Yeah, you, I'm as disappointed as you guys are. They revealed that those are rare fur types. Which means most Great One Moose will be common. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty disappointed with it. Cause that was one of my- that was one of the things I was most excited for. But apparently they're not gonna be the normal thing that we get as a Great One Moose. It's gonna be special fur types. That's a four. Alright, so we've got our old Medved Moose set up. Hopefully it'll do well. Hopefully it will do well for the first part of this grind. That's a three. What the? Okay, that one connected. Yeah, I'm pretty disappointed about it, guys. Not gonna lie. That, uh, it's gotta be one of the more disappointing things I've heard. Great ones are allergic to you? I'm sorry, Hollow. I'm sorry. <laughs> You'll get one eventually, I promise. Yeah, I have no idea, Bunny. I have no idea. I'm just relaying information that I was told about the EW stream today. Uh, yes, Luke, I will be doing that. Wait, they did, Blakester? I was not aware of that. I'm going to assume that's not intentional. I'm going to assume that Red Deer were not intended to be messed with. I never checked them when we were in early access, though. My Whitetail were fine. That's not good if Red Deer were messed around with. That means that all of my herd management would be gone. That would be quite unfortunate. I hope they didn't. I hope that's not like a universal issue. Okay, here's the blood. Oh gosh, we didn't hit either of them good. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. That's really strange, Payson. None of my whitetail were messed with. I don't know, Alco. I think maybe the moose have hit registration issues. It's hard to say. It's hard to say because during early access, I only really played on New England. And then I bounced over to Leighton briefly to see how things looked. Game is taking forever to update. That's not good, Tony. That is not good. What do you do with just with one bull zones? Uh, kill them. You just got to figure out where they go after.
Yeah, I don't know, Walker. I don't know. I, I really feel like it should have been, like, we should have been told about this sooner, I feel. I'm kind of annoyed that we were not informed about this quicker. The first kill of the grind. Nice, Logan. Uh, because I've never got a great one bear crickets and I added them after I finished my uh, first grind for them. I'm not going to do a great one bear one until we actually start grinding for bear. Moose seem harder to take down. It's possible. Yeah, me too, Cannon. I'm pretty disappointed as well. That should have been the first thing that they said when they were showing them off. They should have immediately said, these are the rare fur types you could get. Instead of making it out to be like they were just going to be commons, right? That really annoys me. Oh, apparently they're all rares, Wapiti. Apparently all of them are rares for the Great One Moose. Which, uh, I just, I have no words, man. Pretty disappointed about that. Yeah, I'll check it out at some, at some point, uh, Zedenda. I heard that it was, I heard a lot of people saying that it did get messed with. Yeah, apparently, but apparently, Bunny, apparently, it seems like that's how it's going to be. Also, we're probably going to start with the, uh, the river zones because that's going to take the longest to find. What happened to Whitetail? Uh, nothing. Nothing happened to the Whitetail. What do you mean? Mason, thank you so much for the super chat, man. Really appreciate it. Absolute legend as always. To in herd management on Medved for Moose and to find all my zones um, and hunt them till one to two. It's hard with only 16 tents. Oh, I, I totally get that, man. It definitely is. I think no matter which map you choose, uh, moose are going to be tough to find like all your zones and cover it with all your tents because there is a lot of solo moose zones. I think it's going to be one of those grinds where we have to move tents constantly, which I did that with whitetail anyway, so it's nothing new for me, but it's definitely one that you will have to, uh, it's a grind where you'll have to move things around quite a bit. What is the rarest Great One skin? Nobody knows, Epic. Nobody knows. They didn't tell us how rare they were. They just said that they're rare. What's a max weight buck? Uh, what species, uh, TJ? I'm assuming Whitetail. If you're talking about Whitetail, it's 100 kgs. Do I hunt IRL? I do, but I haven't been able to in years. I mean, I have no idea. Crickets, I'd have to really get a couple to know if I like them more. My opinion on, like, a great one typically changes the more I'm able to see of them. Like, uh, for a while, I really liked the red deer the best. And then the more I hunted them and realized it's just three different racks repeatedly and that the whitetail has so much more, I started liking the whitetail more. I imagine Moose, it's going to take a couple of great ones before I really know exactly how much I like them. Okay, this segment of the river is looking pretty dead, so honestly that's kind of good for us. Means uh, less time spent on the river. Yeah, I don't know, Noofy. I'm hoping that we do. I got a feeling it's going to be I buy though. Though, to be fair, iBuy is grinding New England, so that might make it uh, take a little bit longer to get going. 
Also, guys, I added like 20 more songs from a variety of different genres. There's like uh, some lo-fi in there, a little bit of like uh, trap beats, a little bit of punk, um, a little bit of metal as well. So now we got like an even larger mix of music to listen to while we uh, stream. Uh, what do you mean am I feeling better? I was never feeling bad. Can anyone go check if Red Deer got reset for sure? I will eventually, Luke. I will for sure eventually. I, I want to get this moose grind going though. But maybe later tonight off stream I'll check it out and let you guys know. Nice, hollow, nice. Yeah, there's a, there's a few punk songs I put in there. Already done one, uh, Quattro. Maybe Nufi, we'll see. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, yeah, there's a little bit of metal in there, uh, drama. I added a few metal songs. Uh, keep in mind everything is instrumentals because, uh, I don't want, uh, vocals overlapping my voice, so... Hey, Sicko, how's it going, dude? What's the title about the fur types are rare? Yes, all of the moose fur types, all the great one moose fur types are rare. They they failed to tell us that when they were revealing them, but you know, it is it is what it is. Ah, it still hurts, man. So disappointed that they're not going to be the normal fur types. I mean, it's one thing if maybe it's like a one in five chance to get one. I wouldn't be too upset about that, but if it's as rare as the fabled piebald, that's going to be disappointing. I hope it's not that rare. I really hope it's not that rare. But I guess only time will tell. We'll have to hunt around a bit and figure that out for ourselves. Okay, we got solo cows here. That's good. Uh, yeah, so far, the regular moose will have just the common uh, fur type. I mean, I'm kind of happy about that, Noah, because I'm super against, uh, like, uh, glitches being used as a way of exploiting. That's a decent four. That's a solid four right there. How far is that? 350. Well, we missed the last two, but we got the first one. Yeah, they haven't clarified the rarity. At least I'm I'm not aware of if they have. I didn't actually watch the EW stream. I've just been getting told this by everybody. And so I'm kind of just going off of the info that I've heard. But uh, from what I understand, they haven't really clarified it. Oh, it does, Elon? That's awesome. Yeah, I was pretty excited when I saw that uh, console would be getting the 60 FPS because I know a lot of you struggle with that. And so that's really, uh, it's good to see that it worked out well. Hey, Lax, how's it going, dude? So the overlay is just how many great ones and diamonds we've got of each species. So in the uh, top right, you'll see all of the great one and diamond statistics for Whitetail. Top left is all of our red deer diamonds and great ones. And the bottom is moose diamonds and great ones, which right now is empty because we just started the moose grind. They're really bad, Clay Drew. Oh, gosh, that's so disappointing to hear. Oh, gosh, I hope they didn't. I hope they didn't intentionally change Red Deer and not tell us. I kind of will be a little mad about that as well. Gosh, this update's got so many things that they did not... They didn't tell us was going to happen. <laughs> that sucks, man. They haven't clarified the rarity. Only thing they said is the common variants are more common. Got you, Ben. Okay, that makes sense. I hope that we still have a chance at getting one then. Like, I hope it's not going to be absurdly impossible like rares for uh, the Whitetail Great One. Because Whitetail Great One rares are like virtually non-existent. So I hope it's not like that. I don't think it will be. Oh, there's a three.
We are going to be doing a lot of tracking today. I can already tell. Honestly, the dog is going to be a necessity for the Medved grind. Because you can lose the blood so easily because of the, uh, the snow. Tips on shot placement. Aim for the crease in the front shoulder. I'll show you very shortly. Essentially, you look at the... You want to hit where the lungs are. And so you kind of... You look at the front shoulder and aim at the crease at the very back of it. 238, so like right where we put it right there. A good way to do it is just whenever you kill an animal, examine the uh, the x-ray like this. And then look at where the lungs are located and then aim for that. Uh, we just started a QCK. We just started it. So I, I can't really even like... I can't really even give an opinion on it yet because I haven't hunted them enough. Just kind of working on the river to start. Gonna try and get as many of the river zones and like the more difficult zones to twos. Yeah, apparently, apparently they messed up the uh, the red deer, Johnny. Un unfortunately, it seems like they messed up red deer. Sad to hear it, but it is what it is. Three thirty eight. Yeah, maybe three thirty eight. Might be something that we could do. We'll have to see. Maybe I'll carry three thirty eight and the three hundred with me. That might be good. Oh no, Johnny, that's not good. Did I get another great one whitetail before the update? I got one two days before the update, Bucky. I don't know if you saw it. We got the, uh, we got another drop time great one. Yeah, I don't know what happened, Johnny. Like, there was so much good about this update, and then they just had to leave a bunch of info not talked about, and now, now I'm so split. So split and torn about everything. Just, uh, just disappointing. Disappointing, man. Because everything that we played on New England felt so good for the most part. When we were playing through the early access, like... Everything seems so good. But this is always how it is. It's the maps that aren't the main focus that have the issues. Almost every single time, it's the maps that weren't the main focus. What's disappointing? Um, a few things, Caden. So, all of the fur types they showed up for the moose are rares. They're not actually commons. Uh, no, Allie, we're super against mods here. Not a fan of people that use mods. And we need to go back and grab that other blood. But yeah, there's a lot of issues with this update, unfortunately. There is... Issues with Red Deer. Where apparently all the zones were reset. And that was not talked about. And to be honest, I don't think it's intended either. I think that's gotta be a bug. And then we've also got issues with, um, the great one, moose fur types being rares, like not commons. Most of our moose great ones are going to look like commons. And then another, another thing that's kind of a disappointment is the fact that it seems there's a lot of crashing issues at a couple of the outposts on Rancho. There also seems to be some hit registration issues on moose. Where is this other one? Did we not hit it? No, we didn't. What? Okay, that's exactly, exactly what I was talking about. Hit registrations on moose. 
We didn't even hit that first one that we went for the heart shot on. Whitetail as well. Zones are gone. But they weren't when I checked it out of VIP. We checked out Whitetail and Early Access and they looked the same as my normal. Had 10 drink zones disappear. I've heard a lot of people say that as well, Trenton. Um, I heard um, Ibai is still having issues with zones just randomly disappearing without him even shooting any. Got you, Hypnos. Got you. Yeah, for me, they were fine, so I'm happy about that. I'm I'm scared to look at my red deer, though. I'm scared to look at my red deer. Uh, we have all our tents placed down already. Well, we're almost to a tent. At least we got weapon customization. Yeah, for sure. Don't get me wrong, I'm still happy about all the good things. It's just these these issues that popped up are pretty significant. Pretty significant. Normally I try my best to only look at like to try and look at the bright side of everything, but I don't know, I'm pretty bummed about the moose fur types and the the issues with populations just randomly disappearing. Uh what is it, Ben? The red deer are horrible. Like how bad, Ben? Like just moved around zones or did they did they completely redistribute them? All your herds are reset. Okay, well I'm not super worried about I'm not worried about if my herds are reset for red deer. The only thing that I would be kind of uh disappointed about is if they redistributed the population around again. I don't mind my red deer getting reset because it was pretty easy to herd manage them. I would be a little bit more worried if they just completely moved them around. Okay, good big game. I'm not too worried about that then. It sucks for everybody that uh, had it happen, but I can definitely, I can definitely re-herd manage my Tiawaroa. It didn't take me too long to get that going. Well, they might not have been redistributed, Clay Drew. Uh, keep in mind that uh, everybody's got probably between 100 and 150 different zones. And your map is only going to choose like half of those for Red Deer, right? So... There's a good chance they just tossed them into areas that you hadn't seen them before. Because zones are not in the same places for everybody, right? There is going to be some variances. Uh, because New England sucks for moose, Tian. It absolutely sucks for moose. There is 150 drink zones. I buy had 150 drink zones for moose on New England. That is like the worst thing for a grind. And I had over 100 when I stopped uh, looking for them in early access. It's uh, it's kind of crazy. Oh, it is hollow. They did increase it. They increased the spook radius to about 300 meters or so, give or take a, give or take some meters, you know. So gunshots spooked them from much farther. It's unfortunate because there were so many nice things with this update. Like there were so many things that were really good and then they just had to... Had to... What's the word? I guess they just had to muddy the waters, right? Everything was looking all clear and nice. It was a great day for a swim and then a bunch of mud washed down from the mountains and now the water's got mud in it. Yeah, that's a couple that we need to take down. That is more moose. 
I'm not going to be able to shoot all of these. Uh, we're also going to need to drop a tent like right here. Those are about 280 away. Actually, we might have to approach this from lower. Like, uh, down the river. At least we got a couple really nice zones here. Okay, we got him. And of course, the, the big herd with the four fled. Kind of thought I was far enough away, but I guess not. What does the title mean? All of the moose, moose fur types are rares. All of the special fur types they showed off on stream is rares. And they didn't tell us that. I don't know why, but... Seems like that's some pretty vital information, you know? Like, that I would have loved to know before the update. It's unfortunate, man. Uh, no, no clue, man. I have barely hunted the moose on Medved. I have no idea how many zones I have. I still gotta search around and find them. He's still fleeing. Wow. There must be wolves up there or something. Me too, Blakester. I thought it was going to be all good, but, um, definitely was a lot of issues that arose. And I got a feeling that half of them were unintentional issues as well. Like, there really is so much stuff that I was excited about with this update, but, uh, it's starting to get overshadowed by the bad. And you guys know me, I always try to find the best in an update. I always try to be positive, but I'm just pretty bummed about these random resets that are happening and the issues, well not issues, but the fact that the moose special fur types are rare for the great one. And they never told us. Uh, it's about the same, Bucky. The muzzle loaders are very similar. Pretty much just visual differences. Well, yes, drama, because being negative gets you nowhere in life. And in most cases, I try to find the good in everything that I look at, right? And that goes for everything in life, not just the game. So, yeah, obviously, I try to look for the positives. Just went to go in the house. My game crashed. Hope the level 5 is still there. Yeah, hopefully, dude. I've heard a few people reporting crashes. It's crazy because I didn't get any crashing when I was playing on Early Access. I'm curious if it's maybe just certain platforms, maybe certain areas I never went to. Okay, he should go down. Yeah, it definitely is drama. New England is really good for multiplayer, not gonna lie. New England is a phenomenal multiplayer map. I was hopping on there for today's video and it's actually really good for that. It's really, really good for multiplayer. Orvis, thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate the super chat. Are the devs conspiring to make grinding harder since herd management has caught on so much? It might be, man. It could be. It could be that they're trying to increase the difficulty without, like, telling us that they increased it. That way it doesn't get discovered as quick, right? It could be. I don't think so, though. I think a lot of things were unintentional with this update. I mean, I, I know for a fact that it was intentional to increase the spook range. That's that's for sure intentional. But, um... The, the things with, like, people's populations getting reset, I don't think that's intentional. They would have told us if there was going to be a reset. I think that's got to be a bug that happened. 
Because it seems like not everybody's populations are getting reset. It's just some people. I know, right, Ormy? Hey, to be fair, man, I just started moose grinding like 30 minutes ago. I spend most of my time uh, running around New England multiplayer and uh, unlocking a few outposts on there. <laughs> Uh, to be fair, Yogi, in most cases, you don't need to call them. Uh, typically, I, I don't think I've ever called a turkey in ever since the, like, maybe second week of release of turkeys. Most cases, I just run around and uh, blast them as I see them. I mean, I suppose if you're using a bow, you would need to uh, call them in, but it's not a necessity to hunt them. Uh, yeah, Classic Hunter, it did. They increased the spook range to about 300 meters when, when you, uh, fire a rifle. Did not get vitals on that guy. Where's the other one? Didn't we, uh, hard shot one? Did we already claim it? We might have. There's one. See, this is going to be one of the tough things about Medved. Seeing the blood. Seeing the blood is going to be tough. Curious what colors will show up best. I mean, yellow's not bad. I guess we'll just go with bright green. I guess we'll go with this. That actually might be the best. Uh, Bunny, thank you so much for the super chat. Really appreciate it. Thank you so, so much. Hope this brings good luck. Hopefully it does, man. Hopefully it does. Thank you so much once again. Really appreciate it. We're going to keep going. We're going to stay motivated. It looks like we are at the edge. All right, so we ran through the entire river already. Now let's kind of run along this little coastline right here. Can I, can I fast travel, please? There we go. Should you get the map? Um, I mean, that's up to you, Hunter Boy. I don't really know if it's, like, something that you would like. Because I don't really know, like, what your preferences are on a map, right? Random level two. Uh, Sam, thank you for the eight months. Really appreciate it, dude. Welcome back. What scope am I using? The Argus scope. What time does the update come out today? It's already out, Bryson. It's already out. Best map for finding diamonds. I mean, there really is no best map for finding diamonds. There's a lot of maps where you can find lots of diamonds. I'd say Rebel Tuli is a good one. So Silver Ridge Peaks. New England's probably going to be a great diamond hunting map. <laughs> wow, Hollow. Okay. I see how it is. I see how it is, you nerd. Uh, yeah, Classic Hunter, I do. I do prefer the more modernized weapons. That's a female. That is a female moose right there. At some point, I'm going to have to go through my map, probably off stream, and like make a map of all of these zones. That way I can remember it.
Oh, he stopped. Get one more into him. Gotta love it, uh, Gohan. Gotta love it. That's the worst, man. That is the worst. Because they're always so close, and they don't make it. I'm doing good, Sam. Got a diamond moose yesterday. It was my first diamond moose on the last sun of the night. Nice, Caden. That's awesome. Well, it's definitely out, Bryson. Maybe try restarting your system. Maybe try, like, checking for updates or something. It's definitely out for you. I can promise you that. Best map for Moose? Definitely Medved, Tian. Medved will be the best, 100%. It's got the most manageable zones. Layton's going to be pretty good as well, though. Because I believe the moose are more limited in their range on on uh, Layton. Uh, Kevin, thank you for the 21 months, dude. Really appreciate it. Hope you're doing good, man. Welcome back. And uh, do, do Midnight, thank you so much for the super chat. Red deer herds have been reshuffled around. All my nines are still on the map. Love the stream. Oh, they've been... Wait, they've been shuffled around, but your nines are still on the map? That's really weird. So are you thinking that maybe they moved them around, but didn't reset them? If that's the case, that'd be very strange. Because I don't think that's ever happened before. Thank you, Wanda. I appreciate that. Glad you think so. No, I don't think it's just his map. Unfortunately, a lot of people are reporting Red Deer have been moved. Same with Whitetail. A lot of people lost their Whitetail zones. I got lucky enough that my Whitetail are still there, but... Seems like some people have been losing their Whitetail. Some have been losing their Red Deer. But it seems like maybe the red deer were just moved and not reset. Really weird though. Really weird and unfortunate. What map is this? This is Medved Taiga. Yeah, I hope it's still good, Jenkins. I hope it's still good. Uh, the update came out about 10 hours ago. I don't know if Moose will be through here. I don't remember seeing any there. Yeah, me too, uh, Myra. I really hope so. Hey, Drawn, how's it going? I don't mind Revon Tuli for Moose, but they're they're pretty spread out just like New England. And there's a lot more water to cover on uh on Revon Tuli. Uh, yeah, we did get a new multi-mount. It's a moose with a bobwhite quail standing on its head. That's a three. That is a four. Solo moose zones. Gotta love them. Come on. React. Finally. <laughs> Took him forever.
Hey now, don't be turning on me. All right, he's down. I'm not sure, Ghost Squid. Not sure. All we know is that all of the uh, special fur types are rares. Which is pretty, uh, pretty unfortunate to hear. To be honest, I wouldn't have minded it, but... I wouldn't have minded it, minded it if they had mentioned it, right? Like, if they had said it from the beginning, okay, these are rares, then I would not have cared. Yeah, it's possible, Luke. We don't know at this point. We gotta wait till people get a few. It's gonna take eight hours on your Xbox? Ooh, that's rough, man. Hang in there. Super rare, great one then? Something like that. Uh, because he had, he had the dev tools, QCK, he can set it to spawn whatever. And since Jaxie's never really used the uh, dev commands, he was just following like the stuff that they told him to get them to spawn in the way that he wanted them. And so it, it probably was just a matter of like, you can, when you're, when you have the dev tools like that, you can set what spawns in front of you, right? Yeah, exactly, QCK. Uh, all of these special fur types for the moose are rares, Dorothy. All the moose great one fur types are rares, apparently. And most of our moose great ones are going to be common when we find them. Seems like those fur types, it's just if you're lucky, you'll get one of those. Uh, we don't know, Parker. They didn't tell us. All we know is that it's going to be easier to get commons. That's literally all they said. What do you mean, monks? That's not a thing, man. That's not a thing. How likely are the new... Okay, I already read that. Revontulia has better zones for me on my map compared to Medvet. I mean, that's how it's going to be dependent on how well you've searched your map, right? And the question is, what do you mean by better? Do you mean more zones? Do you mean less zones? Do you mean located in better places? I have no idea, Mr. Bartlow. I, to be honest, I, I wasn't really too interested in hunting waterfowl during early access, so I didn't even look for decoys. Uh, herd management for moose is going to be just shooting threes and above. Keep the twos and below. That's a big four. That's a real nice four. Beautiful. That's a nice one. No, Daniel. It's going to be the same rarity as any other great one. Uh, definitely, Tian. Definitely. Leighton is really good for Moose. What gun am I using? 300 Magnum. Oh no, Bray, yeah, that's, it's definitely gone if you didn't shoot it. Is 
Dog's not tracking anything? That's not good, Rizzy. To be honest, I have not paid attention to if my dog has been tracking. I've sent him out to track a couple times and I don't think he did. I'll have to try it again. 300 Magnum is from, uh... It's from Yukon. Got you, Colby. Yeah, well, it's all about, like, the zones you found, right? There's... I believe, uh, Lady Legend had over 100 zones on Medved. So I imagine that that's gonna be the same for every map. I mean, New England's got 150. There's probably a lot of zones that you haven't seen. Because Medved is a loaded map for Moose. Okay, my dog's tracking. It looks like it's fine. Are the zones the same? What do you mean by that, uh, Kiwi? You're gonna have to elaborate a little bit, man. Got you, Weasel. Okay. Good to know. Favorite great one to hunt for? Uh, right now it's Whitetail, but I'm- I'm hoping it'll be the Moose after we get done with this grind. Hoping the Moose will become a, uh, fun one to grind. It's all gonna be dependent on, uh, how enjoyable the grind really is. Does anyone know if those racks that are shown are the Great Ones racks? They are. Yeah, the- the racks that they showed off, that is gonna be the Great One racks. However, it seems like the fur types they showed off are gonna be, like, rare variations for the Great One. And it seems like most Great One Moose will be common fur type. Hey, little three. <laughs> what? What? Okay. Good to know. Good to know that's a thing. Okay, Hunter, stay out of the way, buddy. We- we are smoking moose here. Not hunters. Okay, we got it. <laughs> well, that was a whole mess. That was a whole mess and a half, man. Are the moose zones in the same spots? Uh, they should be. If you're talking about on maps like Medved, yeah, it should be the same. Yeah, I don't know what went on there, guys. That was weird. That was clearly a headshot. And it, it looked like it just went over top of him. It's exactly what it looks like, Jackson. All the fur types they showed off are rares, not commons, for the great one. You got stuck in the ice and it sent you across the map. Oh my. Yeah, that sounds like Medved. Medved's always had issues with the ice. That won't matter, FW. Zeroing for 150 at 100 isn't gonna make it go like four inches over its head. There's issues with the hitboxes. It definitely will, Tyler. It definitely will. I think I'll be able to get past it, but it is going to be tough. Yeah, we didn't hit it until those last couple shots. Crazy. All right, let's uh, check around this backside first. Because there is a little bit of places that they could possibly be. Uh, yeah, you can get a diamond level 4 moose. It is a thing. 
It's about to be the end of their uh, drink time. Let's real quickly go back here. Got to reset the time. Thank you, Thomas. Really appreciate it, dude. Um, no. Grinds don't ruin the zones if you use tripods, uh, drama. It's all about using the tripods, and then, then your grind will be fine. Grinds will not, uh, ruin your zones if you, uh, use your tripods. Let's head this way, actually. Let's check around this area. Uh, thank you, FW. You really appreciate the super chat, dude. Thank you so much. Good luck with the great one. Hopefully we get him, man. Hopefully we get him pretty quickly. What gun am I using? I am using the 300 Magnum. Uh, no, Writing Society, they didn't. Um... On PC, it's, it's defaulted to our uh, fiercest soap. I don't know what it is on console. No clue. Uh, TDK, thank you for the super chat, dude. How am I doing today? I'm doing good. A little bit disappointed with some of the stuff that's happening with the update, but... Other than that, I'm doing good. Just happy to be grinding the moose. Yeah, exactly, Johnny. I, that's why I'm not going to use something like the 470. Definitely would not work good. That limited range is what kills it. Will the 308 kill a moose? Yes, but not very fast. Uh, no worries, Wanda. No worries. Uh, because a, a population reset doesn't completely remove all your zones, Expensive Star. If you still have Moose at that zone after the reset, then those zones will stay. The only thing that completely removes the zones is a redistribution, and they did not do a redistribution to uh, the existing maps for Moose. Uh, that's for members, uh, Preston. It's essentially just a, a way to support the channel while also getting access to some cool emotes, a green name and chat, the uh, badge next to the name, and some other stuff. It's 99 cents a month. Opinions on the new update? Well, my opinions on it were super, ri like, really, really good. And, uh, we found a few issues, unfortunately, that have kind of drug it down a bit. I still really like this update, but unfortunately there's some problems, mainly with- oh, that's a five moose zone. Mainly with zones just disappearing, some people's populations have randomly reset. There's a few issues. Opinions on the map in general. If you're talking about New England, I think it's going to be a very fun map to play casually. It's also going to be a very fun map for small game and birds. It's going to be great for multiplayer hunting. Uh, but it's not going to be a good grinding map. It's definitely better than Mississippi. I can tell you that, CTK. It's way better than Mississippi. That is for sure. Okay, so we're gonna have to remember this zone. This has five moose in it. I do need to go back and check that at some point. Uh, Vexital, thank you so much for the super chat. Why choose Tiger for the grind? Because it's gonna be the easiest map to grind for them. It's gonna be way easier. Um, Rev on Thule and New England have just too many places that the moose can be. 
Uh, Layton's too brushy. Medved is super wide open. The moose are gonna always be like out on the ice for most of the areas that you go to. And not to mention you don't have to walk around lakes. You can just walk straight across them here. And from what I've seen, I've always just had better, um, like larger amounts of moose in smaller areas on Medved. There's geese on Yukon. There is now. They just added them. Uh, yeah, Parker, it is possible. Uh, they did increase the spook range, uh, sweetness. They did. They made it so the spook range after shooting is like 300 meters. Yep, that's what I've always been uh, curious about too, CP. Like, um, it, it's it's so mind blowing that they did 150 zones on New England for moose. Like, 150 drink zones is too much. It honestly would take a very long time. I mean, I buy was grinding the entire the entire uh, early access weekend and did not get his population that far with moose on that map. So I'm not, uh, definitely not going to be doing that grind. That's why we're on Medved instead. Much more tolerable of a grind. Is that a lurking Caitlyn I see? Hey, that there's glare on the scope when zooming and facing away from the sun. Yeah, it's uh, it's unfortunate. What are my top five maps? Um, let's see. Number one would be Tiabaroa, then Revontuli, Silver Ridge Peaks. I don't know what would be next. Probably Verhonga. And I'd say number five? Maybe New England, to be honest. I think New England would be number five. Uh, nothing, Duncan. They didn't add anything to Silver Ridge Peaks. What do I think about the change on Red Deer Zones of Tiawaroa? I haven't got to look at it myself, so I don't know what's, all, what's going on with mine, but I've heard a lot of people say they got moved. If that's the case, I don't think that's intended. That's got to be a bug. Nice, Jenkins. Uh, Vexital, thank you so much for becoming a member. Really appreciate it. Hope you enjoy all of the member perks that come with that, including the uh, emotes, access to private Discord channels, and access to some extra content on the channel. Really appreciate it. Maybe Ghost. We'll we'll try to remember to do that. Okay, seems like thankfully there's not any moose zones along the back side here. Was hoping there wouldn't be. I don't know, Greens, I noticed that too. I had a bullet go right over top of a moose's head. It was strange. Definitely feels like there's some issues with either accuracy or hit registration or something. Hard to say. The unfortunate thing is like a lot of the times these types of issues don't pop up until the servers go live. Like until they push the game out to the full release. Like I didn't have nearly as many issues in early access when we were playing. Given I didn't really hunt anything besides New England. But still. Atlas, thank you so much for the uh, membership. Really appreciate it. 
Welcome to the Scare Crew. Enjoy all the perks that come with that, including the emotes, uh, Discord channels, and extra content on the channel. You think New England is worth it? Um, if you want to hunt in a beautiful map that has literally every animal at every inch of the map, then it's a great one. It's a great map to hunt if you want to do multiplayer hopping. It's a, a great map to just kind of, you know, relax and smoke some big males. Not a great grinding map for like great ones, but other than that, it's a good map. Uh, Sweetness, thank you so much for becoming a member as well. My gosh, so many new members today. Enjoy all the perks that come with that, including the emotes, Discord channels, and extra content. Is there a great one, wild boar? No, there is not. Right now, it's just a moose, red deer, white tail, and black bear. Yes, you will need the map to get the new muzzle odor. Nobody knows, Bray. Nobody knows. Oh, yep, that's that sounds pretty uh, typical, uh, Nick. That is uh, one of the reasons that I stopped being a, a part of the classic community. If I'm being honest, one of the reasons I stopped playing classic was because of those like classic elitists that criticize everybody's trophy shots all the time. We had to crack down on that pretty hard in the Discord because I swear like every time somebody would post a trophy shot in the classic trophy shots, there'd always be like five or six people that would just like lay into them for having bad angles. We had to crack down on that pretty hard. Blows my mind how some people be, can be so negative over a trophy picture. No, I did, Keegan. I did customize them. Yeah, it'll go down. Have I run across any wolves today? Uh, once, but it wasn't during moose time. It was before we switched the time we found a few. Hey, Kobe, how's it going? Oh, definitely hollow. Made me not want to be a part of the Hunter Classic anymore. Too much of the community is too uh, toxic and elitist. They feel like they're better than everybody else. Always blew my mind. Ah, uh, looks like it should be fine now, guys. I think it was just a brief drop. Hey, we're gonna need to move this, uh, tent. Doing good, Kobe. Doing good. Vexital, thank you so much for the super chat. Let me catch up with that. What map do I recommend for Whitetail? Either Leighton Lakes or Revon Tuli. Leighton Lakes and Revon Tuli are uh, pretty good. Uh, the lag's not on my end this time, guys. I have not dropped at all. It's YouTube. Uh, not super often, Atlas, but whenever I have a video that didn't make it into a full release, I will put it up for members. That's uh, typically how I do it. Uh, no, nice man. Everything's fine on my end.
Uh, not sure Jackson have not seen anything, but doesn't mean that there hasn't been one. Uh, play on whatever resolution your monitor is, uh, Travis. So, like, if you have a 1080p monitor, play on 1080p. If you have a 1440p mon monitor, play on 1440p. That'll give you the best-looking picture quality. What's wrong about Rancho Whitetail Grinding? It's just not as good as uh, Layton and Revon Tuli. Nothing wrong with it. It's just not quite as easy to do. Due to a lot of the areas being super brushy and super mountainous. Like a lot of the lakes are super hilly and hard to maneuver around on Rancho. Yep, YouTube doing YouTube things. Pretty much. There is no turkey great one, no. Um, that's always been a thing, Egg. It just means that something is uh, making it so that tent can no longer be there. Typically, it's changes in the terrain or placing a tent on, like, really rough terrain. Got you, Travis. Okay, I'd say that your, your system's probably not powerful enough to run at that high of a uh, resolution. At that point, just do the highest res resolution that you can do without it lagging a ton. If you have to, maybe lower graphics settings. Got your first great one, Red Deer, on my stream yesterday. Nice, Jutsu, that's awesome. Is stacking great ones a good strategy? I mean, I don't know if it does anything. From my experience, I don't think it does. I stacked uh, four great one whitetail. Before the update, and I never noticed like any increased spawns when it came to like more great ones. Seemed the same as when I had no great ones on the map. What kind of a question is that, Dusky? 800, 600, do you have graphics on Lois? The SPC is ancient. That's probably why, man. Pairing a monitor like that with a really old PC is, um, not exactly ideal. That's, that's not ideal. What's new on Medved? Uh, Wolves and Capricali. Wait, it is? It's the same button for spotting and for placing a waypoint on console? That seems strange. For me, it's different. I press R to place a waypoint and I press E to spot. Seen any wolves? Yeah, we saw a few. Nothing too crazy, but we did see a couple of them. It's different for you. I mean, I suppose it's possible that some people had reset their e binds, and that's why it seems like it's the same. That could be it. That's a group of five moose. Good looking group. Brady, thank you so much for the super sticker. Really appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much. And Rex, welcome back to the channel, dude. I do recognize your name. I do remember seeing you in here a couple years ago. Appreciate you coming back, man. I think we got the second one, maybe. It's definitely hit. I don't know if it's vitally, though. We're gonna hope. What's the new gunshot spooking range? It's about 300 meters. 
You suck at hunting? I mean, the 20 great ones says something else. Trying to get a moose aggressive? Dude, it's so fun when they go aggressive. It is so fun when they go aggressive. I think I've had three of them during early access and every single time it was amazing. Brady, thank you for another super chat, dude. Much appreciated. You absolute legend. Thank you so much, man. Oh, that was not a good shot. Uh, yeah, one of the mods could do the, uh, the join command. Level three. Okay, good to see that this area still has a, a decent amount of moose herds around it. To be honest, I have no idea which zones I'm going to make my main ones. Those are both males. We got to try and get both of them down. About 327. I don't know if... Okay, it did. Sometimes they don't do a flinching animation. Um, I don't know. Shot my very first diamond moose yesterday. Nice, Blake. That's awesome. Congrats, dude. Four there. Okay, we're going to have to get in the stand for this one. Don't want to delete that zone. If you get the great one, you try to get it aggressive. I might. Yeah. I do think that would be pretty cool. Beautiful. Well, it looks like this spot will still be pretty relevant. This is still going to be a decent place to have the tent, it seems. Might need to pull it back a little bit, though. Got trolled by a moose today? Ooh, that's not good, man. Sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear that, my dude. Uh, yeah, I'm using the 300 Magnum. A lot of people have been telling me that it did, Lucas, but it wasn't supposed to, so... It's a bit concerning. I'm hoping that that's not really the case. I'm hoping it didn't happen to everybody. But it seems like a lot of people have, at the very minimum, had their zones move around, which is not good. Not good, because that was not supposed to happen. Uh, the 470 Nitro is already in the game, Rico. 470 Nitro is part of the Verhonga DLC. What gun is the best in my opinion? Uh, the 308. It's semi-automatic. It's insanely good for class 4 animals. It can do decent on stuff like moose. And it's got very low recoil for a semi-automatic and still very good power. So I do think that it is, uh, probably the best. At least one of the best. Yeah, Rax, it's been crazy, dude. Channel has had a quite an increase in the last two years. That's for sure. Thanks to all of you amazing people that watch the channel. And not thank you guys enough for uh, letting me do what I do. Uh, yes, Pyre. Uh, it it's going to be the same for... Uh, all platforms. All platforms got the same update. Let's move drink time. 12 to 16. Solo female. Now it is possible for them to be over here. Oh, same specter. I'm going to have to move so much around with my white tail and red deer. Like the, the new spook range is really going to throw us for a loop. A lot of the stuff with my herd management on white tail is going to need to be changed. 
Because I've got a lot of, uh, a lot of zones that are close together. Um, I think only like two, Mr. Napalm, but I haven't been, uh, I haven't been grinding moose super heavily. This is going to be the first, like, real moose grind I've ever done. Because until they had a great one, moose were not, like, one of my top species to hunt. That's a good four. Uh, there shouldn't be, Charles. It should be good. Is there a 308 rifle yet? Yes, there is. There is a 308 now. It's a part of the Modern Rifles DLC. The Modern Rifle Weapon Pack. Come on. Get his attention. There we go. Check the distance. 319. Hoping that he'll turn to face me. Good enough. <laughs> Man, I love the animations for them uh, dying like that. Um, I haven't gone to Yukon Rax. I have not touched Yukon at all. I just went straight to Medved for the moose. Uh, yeah, I know, Evan. Is the new gun good for moose? Um, it's, it's okay for them. It's a little bit underpowered for a moose, but it still works okay on them. I mean, it's a muzzle loader, so I don't really expect, like, super insane performance. But it's fun. Uh, yeah, Jackson, it did. They didn't switch around zones. Like, they didn't switch around the, uh, home range of the animal, but they did, uh, they did reset the populations for all moose. Later, Rex. Oh, never mind. You're probably saying bye to TTK. Later, TTK. Thank you for dropping by, dude. Hope you're doing well. Hope everything goes good for you for the rest of the day. Uh, no, Jackson, we just started, and, uh, thank you for the super chat, dude. No level fives on the map yet, though. Pretty much just getting started in the grind. What gun am I using? 300 Magnum. 300 Magnum is definitely the best for Moose. Okay, they are tucked away in here. Which ammo for the 300? Polymer tips. Polymer tips are typically the best in all situations. Uh, well, Petey, thank you so much for the super chat. Happy holidays to my favorite Call of the Wild YouTuber. Thank you, dude. Thank you so much. And happy holidays to you as well. Thank you so much. Two female moose. There honestly might not be a ton along this uh, shoreline, which is not, not too bad. Kind of happy about that, to be honest. Average amount of kills to get a great one? It varies quite a bit of Exidal. It can literally happen at any time. Most people, it tends to take at least 2,000 kills, though. Um, thank you for the super chat, though. What scope do I use? I use the Argus scope. Yeah, definitely TDV. Definitely. Uh, 
Uh, probably not, Vinok. Uh, today's mainly gonna be just figuring out where all my zones are. And kind of blasting them as we go. Oh no, Lucas, that's not good. I've heard some people say that they just moved around. I've heard some people say they have the exact same red deer population, they just moved to different zones, so... Keep an eye out for that, it might still be there. It might be that they just moved around. New zone, okay. Gosh, we are finding a ton of moose zones. Yeah, apparently they did, Landon. I didn't even notice it until some people pointed it out. What map should you do the grind on? Uh, whichever map that you enjoy the most that has moose. I definitely recommend Medved or Layton, though. They're pretty good. Hey, CG, how's it going? Shush. Don't you murr at me. Do I collect any sports cards? Uh, yeah, I do. I collect uh, football cards. Another moose. And another zone. Got him. Uh, yeah, Rex, I do. I play with uh, Casey quite often. He's a good friend of mine. What do you mean by all the fur types are rare? So, it turns out that every single one of those special furs for the moose, great one, are rare fur types. So, yeah. Pretty unfortunate. Hey, Deer Killer, how's it going, dude? Yeah, the new moose uh, animations and like the aggressive, the aggressiveness of them is crazy. Nice, sweetness, nice. That is awesome, man. Uh, they do spook faster, uh, Rihanna, they do. They spook a lot quicker. The spook range is farther. They changed quite a bit about it. They didn't really mention any of that either. We just kind of had to discover it for ourselves. Like, there was honestly so many unmentioned changes. Yeah, that's a two. He gets to stay. How to get the 300 Magnum? The 300 Magnum comes with Yukon. Thank you, Vinok. Really appreciate it, dude. Uh, yes, exactly, TDV. It's gonna be one of the common ones, most likely. They didn't clarify how rare the uh, fur types will be. But, uh, from what I understand, the most that they said on the stream was... Most of the time, it'll be a common fur type that you'll get. I think the way Jaxi worded it on the live stream was there will be more commons than the other fur types. Uh, yes, Rex, that's what the green name is. It's uh, to help the members stand out a bit more. Best animal to hunt for beginners? Well, if you're hunting on Leighton Lakes, which I'm assuming most people do start with Leighton Lakes because it's one of the base game maps. I'd say Whitetail are a pretty good place to start. They're relatively easy to kill. There's a lot of them. And uh, 
They don't spook as easy as some other animals because they only go to level three as their max level. Uh, Micah, thank you for the super chat. Love the game, but they did console dirty this time. I, to be honest, I'm not sure how big of a difference there's been between console and PC. I know both platforms have a lot of issues that popped up that were not apparent during early access, so... I'm curious to see, like, all of the issues that have popped up between the two. Yeah, I don't know, Drew. I like a couple of the racks, but... Not gonna lie, if I get the, um, if I get the quad paddle rack on a common, I'm gonna be pretty disappointed. I do not like the quad paddle rack, and if I get it without a special fur type, I'm gonna be so sad. We'll see how it goes, though. We will see how it goes. Traveling? Gotta be near a zone. Uh, yeah, Travis, I know that. Is there any particular reason you don't grind Yukon for moose? Uh, it's just too much water to check, man. The river is super massive, and the moose can be on both sides. Uh, the river is uncrossable in many locations, so if you see a moose across the river and shoot it, you gotta go to the other side of the river to get it, obviously, and yeah, there's not really many places to cross, so that would mean fast traveling. It would just be hard to keep up with everything, not to mention the lakes are super big on Yukon, so you have to walk around the entire lake just to get to all of the zones around it. Whereas on Medved, it's a lot of shorelines, there's ice that you can walk across instead of having to uh, walk around a lake. And there's really only one or two big lakes. This one right here, and then this little uh, part of the shoreline that looks kind of like a lake. So overall, it'll just be a little more manageable on uh, Medved. Nothing wrong with doing a moose grind on Yukon, though. It's still a good map for it. It's all about what map you're uh, best on, right? Yeah, I don't like the I don't like the uh, quad paddle. I don't at all. Can't stand that rack at all. I don't know. It just doesn't look natural to me. It looks so weird. Ooh, that's a that's a good zone. Okay, so I might have to move one of my tents. This is actually a really awesome area. There's two herds in one zone. Or possibly a herd and then a couple solos. Hunter! I'm shooting here! Gosh, that crazy dog. Oh yeah, Rex. I yep. There's been a few people that have said that over the years. I never understood it though. I never understood how I get confused for Flinter so often. Yeah, Dylan. I know it can happen. I just don't like the way it looks. That, that's really all it comes down to. I just don't like the way it looks. Hey, Mel. How's it going? How's it going, Mel? Hope you're doing amazing today. This Medved Moose grind is honestly. Pretty nice so far. What map are you going to do your grind on? I'm liking Medved quite a bit so far. But yeah, as I was saying earlier, I think in order to... In order to make the common fur variation not disappoint me whenever we get it, I better get one of the non-typical racks. That is all I'm going to say. Like, that is... Those are the racks that I care about. I want one of the non-typical racks. So we just search this entire coastline. We search the entire river. We'll probably go through there again at some point. Uh, we do need to go through this part though. But we're almost done checking the river. Then we can hit up all of the lakes and then we'll probably recheck all of the river. How big was the biggest animal? size I shot? Well, every animal's got different, like, scores, right? So, it's kind of hard to, like, measure that. I'd say that if we're talking just in general, 
Do we actually need to check this real quick? If we're just talking in general, probably my one of my big rack great one whitetail. Yo, Medved, nice smell. Medved seems like it's very good. I'm curious uh, how the grind's gonna be on other maps. I know Yukon's got a lot of ground to cover, and New England just has an absurd amount of zones. Really curious what everybody's gonna choose for their gr moose grinding map. That's a three. Oh, two twos, beautiful. Now I don't have to worry about those. You see, this is why we check some areas twice. <laughs> update was a bit slow to download. Sounds about right, Osgard. The updates are usually pretty big for Call of the Wild. Okay, so there's that zone. That's got a two in it. We can just boop this three real quick. Oh, didn't get the heart that time. That's gonna be the toughest thing about the moose if you miss the heart, they're gone. What's the species on New England? Oh gosh, um. Let me see if I can remember. Um, actually, I sent a uh, Brobra message with all of the species last night, so let me just go grab that. Let, let me just copy paste real quick. Okay, so these are all of the species for the new map. Just put it in chat. That is all of the species on the new map. Thank you, Alco. I'm glad you like it. Customized to 6.5 yet? I did in early access, but not since the release. And uh, the 6.5 looks good with a lot of them. It looks really good. So far, I've just customized the 300 and 308 and the stuff like that with uh, the full release. Uh, yes, TDV, it will have raccoon. Same as Mississippi. Which is pretty cool, because I didn't like hunting them on Mississippi that much. So the fact that they're going to be on another map is cool. Um, you can start at any time, Colby. It doesn't matter when you start. One thing to note, though, is typically people have between 60 and 75 whitetail drink zones on Leighton Lakes. So just keep that in mind. Okay, this one did not, uh, did not die. Okay, honestly, let's check some of the other spots. I want to check this little lake. Or no, we still need to check this. That's right. Let's check that first. Hey, Ebron, how's it going? I heard there was a lot of issues with the red deer. It really is, Metal Mayhem. It really is. Uh, Jameson, I believe you can rebind your key. If I'm not mistaken, I believe you can change your uh, key binds, or I guess button binds. If I'm not mistaken, I believe you can. Because they're not the same for me, and I've heard other people on console say that it's not the same for them, so... How do you do herd management with moose? You just shoot threes and above. Leave the twos, leave the ones. Um, if you're stacking, obviously leave the fives. All right, down he goes. You can't? Huh. I thought for sure you could. Nice, Ben. That's really good to hear.
What level moves do I keep on the map? I'm going to be keeping twos and ones and then level fives as well because I'm going to stack the fives to push the twos. You have to buy the new map for the guns? Uh, yeah, there's only one new gun with the new map though. It's a muzzle loader. You can change your binds. Okay, so at least PlayStation 4 can. Xbox can't? Wow. That's that's wild. Why does Xbox always get the short end of the stick with Call of the Wild? I've noticed it's always Xbox that's missing features like multiplayer, server browser, um, e-binds, like things like that. It's like, why is it always Xbox? It's got to be some limitations with Microsoft. It's got to be. Pens track level two white tail. It's the level twos that look like the level ones, TTV. Do I hunt in real life? Uh, yeah, but I haven't in like six years. It's been a while since I've been able to. You're on PS5 and you can't? I mean, you should be able to if if uh, PS4 is able to. I wonder if in many cases, maybe it just doesn't look like you can change the keybinds and maybe there's a way to. It might just be very convoluted. What happened to the bear grind? Uh, we stopped it when they kind of ruined the bear grind. Yeah, me too, YK. Me too. I don't know, Logan. I'm, I'm seeing people saying that PlayStation 4 can change the keybinds. So either they're lying or there's a way to do it. Uh, not really, Rax, because if I play with one person, I'm going to have uh, hundreds of people asking me to play with them. If I'm in multiplayer, though, and, and you happen to get into the same server, feel free to stay in it, you know? But unfortunately, I can't play with individual people or else there'd be a ton of people fighting over who would play with me. Nice, Lucas. Okay, that's good. So it does look like they didn't reset the red deer populations. Some of them just moved around. Um, my white tail are fine, Clay. I already checked them in early access. They were all fine. Looked exactly the same as before. There's some moose here. Little level two. I do, Jonas. I just haven't been able to in about uh, six years or so due to time constraints and for the longest time, financial reasons as well. I just couldn't do it. Nowadays, I, I just don't have the time to go out and hunt. All my time goes towards the channel and... Uh, my daughter. That's pretty much uh, all I have time for. Maybe once Aaliyah gets a little bit older, then I'll be able to do some more hunting, but until then, it's probably not going to happen. Got a piebald whitetail. Nice, Jen. That's awesome. Yeah, Colton, they did. They increased the spook distance to about 300 meters. Uh, yeah, Brayden, I did. I have got that animation before. Yes, no, I've got a one and a half year old daughter. You didn't miss too much, uh, Gina. Is Tiabaroa getting an animal? Yes, Mallard Duck. 
It is getting the mallard duck. How many hours do I have on Call of the Wild? 4,600. I mean, it's my job, Vinok. So, no, no, she doesn't mind. It's my job. It's the same as if I was working like a 9 to 5, except I get to do it from home and I get to do what I love. And that's all because of you guys. If it weren't for all of you that support me, I wouldn't be able to do it full time. You guys are the reason that I'm able to do it. I'm good, Aiden. I'm doing good. Don't know if I'm going to chase after that moose. Don't feel like uh, tracking it down. Yeah, Rax, we've been going hard with the whitetail grind. Uh, it's just me, Dusky. Right now, it's just me. Did Yukon get an animal? Yes, it did, Caden. It got a, uh, it got um Canada goose. The Canadian geese are on beautiful Yukon. Okay, thankfully I don't see a lot of zones through here, which I'm very happy about. I didn't want to have zones here. The Canadians Air Force. <laughs> yes, the Canada geese are here to strike you down. Level two. Okay, I guess some were just late. I haven't even seen wolves yet besides uh, before I switched the time, Deer Killer. I've been kind of surprised there hasn't been more. That's a big level four. Thank you, Monster Hunting. Glad that you enjoy them. Is it just the two here? Yeah. Just the two. Then we got these ones right here. Double solo moose. Uh, yeah. Hirschfelden did get a new animal. It's the ringneck pheasant. I right, later, Vinok. Later, Rax. Hey, Kinsko, how's it going, man? You got your uh, moose grind underway yet? Yeah, there's some more moose. Okay, so I spoke too soon. There is zones here. But they're super close to the outpost. That's amazing. That is super nice. Luckily, these are right next to the outpost. We're gonna hope I hit it. I don't even know if I did. Uh, cause the new map's not good for moose parks. They're way too spread out. There's too many zones. Uh, when I only have a single male moose, I shoot at Kinsko. The only ones I don't shoot are the single zones that are level twos and below. But if I get a single zone that's like a, a three or a four or a five, I get rid of it as quick as possible. My goal is to turn all of the level two zones, or all of the single zones into level two so I don't have to hunt them anymore. That's typically like one of my main goals is to get those solo zones to be ones I never have to go to again. The quicker I can ride off the solo zones, the smoother the grind's gonna go because there will be less, uh, less unpredictability. Hope you have some good luck, Lager. Hope you have good luck, man. I believe in you. You got this. It's a tough grind, but you got this. Nice pulling. That's awesome. How do you get the 300? It is from the Yukon DLC.
Uh, field of view, you would be able to change right in, I believe, video. Yeah, right in the video settings for me. Right there. That's got to be that level two. Three more minutes till you can play. You're almost there, Colby. You're almost there, man. Almost there to play the update. There he is, Travis. <laughs> the moose wanted to go camping one last time before I smoked him. Didn't work out for him, though. Any diamonds so far? Nothing yet, man. Nothing yet. Hoping that we can find a couple before the end of the day, though. It's almost the end of their drink time, but thankfully we're about at the end of this little river right here. Yeah, it takes a bit to get used to TTV. I think the claim screen is going to be better in the long run, though, because of the new inspect feature. I definitely think they should improve the lighting, though. The lighting's a bit odd. Some animals look super, like, dark in the, uh, in the claim screen. How many moose have I shot that are diamonds? Over, like, all of my time playing the game, probably 10 or 15, but... None since the grind started. Okay, I'd say there's not going to be any zones over here. Let's uh, real quickly change the time if we can. Do we have any more river or coastline to check? I don't think we do. We walked around all of the coast and river. At some point, we'll need to go up the river like this once again, but I think we'll start checking some of the little lakes. Yeah, maybe, Travis, maybe. I'll have to uh, mess around with it more. All right, guys, I'm going to grab some water real quickly. I just finished off my water, so... Be right back in less than two minutes, I'd say. Hope you guys enjoyed this close, in-depth look at the bed in this tent. So I'm curious how many times I'm going to have to run around here. How long am I going to have to check all of these little, uh, these little lakes? We're going to have to bounce between all of them. Spook range might become an issue. We'll have to see. What map is this? This is Medved Taiga. Nice, big buck down. Uh, biggest gun in the game is the 470.
Hey, bird is bird. I'm doing good. Doing very well. Just smoking some moose. Quite a while, Hunter22. We're going to be live for pretty much all day. Gotta make a pretty significant push for that moose great one. Bandles, thank you for the nine months. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much, dude. Welcome back. Best gun in the game? Uh, well, it depends on what you're hunting. I mean, the 308's pretty good. The 300 Magnum's really good. Uh, yes, sir, but from what we understand, it seems that is the case. Dade Everett, thank you so much for the super chat. Really appreciate it. Love your content very much. Thank you, dude. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much for the super chat. And oh my gosh, Grady. Thank you for the super chat as well, dude. Holy. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. These lakes might be a problem. Like, we might have to check all of these multiple times. Because I know for a fact we probably have moose at all of them. Uh, no, Carson. I haven't heard anything like that. That's weird if it did. What time is moose drinking? 12 to 16. Brady, thank you for another super sticker, dude. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Hey, Justin, how's it going, man? Welcome, welcome. Uh, New England Mountains is based on like five or six states, actually. It's just based off of the New England Mountains area or like the New England area. Uh, for those of you that didn't know, New England is a collection of states. I believe it's Maine, New Hampshire, Rhode Island, and a couple others that are around that area. And so it's not one state in particular. Holy sled junkie, how's it going, dude? Hope you're doing great. Hope you've been enjoying uh, the update and everything that has to do with it. Thank you for the super chat. Sends blue super chat. That is the bluest super chat you could possibly get. It's a blue super chat with a blue name and a blue wrench. Amazing. Thank you so much, Sled. Hope you're doing great. Man, these moose are just non-existent, though. They are very, very hidden on these lakes. Um, unfortunately, no X, uh, XKC. It's not going to be good for grinding uh, moose or whitetail from what I've seen. It might be okay for whitetail actually, but moose it's definitely not good for. They're just way too spread out on New England. The map is really good for like all the small game though. It's going to be a great multiplayer map, I can tell you that. Very like multiplayer hopping style of map because like all of the drink zones are loaded with animals. That's kind of why it's not good for grinding, though, because there's just too many locations you have to check. But in multiplayer, it's going to be great. Pretty much anywhere you go, there's going to be something. Uh, yeah, Zachary, the ones for, um, all of the zones for Moose got reset. Same as Mountain Lions and Mouflon. Oh, they are hype. They they increase the spook range of gunshots. So they do spook easier now. Well, that's not good, Aiden. I'm sorry to hear that, man. Glad nobody was hurt. Really, Justin? I've heard a few people saying that there's issues with that. Maybe it's like a, a problem with searching. Hard to say. 
There was a fair bit of bugs that showed up that we weren't aware of. Oh no, Sled. Sorry to hear that, dude. Unfortunate, but you know it is what it is. At least you got that uh, great one moose to chase after now. You're gonna be eating good once you get that great one moose, you know. <laughs> yeah, this is a quite unfortunate lack of moose at these lakes. I don't know if they're late or if they're just not here. It's about 30 minutes into their drink time. We might have to go over here again. Yes, very delicious pixels for sure. You found servers just not for the new map? I don't know why that would be. Maybe it's because it the patch is bigger on a console than it is on PC. So maybe it just took people longer to update it? I don't know, to be honest. Very strange for sure. What new map would I like to see next? I mean, my personal favorite that I would like is probably not exactly everybody else's first pick. I'd love to see a Texas game ranch. Yes, I know, another United States map, but I like it. I think it would be a really good idea because you could put a ton of exotic species on there. You could put a bunch of, like, antelope from Africa on there. You could put stuff like the Watusi cattle, the Pure David's deer. You could put the, the white stags. You could put, you know, a whole bunch of different sheep species if you wanted to. There is so much versatility to a reserve like that that they could literally put whatever they felt would be good. Which is why I've always really wanted them to do that. It's decent so far, Will. There's a few issues that showed up, but other than that, it's been fun. Nice hunting and fishing outdoors. Yeah, it's understandable, Jojo. I know the updates are massive on console. What do you think the best zone to hunt black bear in? Drinking? Uh, yes, drink zones. It would be drink zones for sure. Gonna be here for... Hold on. Gonna be here for a few because I'm on PC. Game is updating slowly. Well, hopefully it'll update as fast as it can, Nick, but I appreciate you having or I appreciate having you here. No update for you. There should be, Dakota. You should have an update. What do I mean by all fur types are rare? All of the fur types they showed up, they showed off for the Great One Moose are rares. Most people will get a common Great One Moose. So, yeah. Kind of disappointing. Not gonna lie. Kind of disappointing. Yeah, it's unfortunate, Michael. It's unfortunate. Console gets hit with some pretty large update sizes. I hope so, YK. I hope they're not incredibly hard to get. That would be pretty rough if they were. Especially with how much they hyped it up. Don't see anything here. Yeah, we've got to have some moose zones, right? Unless they're not here anymore. I don't know how common the moose are throughout this area nowadays. I mean, we had some on the river. Right as I say that, I hear one. Right as we fast travel. <laughs> of course, that'd be my luck. Oh, they are, Justin? Yeah, it's, that's weird. I remember I had seen a few, uh, few people during early access run into some freezing animals, but that's kind of always been a thing in Call of the Wild, so I didn't really think anything of it, but maybe it is more prevalent than normal. Really curious. 
10 minutes, 10 minutes till you can play. Nice, Brady. It's super close, dude. You're getting close. That's a moose. Okay. Oh, another one. Oh my gosh, they're so spastic now. And half the time they don't flinch either. Oh gosh. Just purchased the new map. Nice hammer. Nice. Uh, no, Kyle. Just specific species. Like, uh, moose. Mountain lions, mouflon. Things like that. Uh, yeah, Hype. Uh, going to the main menu will still work to kind of get them unspooked. Item wheels working for me, ball python. I haven't had any issues with the wheel. Where? Where was that from? Well, it looks like regardless, only one of them died. I think what we're going to do now is check out a couple of these lakes down here. Maybe the crater even. We might check out the crater. Uh, you can take away the dot, Rex. It's an optional crosshair. I keep it on just to give me a better idea of where the center of my screen is. But the cross area is fully customizable. Do ground blinds work to reduce hunting pressure? Yes, it does. Ground blinds, uh, tree stands, tripod stands, they all do the same thing. Wow, Clayju, that's a big one. That's huge for a four, man. The massive level four. Hey, we're not after you. Don't see any moose here. Let's head up to that one. Kill or leave the diamond four. I mean, if it's a guaranteed diamond clay draw, I'd say stack it. I'd say stack that for sure. If it's got a guaranteed chance of making diamonds. It means exactly what it says, uh, Samu. All of the fur types they showed off for the Great One Moose were confirmed to be rares. They're not going to be the common fur types. So most of the time, you won't get one of the special furs they showed off. It's unfortunate. Pretty bummed about it, to be honest. Uh, Vexital, thank you so much for the super chat. Killed your first diamond moose of the grind, 277. Nice, dude. Nice. That is awesome. How many diamonds today? None so far. But we pretty much just started, so I don't expect to find any diamonds today. Or at least not throughout the first few hours. First few hours are just going to be kind of setting up, trying to figure out where all our zones are. Then we're going to adjust our setup based off of that.
Yeah, I know, Johnny. Crazy. Hey, Night Warrior, how's it going? You did, Aiden? Man, yeah, I've heard a few people mention that Whitetail were messed up, but... I, uh... I haven't checked Whitetail on other maps. My Layton seemed fine, though. They should add a great one duck for memes. I mean, I'm sure eventually we'll get something. Something along the lines of a duck or something for them. I hope they focus on some of the other stuff first, like uh, mule deer, black tail deer, elk. There's a new white tail on your map. I don't know, maybe it did uh, mess with the white tail for some people. And they didn't look messed up for me. That's why I'm just a little confused about it. My white tail looked exactly the same. Maybe I just didn't look at them thoroughly enough. I guess that's always possible as well. Beavers would be cool, Sled. Yeah, Great One Roosevelt would be really nice. It, it would be very stunning looking. Many of my whitetail zones have been removed. My whitetail are fine. Yeah, it seems like it's mixed. It seems like not everybody had it happen. Still so unfortunate for those that did get affected by it. How long does the update take? Uh, it depends on what your internet speed is, right? Depending on what your internet speed is, it could take a different amount of time than it could for other people. Your white tail changed? Yours are good. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like it's pretty 50-50. How long did it take for mine to update? Um, I think it was like half an hour, but I did a full game reinstall. Because I found that on Steam, at least, uh, updates typically take longer than a fresh in than a fresh reinstall, so... I just uninstalled the game and reinstalled it. That seemed to work out pretty good for me. Were they supposed to change? Uh, no. They were not supposed to change anything with the uh, with the whitetail. Besides the the models, that was it. They they said there was going to be no like resets or anything. And it seems like for most people there wasn't, but then some people are seeing weird stuff going on. So I don't know what to make of it, man. Seems like it just happened to some people, and for others it didn't. Very unlucky circumstances. I don't think this lake has any moose. I don't think so, at least. No, don't think so. It didn't see any zones either. You're watching her on a bus? <laughs> nice, Waylon. When do moose drink on New England? The same time as everywhere else, 12 to 16. Your super chat didn't post? Uh, I didn't see it either, Orvis. I'm guessing it just didn't go through, man. 
Seems like it didn't go through. You know, I just realized when I went into the uh, inventory there, I had to recollapse all of the tabs every single time. It didn't save the ones that I had collapsed. Oh, that's going to drive me crazy. For me, it's the little things that drive me crazy. That's definitely going to be one of them. <laughs> Your white tail are fine, Orvis. Okay, good, good. Oh no, Aiden, that's not good, man. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like it's pretty mixed. Still no great one moose posted yet. I think it's going to be a bit before we see one, Clay Drew. The Great One Moose seems like it's going to be a hard one to grind for. Just because of, in general, how Moose act. There's so many solos that move around all the time. Hey, Donde, how's it going? Glad that yours are untouched. What do you mean all fur types are rare? Exactly what it says. All of those special fur types they showed off for the moose on the live streams are the rare variations of the Great One Moose. The normal ones are just common fur type. So it's unfortunate. Uh, the skins are in your storage locker, uh, Deer Killer. It'll be in your like inventory. You can press C over top of it. Or if you're on console, it'll tell you the button to press for that. Nice, Donde. Happy birthday, dude. It's been decent for me so far. Yeah, that's to be expected, Rax. They did a reset to Moose. Because of the Great One Moose getting added, Moose were reset. Uh, yeah, Blake. Actually, the majority of them will be commons from what I understand. I'm doing good, Kel. Doing good. Welcome to the channel, first of all. Hope you're doing great. And uh, when it comes to tips, I'd say a big one is uh, hunt around water. Hunting around water will ensure that you see a lot more animals. Because in general, it's easier to spot animals when they're in their uh, drink zones than it is in other zones. Just one moose here. That's it. <laughs> Never gets old. Uh, why, Johnny? Oh, for the for the Great One Moose because of the fur types got you. Yeah. I feel like that's going to be the sentiment from a lot of people. I'm still going to do it because, you know, I, I still want to try and get one, even if they're going to be rare. Because right now we don't know the exact odds. I'm hoping that it's like 1 in 5 or 1 in 10. That way it's still possible, like it's plausible that you could get it. But if it's like... Gosh, if it's like a, if it's like a one in 50 or a one in 100 thing, that's going to be disappointing. Hey, Cutter, I'm doing good, man. Thank you, Tina. I really appreciate it. Am I doing herd management? Yes, I am. We are doing herd management. That's another three. Man, we have found so many threes today. 
I think the majority of the moose we've found have been threes. That's a weird three. Where do we spook that guy from? Can we make this shot? Nope. I mean, it'll die. Not fast, but it'll die. Uh, maybe, Anton. We're not 100% sure, but it seems like it helps a little bit. Hard to say, though. What am I grinding on? Uh, this is Medved Taiga. Nice, dear killer. Nice. Got a melanistic gold whitetail on Rancho. Nice, Rex. Nice. I have no idea, Pioneer. Not sure. How do you use the weapon skins? Uh, go to your uh, storage locker, first of all. Then go to the stuff that you've already purchased. Hover over the gun of your choice. And uh, press the corresponding key that it tells you to at the bottom of the screen. Hey, Brayden, just grinding for that great one, Moose. Seeing if we can make it happen pretty quickly. We've already killed about 30 Moose, I'd say. Definitely going to be a slower grind than some of them, though. Where can Moose be on Medved? Um, everywhere for the most part. Moose can be at pretty much every spawn on Medved. However, there's definitely some areas that have more than others. Killed like 40 and got the great one. Nice, Sinoy. Uh, you better post that in the Discord or else nobody's going to believe you. You know, luckily, this moose ran the same direction that we're already going. On the grind for the moose on New England. Good luck on yours. Thank you, dude. Same to you. Hopefully, you get yours pretty quickly. Hoping for a semi-fast grind. Got a melanistic diamond. Nice cutter. Nice. Yeah, it definitely is uh, just... It's definitely infested with him for sure. Uh, not sure, Brett. Whenever the angler adds the new map, I'll go back to it. Kind of just waiting for more content on the angler. And a lot of times I have to have new content to stay interested in games. If there's like a long time without a major update, then I tend to lose uh, interest in playing for a bit. That's really for any game. Yes, Ghost Squid. I believe he does. It was announced on the EW stream, so pretty much everybody that was watching has heard about it. And then, of course, since... We do content. We've been told about it because of everybody else seeing it in the stream and then telling us. Yes, Caden, it seems that most of them will be commons, actually. Yep, 
Yeah, no problem, Brett. How long do I think the grind's gonna take me? I'm gonna say a week, man. I'm gonna say a week of grinding eight hours every day. That's probably... Probably what it's gonna take. Maybe sooner if we're lucky. But that's just if we're super lucky. I feel like it's gonna be a week-long grind. It's similar to how Red Deer was for me. Well then. The big four. Kinda wish I hadn't spooked him. Wait, I hear Capricallis. Where is that little Capricalli? I have yet to see the Capricalli on Medved, so I'm kind of excited to see it. Is it near? Is that it? Nope, that's a musk deer. All right, well, it's just those two threes plus the four that ran away, I guess. Hey, whoa, whoa. Not good. Oh, no. I hear wolves. No. <laughs> uh, there they are. First aggressive wolves on Yukon. Oh, no. I don't want to delete this zone. Oh no. Ah, can't get me now. Yeah, that's right. What you guys gonna do now, huh? Hey, none of them are diamonds. <laughs> really? You guys just had to come over here and ruin the party? No wonder that four was running before I could even, like, get a chance to look at it. Yeah, that's right, get out of here. <laughs> These wolves, man. That is the first encounter with wolves during the moose time, so that is good. Glad that they're not a nuisance for the most part. Honestly, though, I think that the uh, wolves really fit Medved super well. That was amazing. That's got to be one of the more cool things that's happened today. That could be cool, Rex. I'd love to see something like that at some point. Nice, Kyle. So we're definitely going to have to put a tent over in this area, I'd say. Unfortunately, I've got max tents down from when I was uh, hunting moose pre-update. So not able to do it yet. We'll uh, reorganize our tents once we know where our zones are. Nice, Clay Drew. Nice. Uh, you need to accept your roles, uh, uh, TRX. You need to accept your roles in the Discord. Hey, Tyler, how's it going, man? Welcome to the channel. Hope you're doing great. Hope you're enjoying it. Am I checking every lake? Yes, Wyatt, I will be checking every lake. I'm doing herd management, so I've got to be as thorough as I possibly can with everything. Alright, little Capricalli, I hear you down there. Random musk deer, okay. Musk deer again. Not seeing any moose in the crater yet. They're probably on the other half of it. Oh, it's the other three. We need to get this guy down.
Oh my gosh, I think the second shot was a hard shot. Uh, I'm on Medved Lavish. Do I like Rancho? Rancho's cool. Especially now that it's got pronghorns. That's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, Tyrell, I do remember you. I do remember you indeed. Welcome back, man. Welcome back. Best map to grind moose? Uh, it's gonna come down to personal preference. I like Medved best, though, Crickets. I'd say Medved, Layton, and then Revon Tuli are probably top three. A lot of people are gonna grind Yukon just because of how beautiful the map is, though. Is New England worth buying? Uh, it's gonna depend on what you want to get out of a map, right? Like, if you enjoy a lot of small game hunting, if you want to see every animal drinking at, like, every single lake during their drink time and being super spread out across the map so that there's always something to hunt, then you're gonna love the map. If you're a grinder that's looking for great ones, it's probably not the best map for that, but it's a very solid map. Definitely one of the more beautiful maps as well. What do I mean by all fur types are rare? All of the fur types that EW showed off in the live streams for the Great One Moose are rare variations. Most people are going to end up getting a common. Be honest, I don't even think we have any moose in the crater. If not, that eliminates one pretty big area. Best map for cash grind? I'd say Tiabaroa for red deer. If you hunt red deer on Tiabaroa, you will find tons of them and you will get a ton of money. Oh, there's moose. Spoke too soon. What got added to Yukon? Uh, Canadian geese. There's a couple threes. We need to boop down to ones or twos. All right, got them both. Uh, no, nothing got added to Silver Ridge. Unfortunately, they did not have enough time to do that. Which, I get it. That's a two. We can leave him. What well, time do moose drink? 12 to 16, Lucas. Um, I don't know how to explain it, TRX. It's going to be different depending on the platform you play on. I believe if you're on console, the screenshots that you take like that don't save, so... You have to use, like, the actual, like, screenshot feature on the console. If you're on PC, it should be in... It, it'll be somewhere deep in your Steam folder. It's better to look up the, uh... Better to Google it, probably. I unfortunately don't have the answers for you. The best one, thank you for the super chat, dude. Really appreciate it. Hope you are doing great. Just want to say hi, good luck on Great One Moose Grind. Thank you, dude. Really appreciate it. Hopefully we do have some decent luck. That is about... 225. Alright, we got that one at least.
Anything good? Nothing yet, Link. Nothing crazy yet. We're still pretty early into the grind, though. We'll start getting some good stuff eventually. Nice, Dan. Nice. Yukon's a pretty beautiful map. Where did this other one go? Well, looks like Hunter knows. Hunter knows the way. You know, I kind of feel like we got to re-customize our 300 to match Medved, right? Like, uh, we got to make it be a Medved looking rifle. Man, thank you for the super chat as well, man. Ryan and Whitetail and Rev on two, we lost 10 zones and the zones were all good and stacked with threes. Upset, what do I do? Okay, so from what I understand, Mint, it seems like you didn't lose the zones, they just moved. I've heard a lot of people say that they lost stuff and then they ended up searching their map and found the herds. They just moved for some reason. I don't know why they moved, but apparently you just gotta go search for them again. But thank you for the super chat again. Really appreciate it. But yeah, it seems like it's an issue of them just moving. Nobody knows why. Ah, uh, the best one. Thank you for the super chat as well, dude. What map is this? This is Medved Taiga. Love me some Medved for Moose. Hey, Ashley, how's it going? Nice, Brayden. That's awesome. Yeah, I agree, JD. I hope that they do. And for all we know, maybe they are. They haven't really elaborated too much on it. We just got like a little tidbit of information pretty much hoping they'll talk about it more in the coming weeks because I think some clarification is overdue Zach thank you for the super chat as well man really appreciate it what got added to I'm assuming you're talking about SRP uh, nothing did Unfortunately, they did not have enough time to add something new to, F to SRP, so uh, for now, Silver Ridge does not have anything new. Is it the same as like an albino great one whitetail, or is it more like an uncommon? Uh, we don't know. They didn't elaborate on it. They just said that we would see the commons more often than anything else. They did not elaborate more than that. Which is a bit unfortunate. I would have liked some more clarity. Um, I don't remember Justin, or not Justin, uh, Frizz. I think it's like towards the end of the missions. Uh, Justin, thank you for the super chat, dude. Distract a dilute muley for 1.56 miles. Oh gosh, man. That's rough. That's rough, man. Thank you for the super chat, though. Really appreciate it, dude. Really appreciate it. That's kind of a clean looking uh, skin there. That's kind of clean. We'll try that. And then uh, for the other 300. Oh, I got an idea. This might look good. You guys ready? I think this is going to look good. Oh, yes. Yes, that's beautiful. Maybe that's maybe that would be cool. I don't know. That kind of looks sick. Not going to lie. That kind of looks sick. I like that. Wow, yeah, that's awesome looking. That is a premium looking rifle. And that one right there, beautiful as well. Okay, I like that a lot. Now we are ready to take down some moose for real. Nice seven, that's awesome. 
Which one is the cream paint? Is this it right here? I didn't check. Drink time for Moose. Drink time for Moose is 12 to 16, which actually, thank you for reminding me, we need to reset the time. It's more egg colored? Got you, okay. Let's see what you were talking about. I'm assuming this one. Oh, wow. Yeah, that would look really good. Yeah, that does look pretty good. Let's try that. Wow, yeah, that's cool. That is pretty awesome. Love it. Justin, thank you for the super chat. Same rifle design hype. Oh, are you using the same one? Amazing, man. Thank you for the super chat. There's a lot of cool combinations with the customization. Got you, Zevin. Got you. Yeah, that makes sense. I think this is a good uh, combination. I like these two options. Look very nice. It really fits the Medved vibes. To try dark red on the 470 looks pretty good. I kind of figured that that might. Um, Baj by Boo, thank you so much for the 20 months. Welcome back. Hope you're doing fantastic. 20 months, that's insane. That's a long time to be a member. Uh, not really, Declan. We've just been finding zones. That's about it. How is it broken, uh, Peyton? Uh, that's on all platforms, Kyle. So, the way it works, from what I understand, is there's a free pack that they released. That is, um... I think it's like five or six skins for free. Then they have the premium one that you have to pay for. That's on all platforms. And then every reserve you own will come with a couple different uh, camos. So it's going to be dependent on what you own. Oh, it's Strats. Welcome back, Strats. I was curious. I was like, I don't recognize that name. Strats sounds uh, much more familiar. How do you tell how long you've been a member for? Um, you can do the, uh, member message. Uh, somebody else can probably tell you how to do that. Missed. We've been pretty good with the hard shots today. We unfortunately missed that one, though. Uh, Justin, thank you for the super chat again, dude. Thank you so much again. Really appreciate it. See if the dog will search for blood. Uh, it looked for it when we were in the crater. I think my dog's working fine. It's uh, it's tracked the blood every time I've told it to. Come on, can we get him to move? There we go. Once again, though, thank you for the super chat, Justin. And Brayden, thank you for the 27 months. Oh, my gosh. Dude, that is an absurd amount of time. 27 months. Gosh, dude. That's crazy. That is just unreal. 27 months. Thank you so much, man. Yeah, that's very unfortunate, Johnny. I wonder why it's doing that to you. Maybe you could try reinstalling the game and maybe that would work. 
Anything's worth a try at this point. I don't know, G-Man. We have yet to find out. Thought that on multiplayer, if someone else shoots something and you pick it up, they get the money, but they ain't on the player list on the server. I made 10k because of it. Weird. That's, that is very strange. I think if the person has left, they can't get the money anymore, but you shouldn't be getting the money either from what I understand. Like, I've claimed plenty of trophies that people just randomly left, and I never got credited for any of it, even if they had left the server. That is a little bit strange. Um, I'll, I'll test real quickly, uh, Justin, by the way, I'll show you the dog. He's working fine for me. He's tracking the blood. I'm wondering if maybe it's, uh, just a... A bug that happens occasionally, or maybe it's only for some platforms? Because I have noticed a lot of, uh, a lot of issues seem to be happening on console more than PC. From what I've seen so far, at least. Dog doesn't work for you on PC? That's so weird, Elusive. I wonder what causes it. Uh, what's the question, Chandler? Uh, it's 12 to 16, meme. 12 to 16 on all maps. Yeah, that's a three. That's a three. That's a three. Okay, this is one of the pre-existing moose zones from before the update that didn't get reset, but it's got new animals in it, obviously. Gosh, we gotta bop all three of these. This is three solo level threes in one zone. This is not gonna be easy, but we're gonna try it. Wow, we hit the heart on the second one. Okay, that guy's going down too. Nice. That actually went smoother than I expected. We got two hard shots. And then the other one we hit a few times, so he'll die quickly. And this is how you delete a zone instantly. <laughs> Three solos gone. How do you become a member? It'll be the join button next to the subscribe button, or you can join via the link in the description as well. Yeah, it's definitely strange, Matthew. Definitely strange. I'd probably just be on, you know, be cautious about it. Just leave, find a new one. There's plenty of servers around right now, so shouldn't be too hard to find another one that's good. Yeah, Zevin, unfortunately, the 470's range is pretty terrible. So I don't think it would be very viable for that. Plus, it's a two-shot rifle. I think 300 is going to be the way to go. Maybe 338 as well. Maybe 338 for the solo zones, and then 300 for the ones with multiple. I'm thinking that might be the move. Uh, yes, Dan, that is a thing that happened with this update. I noticed they spook from about 300 after you shoot. Just got the new map. Nice, Melissa. Nice. Hope you've been enjoying it. It's a pretty beautiful map. Big fan of the way it looks. Pretty big fan of the small game hunting on it as well. I had a blast hunting fox on New England. Hollow's always here, Caitlin. Just not telling us that she's here, you know? Yeah, I don't know where this, uh, where this moose went. It had to be over here somewhere, right? Apparently, I'm nowhere near it, though. Was it clear back here that we shot it? It actually might have been. Maybe I'm, uh... Maybe I'm tripping here. Speaking of tripping, a Tyler Trip. Thank you for the uh, membership, dude. Welcome to the Scarecrew. Hope you enjoy all the member perks that come with it, including the emotes, the 
private Discord channels, and extra uploads. Really appreciate it, dude. There we go. We found it finally. What should I do? Some of my red deer zones disappear that I had threes and fours in. Uh, from what I understand, Colton, they just moved. A lot of people have been telling me that they moved. What is the best map for moose along with the gun? Uh, best map seems to be Medved. Layton might be a close second. And then as far as gun, 300 Magnum's the way to go. Pretty much always for moose. Alright, let's go recheck some of these zones now. However, let's maybe... Maybe hop to this tent first. No news yet, Ebron. I'm still waiting to hear back from Archie. I'll have to send him another message soon. Um, Holocrow. Would you be able to, uh, make a couple emotes if Archie's not able to? Because, uh, we've got... Ebron gifted a massive amount of memberships. So that we would be able to get new emotes, so... It would be awesome if we could get some new, uh, like, amazing looking emotes at some point, if, uh, you're down for it. We've got some ideas of some that would be pretty cool. Come on, Moose! Go down, man! I know you're like a walking tank, but just stop tanking the bullets. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Go down. <laughs> yeah, we are going to do a, a scarecrow emote for sure. I am going to do the uh, the golden crow or the rainbow crow or whichever one you guys want. And then uh, I want to get a few others done. Uh, yeah, Hollow, I'll send you some of the ideas, uh, a little bit later. I believe there was one that Ebron wanted done, so, uh, I think Ebron could give, like, an idea of, uh, what he wants to see. Yeah, Justin. He is indeed. How long will I be streaming for? A pretty long time. We're going to be grinding a lot today. Obviously with like intermittent breaks in between. But uh, the stream's going to be going for at least a total of seven hours. We're making a hard push for this great one, Moose. As, as much grinding as we can possibly do in one day. I hear the wolves, oh no. Can I show where my zones are so far? To be honest, I haven't even been keeping track of them yet, Jackson. I'm just trying to find them all. We will count them once, we, once we've gone through the whole map a few times. And then I'll start making a map of all of them. And just rechecking every place. Uh, no clue, Raptor. I have not played the missions. I, I don't really pay attention to missions. Five forty-five to six twenty. That's a thick moose. Oh uh, no, it's spooked. Unfortunate. Well, we found its zone at least, right there. Yeah, I don't know, Atlas. Maybe they did. How many zones do I think are on Medved? I think Lady Legend had a hundred when she was doing the moose grind. But obviously that number can fluctuate based on your own individual experience.
Hey, Mr. Snack, how's it going? Thank you, Apex guy. I really appreciate that, dude. Thank you so much. There's that moose. All right, it's a big four. Best handgun? Um, 454 probably. The Glock is amazing too, though. So is the 243 handgun. Where's this moose gonna pop out at? Oh my gosh, they stop so much. Hey Ranger, how's it going, man? Welcome to the channel. Hope you're doing good. Oh, you are Matthew? Nice. What was evil, Kyle? Nice rag, that's awesome. Are the spook reactions quicker? Yes, they are, Duck. They are quicker. Hey, Steel, how's it going, man? Hey, NBS. Uh, yeah, some of them did, Parker. So, with a, um, when it comes to a, like, population reset for a specific animal, if they're not moving the, like, the home range of the animal, then some of your zones will stay. That just means that you still have them there. It is still going to be new animals, though. But you'll still have some of the same zones. It'll just be different animals in them. Two forty-two. I don't think it'll change back, Duck. I think it's here to stay. To be honest, though, it's just going to make it so between PC and console will be more in line. Since uh, it was already, like you said, it was already difficult to hit follow-up shots on console. Now it's just going to be difficult to follow follow-up shots on PC as well. I think if anything, it kind of uh, evened the playing field a little bit. That's a female zone. Oh, it's 1625. We need to reset. Why is she still there at 1625? Hey, Brian, how's it going, dude? Let's main menu real quick. Been a bit since we've done it. Tyler, thank you so much for the super chat. You're the only one I've joined. Usually I only subscribe, but your content hits different with me because I play Call of the Wild a lot. Nice, dude. That's awesome. Thank you for, uh, well, th first of all, thank you for being a member here. And uh, thank you for the super chat. Thank you for supporting the channel. That is awesome to hear. Hey, Dryton, I'm doing good. How about you? Uh, no, Yorktown. Kudu is never going to be added to Verhonga. It was a misspeak. It wasn't supposed to be on the list that he was reading. It's not a glitch, Kaylee. That's normal. It's supposed to be that way, apparently. Apparently, all of the special fur types are supposed to be rare. So it looks like most moose you see are going to be common fur variations, which is unfortunate. <laughs> yeah, Deer Slayer, exactly. Definitely are. <laughs> That's me. Love the soundboard. All right, so let's uh, take a little trip to these lakes down here. We'll just do a little roundabout all the way through. Uh, we got a couple. We got one moose zone that stayed. Oh, actually, we already checked that one. Uh, 
Uh, yes, Drop Time Gaming. So all of the uh, fur types they showed off, those are the rares from what I understand. Just shot a five. Nice, Cohen. That's awesome. What was added to Silver Ridge? Uh, nothing was, Colby. Nothing got added to Silver Ridge. Yes, Chope. In fact, all of them, for the most part, will be common. Apparently, the other fur types are rares. So, yeah, a little bit disappointing, not gonna lie. Yes, Captain, exactly. It's still exclusive to the new Great One. Yeah, Dryden, it's pretty bad that there's that many zones, like... That's why I didn't grind New England, because I buy premiums had 150 zones, and that's just so much to keep track of. Especially early in the grind, when you still have to hunt all of them. Yes, Mr. Snack, I did years ago. Oh, no, Johnny, that's unfortunate, dude. Um, from what I understand, your animals will still be there. Like, all the stuff you sacked, it should still be there. The thing is, for some reason, some of the zones just moved. So you're going to have to find them again. It's really unfortunate that they didn't tell us more about what was really happening with the update. Level three moose there. Yes, call the wild, I have. Nice, Parker. Hopefully it goes well, man. I think the whitetail might be pretty good there. Where did that bull go? Oh, they're heading over there. But why, though? Uh, that's up to you, Shaw. If you want to shoot it, then shoot it. If you want to stack it, then stack it. That is totally up to you, man. It's not a bug, Chope. It's not a bug. It's intended. No, Whitetail did not get a pop reset, guys. The Some of the zones just disappeared for some people. But the, the animals are still on the map. You just have to refine them. Yeah, it's a pretty big update, uh, Nun. Pretty big update. Great one, Red Deer would be awesome, James. It'd be super awesome. Where did that bull go? There he is. Hey, now. He's right there. I think. Well, that's a three that's going to get away for now. Uh, because the new map's not good for grinding moose, Luke. That's why. There's too many zones. They're too spread out. Not worth trying to grind on New England. It would just end up being more of a pain than anything else.
Not gonna lie. Did not think that he would come back. I thought we spooked him for good. Yeah, me too, Chope. I am as well. I'm very disappointed that we won't be seeing those cool fur types on most of our moose. I thought it was just going to be part of the moose, but it looks like it's rare, so that's unfortunate. It is what it is, though, I guess. Do it, Kobe. Do it. Hey, Bailey, how's it going? Uh, it's not been too bad. We've just been uh, trying to get all of the uh, zones and smoking all these threes and fours. Uh, the racks are different, Oski. I already answered you, DRK. If you're going to ask a question, learn to listen to the answer. Going to help you out quite a bit. There's another three. So we got two threes here. Lots of solo moose, man. Whoa. Didn't realize there was some that close. Gotta love that new spook range as well. Eh, he'll die eventually. Greenwing Teal are on uh, the new map as well as Mississippi, uh, Aiden. Are they ever going to do loadouts? Maybe. We'll have to see. I hope they do. As loadouts would be very helpful. Uh, go to your weapon locker, Commander Zack. Where's the New England map uh, based on? It's based on the New England area of the United States. So it's essentially a collection of states on the East Coast. Uh, Maine, New Hampshire, Rhode Island, and a couple others as well. All of those states uh, combined make up New England. Definitely, Bailey. I love them. The, the new moose animations do look pretty good. Yeah, I hope they do improve animations on other animals in the future as well. There is some wonkiness when it comes to like some of the hit registration with the moose now though. So that's a little bit of a problem, but I'm imagining they'll get that worked out at some point. So far, mountain lion free bear time. That is great to hear, Caitlin. That is great to hear. Capper Cali track, okay. Little Lynx. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Not again. Not again. Aggressive Wolves. What are they doing? <laughs> what are these wolves doing? They're just looking straight to the sky. What are you all doing? Like... <laughs> Holy. These are some interesting wolves, I'll tell you. <laughs> 
now they're launching at me. Oh my. I mean. Now that's a screenshot for thumbnails right there. Amazing. Oh, that's even better. Beautiful. <laughs> that was something else, man. I don't know what to, I don't know what to, uh... We got some interesting wolves here. Some very, very interesting wolves. Basically decimated that whole pack. <laughs> we didn't delete the zones, though. We were far enough off of them. That's good. <laughs> uh, definitely, Bailey. I, I'd say so. Probably will be. <laughs> yeah, YouTube lag a little bit, uh, Caitlin. It seems like that. YouTube's been weird today. Like, I'm not getting any dropped frames in OBS or in uh, Streamlabs, so. I mean, I think you're being a little dramatic, Dan. I don't think they ruined the game. There's definitely a lot of issues, but... I wouldn't say they ruined the game. I'm still having fun. Definitely a lot of major problems though. What do we got here? No moose so far. Guess we'll see what these zones are. I don't. Oh, uh, yep, we got one. Okay, good to know. Viper, thank you so much for the super chat. Just got done processing the dough that you killed today. Nice, nice, man. That's awesome. Congrats on the dough. Uh, yeah, Ebron, for sure. We can do one of those. Uh, just explain, like, what you wanted it to look like again. I'm... It wasn't it like a, um... Like, hit markers all around, like, a, a deer or something? Or, like, hit markers around the word whiff? I think that's what it was. I can't remember for sure. Once again, though, uh, Viper, thank you for the super chat. I don't know, Lucas. I'm my money's on iBuy. I think the only thing that gives me a chance of getting the first one is that I'm on Medved instead of uh, New England. iBuy chose New England to grind because it's the new map, and well, that map is—it's tough to find all your zones. So, I think that's going to be the saving grace for me is the fact that I'm on a slightly easier map to hunt. We'll see, though. We'll see who will get the first one. Regardless of when we get ours, though, I'm just going to be happy to have one. Reloading might help. That that might be very, very helpful. Oh, he stopped. Oh, there's another. Well, one or two of those should go down. Uh, the gun I'm using, Kelm, is the uh, 300 Magnum. It's from the Yukon DLC. There's another bull. I think that one died. We should be good. Yeah. Three dead moose.
Yeah, they're interesting with the way they run now, Ben. That's for sure. Yeah, definitely, Kyle, it is. Oh no, Crayfish. That's not good, man. There's one there. I don't know where the other one ran off to. It's got to be close, but who knows exactly where. How many kills into the grind? Not sure, Kobe. Probably around 50 or 60. Give or take a few. It's been a lot of running around and finding zones right now. Uh, they just added turkeys to Layton Lake, uh, Delvinator. They just did that with this update. Oh, it seems like we, uh, we're in the wrong area. All right, then. What is my best kill? Uh, to be honest, I don't know what my best kill would be. I'd say... Probably my diamond albino whitetail deer. But it's so hard to pick, right? Like, there's so many different trophies that are cool. It's hard to pick one that I think is, like, my best of the best. Nice, Wilger, that's awesome. Did they have the muzzle loader? Yes, they did, Punker. They did. It comes with New England. Yeah, Kobe, we did hit 80k a couple of days ago. Crazy, man. No moose so far, but we did just shoot a bunch near this area, so... Does not surprise me one bit. Let's at least find the zone. Favorite non-great one trophy? Hmm. Now, if we're talking favorites instead of best, I would say my favorite is my melanistic pheasant. Because it was so hard to get, they're super hard to find, and they look gorgeous. Love the way they look. Musk deer zone. Do we got moose here? Mm, not yet. Hey, Andrew, how's it going, dude? I don't remember, Brayden. Maybe. Did it score diamond? If it scored diamond back then, then yes, that would have been after the changes. Uh, no, Chad, I don't. What time am I hunting them at? 12 to 16. Nice, Braxton, that's awesome, man. Congratulations. It was diamond? Then yeah, that would have been on the new system for sure. Because I believe diamond before was like 277 or 276 or something like that. I might be wrong though. It's hard to say. Oh, Crow could be wrong. Nice, Raccoon. That's pretty cool. Nice, Fat Fly. I'm glad that, uh, I'm glad the content helps you out. That's awesome to hear. Was there a pop reset? Uh, just two specific species like Moose, Mountain Lion, and Mouflon. Oh, 
Okay. Got one level two and two threes there. Three there, four there. This will not be easy. I stand corrected. Maybe it will be. <laughs> that went way better than I thought it would. I'll take it though. That went way smoother than I expected. Nice, Jackson. Nice. Glad I practiced on Peccary with how they scatter. Oh, definitely, Caitlin. That'll definitely have helped out quite a bit. Because these moose definitely do it now. They just dip out so quick. Final little lake in this loop. I feel like the moose grind is going to be a lot of doing this for the first few days. Just running in circles through all the lakes. Shooting any threes you find. Uh, shooting any fours you find. Leaving the twos. I wonder how quickly we're going to be able to get the twos. What time do wolves drink? I don't actually know. I haven't checked for it, uh, David. I have not checked for any of the times of the new animals, or the animals that are put to old maps. Best spot to hunt moose? I would say Medved's probably the best one. As for best spot, there really is no best spot. Your map is going to be different from my map. Depending on how you hunt it is going to determine what becomes your best spots. Did Moose get a reset on Medved? Yes, Cameron. On all maps, Moose did get a reset. Nice, Grizzly. That's a good one. That is a solid one. Um, if you're stacking Diamond Moose and you've got one that's that big, Lando... Are you talking about a level 4? If that's a level 4, I'd say still shoot it. For the most part, I would just leave the 5s unless you know for a fact that a 4 is guaranteed to make it. Um, the rangefinder shows the distance. The regular binoculars don't, uh, Kelm. However, the, um, the endgame binoculars, the ones that I'm using right here, the, uh, the apex view, they have a rangefinder built in. So it kind of combines the rangefinder and the binos. Uh, yes, Alex, there was a muzzleloader added. We now have a inline muzzleloader. A little more modernized than the uh, old muzzle loader. That is the only thing that was added gun wise, though. More moose over there. That's a three, and that is a two. Okay, not bad. I don't know where that one is, though. Oh, hey, buddy, you're a four, huh? As much as I want to see uh, the rest of what's here at the lake, I kind of want to get this four down. Oh, did not get the heart that time. We've been good about hitting the heart, and yet we missed that one, which was a really easy one. That's a three. Three. Okay. Okay, 
Should go down. Not fast, but it'll go down. How do you get the new gun? You have to purchase the new map. Uh, yes, Kaylee, it will be. All of the uh, special fur types for the Great One Moose is rares, from what I understand. Unfortunately. How to customize the guns in the update? Go to your weapon locker and go into your inventory. Or not your inventory, but your weapon, like your storage. Go to your storage and uh, you will be able to access it through there. What do you guys think? Do we hit up the big lake now or do we go down to some of these lakes down here? We still have so much to cover. Kind of think we work on these little lakes down here and then move our way up. Uh, no, Claire. Well, there's green wing teal, but that's the only new one. Big lake. Big lake. Yeah, I mean, I guess we could. We could just go straight to the big lake. Might as well. It's always pretty loaded, so I'm expecting a lot of moose here. Um, apparently, Nolan, some of them moved. It did not reset your population, though. From what I understand, just some of them moved. That's what other people have been telling me, at least. Is that some whitetail just randomly moved to different areas. Same with red deer, apparently. I'm gonna assume that probably a lot of species have that happen. Would not surprise me, at least. Fourteen twenty-two. Okay, we still got time. Well, your moose zones aren't resetting, uh, Max. It's the population on your map that's resetting for the moose. You'll still have some of your old zones, but it will be different moose that are in them. A, uh, a reset to a species and a redistribution are two different things. Redistributions remove all zones on your map. Uh, resets just give you a new population of moose. So some of your old zones will still have moose. And then there will also be some new zones created. Oh, what the? Oh! Oh, we got a piebald! Oh my gosh, look at that! We got a little level 3 piebald! Holy! Amazing! Our first rare of the grind! Let's go, guys! That is a beautiful moose! Wow! That is sick looking! I love the piebalds! Look how tiny he is as well. That's practically a level 2. That is practically a level 2. That's pretty cool. That is pretty awesome. I'm excited to take that guy down. Uh, let's get lined up. Let's get lined up on him. Try to get a good shot. I think we could hit the hard from here. Um, let's see. I want to get that guy as well. And just like that, hard shot. Wow, that's cool. We got a rare already. Uh, no, this would be an initial spawn, Caitlin. We haven't been to this lake yet. This has to be an initial spawn. We have hunted the entire left side of the map so far. We've ran up the river, ran along every single coast around this big uh, iceberg filled lake thing. We've gone to all of the lakes on the left side, including the crater. This is the first time we've gone to anything on the right side, so... This would be an initial spawn, so... That's pretty cool. Hey Blaze, how's it going, dude? Have a piebald on my map, I'm excited now. Nice, Chandler, nice. The moose version of Lucky, kind of. 
But this one we're taking down because I want to see the fur types. I want to see what the rares look like with the uh, the fur overhaul. Wow. That looks so good. 124 piebald moose. Let's tax that immediately. That is the coolest trophy that we have got so far. Actually, it's the only trophy. We have yet to get a diamond. We have yet to even see a five. We've got a couple big fours down. But that's it. That is, uh, that's pretty cool. That is a cool uh, trophy there. Try some different poses for screenshots. What a beauty. Beautiful. Well, that's a pretty awesome uh, start to grinding this particular lake. 124 on his score. Just the silver, but I'll take it. It's been a while since I've had a rare moose. That's super cool. Well, let's uh, let's keep searching. Keep searching the lake. That is a new zone. It seems like it was taking them a bit to actually get here. I bet we missed some back there. Because it seems like these ones were just getting to their zone. But I imagine a lot are probably kind of late. Got a 5 to spawn, goes up to 309, but it's smaller than the 4 that I was saying earlier. Well, score estimates don't really mean anything, Lando. It can hit anywhere within that score estimate. So just because a, a 4 has a higher score estimate than a 5 doesn't mean that it's going to score higher. That just means that it's got a higher estimate. Man, we got some good moose over there. Things are looking good already. I almost forgot to clip that piebald moose. I had to real quickly do that. There. Now we should be good. Okay, second shot was not good. First one looked okay. Third one got the heart somehow. Uh, yeah, under 17 they did. You know, I keep forgetting. We can just delete the uh, waypoint like this now. I keep forgetting that that is now a thing. Where did that female moose come from? I swear she wasn't there. Look, that's the one that we just killed. Where'd she come from? Where is this one coming from? It's random female moose showing up. Crazy. Nice, Alex. Best lakes for moose? Uh, there's not really any best lake, man. It's all going to be dependent on your individual map. It's hard to give like a best of the best, right? Because everybody's map's a little bit different. Holy, we hit the hard shot. That is insane. Uh, no clue, Jacoby. No clue. I haven't paid attention to it. Uh, they didn't really reveal much about that. So, uh, your guess is as good as mine, man. I have no clue what the weight estimate is going to be for it. They kind of left that as a mystery. Nice, Alex. Nice. Uh, no, Scooby. Don't shoot the female moose. There's really no need to do that. 
You don't get any benefits from shooting female moose. Random group of reindeer? I mean, might as well smoke a reindeer. Since it's on the way, might as well. Welcome back, Ben. How's it going? Rifle spook distance is about 300 meters, Necron. Approximately 300 meters. Are your binos a different color than normal? No, Chad, they're the same as they've always been. It's going good, Nathan. We've had a, a piebald already. Other than that, nothing too crazy has shown up, but we've been finding a ton of good zones. Oh, we've been getting pretty consistent moose. We've been, um, I've been very happy that the river hasn't been as loaded as I was expecting it to be, so we won't have to go there quite as much. There is a moose right there. That's a two. Okay. That guy gets to live. What do I mean by the fur types in the title? Um, all of the special fur types they showed off in the Expansive Worlds live streams for the Great One Moose are rare fur types. That's what it means. So apparently... Most Great One Moose will be common fur variation instead of those super special fancy ones. Which is unfortunate. I was really... was really hoping that uh, that would be the normal fur types for them, but apparently those are rares. Uh, 22 trick is still a thing, Kyle. You, you've seen me do it this, uh, this stream. I know you've been watching the stream for a while. I've been doing the 22 trick. It's just like the 300 Magnum and, you know, the bigger rifles. AT2, how's it going, dude? Welcome back. Got a three and a two. Okay. Definitely need to get this three. Nice, we're doing good on the hard shots. Way better than I thought we would, honestly. It has been going surprisingly smooth with the hard shots. Oh, no worries, Kyle, no worries. Uh, we don't know, Squirrel. We're not sure yet. We're not sure. Can there be ultra rare moose? Not sure as of now. They have not talked too much about that. Apparently, it was revealed on the uh, the EW stream today that the uh, the fur types that they showed off were the rares. They haven't talked much about anything else. They just said most moose that we find will be common. Most of our uh, Great One Moose will be commons, apparently. So, a little disappointing. I wish they would have told us that from the beginning. To be honest, if they had told us from the beginning that those were rares, I wouldn't have cared. I would have been like, okay, awesome. That's some cool rare stuff to grind for. But it's the fact that they made it seem like those were the normal furs. That's what really annoys me. The fact that we got excited about those being the fur types and then it turns out they're rares. Um, that's not normal, Cooper. I would contact support about that. What's the 22 trick? Uh, so essentially, if you are 150 meters away from an animal or farther, you can shoot the 22 next to them to get them to go alert. I'll show you right here. Got to get it to land next to it. There. As you can see, this moose is now alarmed. So now she is giving us a better angle to shoot her. Instead of being facing away from us, 
she's turned and faced us so that we can actually get a good shot. That's what the 22 trick is, that's what it's for. It only works with the 22 Virant and the 22 handgun though. For some reason the 22 AR it does not work with. We have three solo females there. Because I don't believe that the female moose can be in a herd of just females. Wait, oh god, what the? Dude, they keep popping in. There's four now. Random brown bear. Another random brown bear. Another random bear. Oh my gosh. They're everywhere. Brown bear paradise. Uh, yeah, Chandra, I'll probably be streaming, um... I'll probably be streaming every day this week to grind the moose. Normally, I take a day off for recording, but I think we're just gonna grind for this next week or so. Really gotta put in the hours to try and get this great one, moose. That's a big four. That's a really good looking four. 243 to 297 is not bad. That's really good. That's a three, that's a two. Okay, we got a few good shootables here. Holy. We are hitting the hard shots today. Oh, you love to see it, man. You love to see it. We're finally getting good at the hard shots on the moose, guys. It's a lot easier than I thought it was. Like, I've always known that it's easy to get the frontal shots on moose, but it's actually pretty easy to get hard shots when they're broadside as well. You just aim above the leg. Literally just line it up with the leg and boom, hard shot. The gun, this is the 300 Magnum. Oh, that's good, Necron. That's good. At least it didn't uh, mess it up too badly for you. Female moose. Uh, you get the 300 Magnum from the Yukon DLC, so essentially you buy the Yukon map, and then you'll have access to the 300 Magnum. Nice, Jacoby, that's awesome. Hope you're having fun with it. Did I find any wolves? Yeah, we've been attacked by two packs so far. Thankfully though, they have not been a problem with spooking moose, so that's really nice. They're not spooking the moose while we're hunting them, but we've still ran into a couple packs of them. 249, solid moose. One of the bigger ones of the day, to be honest. I don't know if we vitally hit this other one. I don't think so. I don't think we did. Nice, Jacoby. I'm glad you're having fun, dude. Vital blood right there. And there's the other one. That's the female. That's a two. Don't see any more. It's 15.30, so we got 30 minutes left before we reset the time. 166. Three hundred is amazing. It is, Harley. It's great. Moose attacking wolves. That could be interesting. You never know what you might see in Call of the Wild. Uh, yeah, I think Medfit will be a great map to hunt on. I I've liked it ever since they did the reset to, or not reset, but ever since they redistributed a lot of the species. And now that they added two new species to Medved, it's even better. Definitely a lot more variety here. Yeah, I think we got everything. We do need to go pick that up, though. Ah, 
Yeah, to be honest, we probably won't go claim that one. We'll just reset. We'll just reset the time main menu. Then keep looking. Later, Kyle. Thank you for dropping by, dude. Yeah, muskox would be awesome on Medved. That's for sure. It would be pretty cool. I would not be opposed to that. Scotty Lucistic, Turkey Gold, let's go. Nice, Jackson. That's awesome. That is super awesome. Let's see what's at this lake. This was always a good one, and so was this. Kind of want to check those out. Thank you, uh, Chandler. I appreciate that. Yeah, I enjoy Flinter's streams too. Flinter's, uh, Flinter's a cool dude. Glad that you're liking the stream, though. Just found a five medium moose. Nice, Tyler. Nice. Making that progress, I see. Let's see if we got any moose here. Possible that they're not here yet, as we have yet to be to this zone. We have yet to visit this zone today, so might just not be here at the moment. Definitely looks like it. Check out this one. Whoa. More wolves. Yes, silly wolves. What you doing? Oh, so uh, apparently Kathy in the EW stream today, they revealed, they revealed that the fur types they showed off for moose are rares. They're rares for the great one. So that's not what most of our great ones will look like. Most great one moose that we get are going to be common. So yeah, a little disappointed with that, not going to lie. Pretty sad to hear. Was not expecting that, but um, it's so sad. Like, I'm so disappointed with that. Like, I, I wouldn't have cared if they were rares if they had just told us that from the start. The fact that they didn't tell us till now, that kind of makes me a little bit mad. Not going to lie. Because they made us feel like it was going to be the normal fur types, and then out of nowhere today, they're like, Oh, by the way, those are rares. Like, come on, you couldn't have told us last time that we saw the great ones get shown off on stream? Like, you couldn't have just told us when you were showing them off? <sighs> like, man. Yeah, maybe, Zyphon, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I hope they're not impossible to get. I think like 1 in 10 or 1 in 20 would be okay. If it's like 1 in 1,000 or 1 in 100, you know, that's going to be kind of uh, kind of annoying. But either way, I suppose it is what it is regardless. Nothing we can do about it. Lots of female moose here. One in four million, not that hard, I know, right? I bet it's gonna get every four with every rack. Maybe. We'll see how it goes. This is definitely gonna be harder than what we're used to. But I'd say it's still doable to get them eventually. Ooh, that's a big four. That's that's a thick four right there. Alright, let's see if we can get them all before they spook. We got two of them. Is Yukon a good map for grinding? Um, I don't know to be honest. 
From everything I've heard, I don't think it'll be as good as like Medved. But it should still be tolerable. I think no grind for Moose is going to be easy. Uh, not always, JN. If it's a solo zone, then no. If it's a herd, then they should. However, sometimes you'll have multiple solos in one zone making it look like a herd, and then those definitely would not respawn in the same spot every time. Another 240. Jeez, Vinok, that's crazy. Insane. What gun am I using? The 300 Magnum, uh, Vinok. The 300 Magnum. Will the Finland Finland map work well? I'm sure it'll work as good as any other map. I think, from what I've seen, it seems like Medved and Leighton might be the best options for moose grinding. Leighton just because of a more, more limited area you have to search. And plus it's a base game map, so very accessible for everyone. Medved seems to be the best overall because it's super easy to see the moose. And you don't have to uh, walk across or walk around water or walk across rivers. A lot of times you just walk across the ice and you're good. Let's head down here. Actually, before we continue, guys, I need to take a quick break. Gonna go get some uh, lunch, late lunch. And uh, yeah, then we'll be back and we will jump right into the grind once again. But uh, we'll take like a 15, 20 minute break. And uh, yeah, hope to see you guys back here when we get back.
Hello, everybody. We are back. We are back, and the moose will soon die because of it. Double twos. Okay, okay. Good to know. All right, how's everybody doing? Got some food in me. Got a got a drink. Filled up my water. We're good to go. We are good to go, guys. Uh, yes, look, a lot of people have that happen. Your deer are still the same. Excuse me. But, um, they've moved around. Like, some of the zones disappeared and then they created new zones, but it's the same animals, so it'll just be a matter of finding them again. Nobody's quite sure why that happened, but it's something that happened, sadly. Is that a lynx? Nope, musk deer, okay. Uh, yeah, Tuxedo, once I finish the grind and get a great one, then I will make a guide on it. I tend to want to get a great one before I make a great one guide. I used to make the guide, like, preemptively, but I feel like nowadays I'd rather get one first. Before I try to give anybody, uh, a full-on guide on how to do it, right? Okay, this one's all females. That is good for us. Man, someday they really need to give us a feature to write on our map. Like, how cool would that be if we could draw on the map? That would be phenomenal. If that was ever a thing. Uh, what do you mean, Simon? Are you talking about a specific map or what? We're grinding on Medved. You can grind any map for the Great One Moose. Ah, uh, Jacoby, thank you so much for the super chat. Really appreciate it, dude. Just found a Great One Moose while finding zones. Can't believe it. Nice, dude. Nice. Be sure to post it in the Discord if you haven't already. Thank you so much, dude. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm convinced I do not have moose here. Convinced this is a mooseless location for me. And honestly, not too mad about it. Ah, uh, you should be able to, uh, Zyphon. If you're a member, you should be able to. Um, Nightbot might be acting a little weird today. Are you jumping off, uh, Holocrow? If that's the case, thanks for stopping by. Hope you had fun. Although, since it's not Whitetail, you probably did have fun. <laughs> uh, no, sir. If there is no new animal on Silver Ridge Peaks, they didn't have time to make one. Or they didn't have time to introduce one. Because something like that takes a lot of work. Guys, we're almost at 80,600 subs already. That's insane. I've just been blown away at the channel growth recently. Like, it has been pretty insane. So far, three super rares in on the grind since the map came out on console. Holy Matthew. I personally recommend Medved, uh, Levi. New England's got 150 drink zones for Moose. Um, Ibai was grinding his map in early access to try and get one in early access, and well, 150 zones later, he still didn't have one, so. Seems like New England's gonna be a tough grind, man. I think you might be muted, uh, Clay Drew. I think Clay Drew might be muted because, uh, I'm, I'm definitely talking. Everybody else is hearing. What am I going to do when I hit 100k subs? Probably something super special, for sure. I don't know what yet, but I want to make it special whenever it happens. Yep. 
Yeah, I was gonna say, you guys should be able to hear me. I shouldn't be muted. Uh, not that I know of, Landon. I haven't seen one posted yet, at least. And until I see a picture of one, I'm not going to believe that anybody has got one. That's kind of just the way I do things in Call of the Wild. If I don't see somebody post a trophy shot of it, then I'm not going to believe that it happened. Because there has been so many people that have lied about it in the past, and yeah. You know what they say? Nobody likes her. Liar. <laughs> Been waiting to use that. <laughs> Just so you guys can hear that new one. <laughs> oh, no worries, Clay. No worries. Got a great one, Unicorn? I knew it, Caitlin. I knew it. What was that? It was a it was a voice saying liar. I thought that'd be hilarious. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ben. I had to do it. Daniel, thank you for the 18 months, dude. Am I cool now or is this not long enough? Don't worry. You've always been cool, man. You've always been cool. About as cool as that moose right there. He's pretty chill. Wait, they're both threes? Oh, gosh. I thought one was a two. I thought one was a two, but there's two threes. <laughs> Hunter. That actually scared you. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. At least you know about it now. Honestly, I probably should lower the volume of it. It's hard to tweak the volume right. Let me test it again. Let's see how this is. Okay, that's better. Not as loud. Not as abrasive. Should be better. What rifle am I using? The 300 Magnum. So it looks like we only have one herd here, which is pretty good. Don't want to have more than that at these uh, outlier lakes. These freaking wolves, man. Better? Okay. Yeah. I thought that that would be a little bit better. Uh, you can join the Discord through the link that the uh, moderators will put in chat, uh, Jacoby. The mods will put the uh, link in chat for you. And then you can access it through that. It definitely is, Chad. Love the howling of the wolves. Uh, yeah, the 308's good. 308's really good, uh, YT. They're all over Medved, uh, Tuxedo. They cover pretty much the entire map. Yeah, no problem, Jacoby. No problem. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna real quickly check the Discord, see if anybody has posted a great one, Moose. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't see any pictures of a great one, Moose, yet. Unfortunate. Really wanting to see somebody get one. It's looking like the moose grind is going to be a lengthy one. 
feel like it's going to take a long time for most people, including myself. Nothing there. Musk deer, but no uh, moose here. What do you mean, Hunter 3? Like, are you talking about the Apex Connect? Are you talking about an Apex account? It's not going to get rid of your trophies if you make an Apex account. It's, uh, it's a completely separate thing. We must find this great one. Yes, exactly. We must find it. Just trying to get a great one anything. Yeah, it's understandable, uh, Waylon. That was me for a while as well. I spent about a year looking for a whitetail one and didn't get it. It wasn't until recently that I really started getting them. Oh gosh, these lakes are going to suck to check, man. Well, over there we go. Uh, that's not the way Great Ones work, uh, X-Ton. Great ones are a random spawn, a super difficult to get random spawn, so it can take one kill or it could take 10,000 kills or for some unlucky people, 20,000 kills. For a lot of people, it seems like it's two, three, four thousand 4,000 kills, somewhere in that range, but it can vary drastically. Uh, yeah, Chad, you totally could. It's just going to be more difficult because you won't have all of the perks and skills and um, all the tents and tripods, but you can totally start your grind at any level. It's just the lower level you are, the harder it will be at the beginning. Don't have the new map, can't customize the weapons, but I have the update, won't let me customize on console. Where are you trying to customize it from, Pioneer? You, the way that you customize it is by going to your uh, storage locker and then going to the uh, stuff that you own. And uh, if you hover over the gun that you want to customize, it should give you the option to. It'll tell you what, um, it'll tell you what button down below. Uh, you don't have to buy the DLC to get customization, Clay Drew. It's just, um, the, the DLC has some extra skins, right? You get stuff for free, right? You get the customization for free. You get certain skins for free. Uh, there's skins that come with each map. But the actual skin system is free. You should be able to customize your guns no matter what. Uh, yeah, Brooks, we did a bear grind, but I never got it, unfortunately. Hey, Turkey, how's it going? Welcome back there, sir. I tell you what, we're gonna get ourselves a moose. Hopefully. Wow, this lake's empty as well. Honestly, not mad. Kind of happy I don't have to go to this lake to uh, search. It seems like these four lakes have been empty for me. We'll see about this last one, though. Are you sure, Clayton? That shouldn't be the way it works. There's no way that that's how it works. And if it is, that's got to be a bug. They wouldn't do that. Thank you, Jeff. 
Great one, Moose. Next lake. Maybe, Duxton. Maybe. Hey, Mac, how's it going, man? What's up with the rare furs for Moose Great Ones? So essentially, all the fur types they showed off in the EW stream, it turns out they're rares. So most Great One Moose will be a common fur type. Which is pretty unfortunate. Not gonna lie, pretty disappointed with that. But it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, nothing there, sweet, perfect. Love to see it. Let's go to these areas. Uh, yes, yeah, Simonizer. You'll have to if you want to do herd management. If you're not doing herd management, you can do whatever you want with those zones. But if you're doing a herd management grind, you will definitely need to shoot all the solo zones that are above level twos. Six hours? That's unfortunate, Brody. Got you, Jake. Okay. Yeah, that makes that makes more sense. I was gonna say they wouldn't make people pay for the ability to customize their skins. That makes more sense if you just have to get the free one and then you have access to it. That makes sense. Also, how's it going, man? I hope you've been doing good. Oh, uh, we don't know, Logan. They haven't told us yet. They just said that it's not going to be as easy as the commons will. Essentially, they've just said that commons will be much easier to get than the special fur types. Uh, no, Jackson. There was not. No fives yet, Austin, but we did get a piebald, so... Pretty cool. Right now we're kind of just in the process of checking all the areas we haven't been to, so we've just been hammering all of the uh, different zones. We have searched the entire left half of the map, including the river and the top coastline, all of the coast over here as well. Now we're just kind of working on all the lakes over here. I already checked all the ones down here. I checked uh, all the ones right here. Check the big one. Now we're just down to these three, this lake, and these two, so we're getting really close to having checked everything. Uh, definitely gonna have to go over a few of the areas a second time, though, just to make sure I find all the zones. Okay, we still have 14 minutes until the zone time ends, so... If there's gonna be moose here, we should see them. I'm hoping that there isn't, though. I'd like to be able to cut a few lakes out of the grind completely. Would be nice to be able to write a few off immediately. That's a bear track, so not a moose good. Okay, those are not moose. Okay, that one looks good. Let's go to the other ones. Ah, man, I should probably... Probably time reset. Do I have a tent available? I don't remember if I did get one. Okay, I think I definitely did. Let's reset the time. Uh, yes, Blake. Sir, every single, uh, every single body of water on Medved can have moose for the most part from what I'm seeing. Ooh, I just realized there is one spot that we missed. I'll have to go back to it. Uh, she's one and a half, Chad. Now let's push ahead a couple minutes. Should get them to their zones. But uh, as I was saying, we didn't check around the back side of this, I just realized. We'll still need to do that soon. Nice, Sacred, that's awesome. Um, I don't know, Elon. I'm assuming that's a bug.
I didn't give up Way of the Hunter PES. I'm waiting for updates. I'm waiting for new content like rares. Way of the Hunter unfortunately doesn't have a lot of replayability right now because the only thing that you can search for is five stars. And people have found out how to get the five stars somewhat easy, so... I don't really have any reason to play Way of the Hunter until they add rares to give more variety. Or a new map. Anything that gives like something new to chase after in like a large scale. Been shooting Whitetail and Moose all day, found two troll level five moose so far. Jeez, Jake. I mean, at least you got a couple fives. That's better than we've been doing. We have yet to get any fives. We did get a very small level three piebald. Oh, what the? Got pigs. Mars hunting simulator. <laughs> That'd be interesting. What's well, diamond for moose? I believe it's 274. I think it's 274, right? If I'm not mistaken. Come on, moose, where are you? There's a moose that's a female. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we got wolves. Yep, right there. Okay, they're fleeing. We're good. The second I heard that growl. <laughs> oh, my. Uh, yeah, we're not shooting the level twos, uh, Dasher. Okay, just one more lake to check here. Then we got to go check this one. I like them both, P.S. I like them both. I think Call of the Wild I enjoy more, but that's just because there's more content. I feel like in the long run I'll like Way of the Hunter just as much once they add some more stuff. Did Whitetail get reset? No, they didn't get reset, but unfortunately... There has been some issues with them that we've seen. It seems like some of the whitetail zones moved. Now, the population didn't reset for whitetail, so you will still have all the same animals, but some people are noticing that their zones disappeared and the deer moved to new areas. I was lucky enough that that didn't happen to me from what I can tell. I checked in early access and it looked fine. Uh, we might check it at some point today, though, just to make sure it's still the same on a uh, full release. When will I be live next? Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow around 12 or 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Somewhere in that range. Okay, these lakes seem pretty empty for me. That's good. I was uh, really worried that I'd have to hunt here a bunch, but we only got one moose zone and it's just a female. Let's check this little lake right here. Yeah, it's unfortunate, Blakester. If you didn't know uh, PES, you can... Um you can play on uh, any map in the game just by going to multiplayer. As long as somebody in that multiplayer session owns the map, then you can play on it as well. Hey Blaze, welcome back. Uh, yeah, Gavin, we're hunting moose. We're trying to find the great one moose. Uh, 
Uh, the stream will probably go for a couple more hours at least, Jacoby. I'm probably gonna go till like, I don't know, 8 or 9 p.m. maybe. It's gonna be a long stream. I'm gonna be grinding all day, so I might as well stream it. Because I'm gonna be grinding super hard to try and find this, uh, this great one. I want it so badly. Okay, there might not be anything here at the moment. We'll have to check it again later on after a uh, after it's been a little bit further into the time. Uh, we should probably check around here real quick. All right, later, Turkey. Nice, G-Man. Happy to help, man. 24 hour stream? Probably not, but we'll go for a while. We will go for as long as we possibly can, man. That rhymed. It's definitely not as easy as it used to be, Deer Slayer, but I don't mind it. I think we'll all adapt to it eventually. Honestly, this is just gonna be a situation where we need to take longer shots, right? Uh, yeah, Johnny, I can check it right now. Uh, yeah, I could try that, Johnny. I could definitely try that. I could try that for sure. Uh, what did I miss? Blake, thank you for the super chat, dude. It's a level 2, 258 whitetail. Nice, man. That's awesome. That is super awesome. Let me check the uh, chats real quick, guys, to see if anybody got a great one, Moose, yet. I don't think anybody did. Yeah, it doesn't look like anybody has killed a great one, Moose, yet. I see a big albino moose in the trophy shots, though. Not bad. Yeah, no great one moose posted yet, though. Uh, yeah, Lewis. Pheasants are on Hirschfelden and Quattro. Medved got Capricallies and Grey Wolves. Um, Leighton got Turkeys. Tiawaroa got Mallards. Um, Mississippi got Green Wing Teal. Uh, Yukon got Canadian Goose. What else am I missing? Berhonga got Eurasian Widgeon. Uh, let's see. Rancho got Pronghorn. I think that's all. I might be forgetting one. Definitely could be forgetting one or two there. There's a bull. Level three. Okay. I guess you could say this guy is a shoot a bull. And he's dead. Uh, yeah, Chris, go for it, dude. Oh, yeah, that's right. Peccary's on parquet. I forgot about that. Uh, no, Blake. There is no black-tailed deer on uh, Silver Ridge. 
they decided not to do it because people were complaining about it. I'm sorry guys, I had to. I had to do it. <laughs> I had to do it. It was just too tempting, like, it was just tempting me, and I had to make the joke. I'm sorry. Yeah, the new map is awesome, Nicholas. I love it. Um, it's just not gonna be my grinding map because of the amount of zones. But, uh, I do think the map itself is actually really good. It's a very fun map, very gorgeous map. It's gonna be great for foxes, that's for sure. I'm excited about the fox hunting. You know, I wonder how many we have killed today for the moose. We got to have killed at least, like, 70 or 80 of them. We've definitely killed a lot of them. It was because a lot of people didn't like the fact that Blacktail aren't actually in Colorado, so a lot of people thought that it would be stupid to have them on SRP. The way I see it, it's a game. I wouldn't have cared. I would have just been happy to get Blacktail on another map. But enough people got annoyed with it that they decided not to do it. Uh, not sure, Jackson. I don't know why it wouldn't be. If you haven't changed your perks or skills, then it shouldn't be doing that to you. Uh, yeah, Kieran, we got a piebald uh, moose earlier today. So far, it's been the only rare of the grind. Uh, no, Jacoby, only Layton has black tailed deer. It shouldn't, Lucas, but a lot of people have noticed their zones moved around on Tiawaroa. So it seems like the animals aren't resetting, but the zones are moving. It's a very strange situation. Not exactly sure what's going on with it. That's just a female there. I do my best, please. I do my best. Nice, exotic, that's awesome. At least it was a uh, pretty big mythical, even if it didn't make it, right? Still a big male regardless. Alright, no worries, Clay Drew. No worries, man. Hey, Rebel, it's going good. We got ourselves a piebald so far today. Thank you, Blake. Do you think they're going to fix zones on Tiawaroa? Are you talking about the ones that randomly moved? I don't think there's a way for them to fix that, man. There's no way for them to know, like, what your zones were previously. There's literally no way they could revert them. So, unfortunately, if that is an issue that's happened, there's no way that they could just fix it. Because everybody's uh, population files are saved to their own system, like, individually. They can't retroactively change something like where your zones used to be versus where they got moved to. Unfortunately, just not possible with uh, the way the game saves itself, right? Gun, it's the 300 Magnum. Hey. What you doing? Yes, silly moose.
Yeah, I think we've got to about everything. And no, Dan, because it's not, um... Okay, look at, look at it this way. Um, your game save is saved to your system. Like, for example, I'm on PC. My game save is saved to my PC. If you're on console, it's saved to your console. It's not in a cloud or anything. And so they can't just retroactively change things without completely resetting your progress. And to be honest, I don't even think they could. I don't think they could even reset progress. They don't have that type of power over the save files. Because all of the saves are saved locally. So unfortunately, that really is not possible. They can't just retroactively um, change like where your need zones have moved, right? Because they didn't do any type of redistribution. Um, it was just, for some reason, some of the deer moved and we don't know why. Unfortunately, they can't, like, revert bugs that happen like that. They can obviously, like, fix the bug, but it's not gonna eliminate any of the stuff that happened because of it. It's unfortunate, but there's really just nothing that can be done about it. I think we got the other one. Gosh, you keep stopping. <laughs> the way he died. Oh my gosh. I've heard about that, uh, Fazin. My brother's got the same issue. He keeps crashing every time he tries to load in. Not sure what's going on with that. How many kills so far in the grind? Probably about 70 to 80, I'd say. It's going pretty slow right now because we're just trying to shoot all of our zones down to twos at the moment, so... It's a lot of just finding zones, shooting the threes and fours, searching for more zones. That's uh, pretty much the process we're going through right now. That's a solo female zone. That is musk deer, okay. Uh, yeah, puppy, there was a pop reset for moose. What do I mean by the furs being rare? All of the furs they showed off for great one moose are rares. That's, uh, that's all there is to it. They're rares. They aren't the uh, common Great One Moose variants. Most Great One Moose will be a common fur type. Like this. Like the, the brown. Yeah, no diamonds yet. Yeah, it's unfortunate, Levi. I'm pretty bummed about it. I guess it is what it is, though. Can't control it, so... Just gotta make the best of it. Uh, no, Brooks, we didn't shoot Lucky. Lucky's still on our map. How many racks will the Great One have? Well, right now it's got four. There could be more, though. We've only seen four in the EW streams, but... Jaxie had said that he doesn't know if that's all of them. So, there could be more. That's a two we need to keep. Missed the heart just barely. And out of render. Feels bad, man.
Yeah, pretty much, Levi. I hope they change it, though. Like, I feel like if we complain about it enough throughout the community, they'll eventually change it, but it is quite disappointing to hear that, right? Like, we expected them to be something that we could expect to find, right? And for it to be just rares, it's a bit disappointing. What's my favorite kill? I don't really have one, T2. There's so many different good trophies that I've had that it's hard to pick. It's so difficult to uh, pick them. Pronghorn drink at 17, I believe, Cody. Either 17 or 18. One of the two. I can't remember. One of those, though. Okay, that's nice. This herd is already twos. Good. No, puppy. Not on any moose, just on the great one, and it's a rare for the great one, so... That's why a lot of us are kind of upset, because you can only get them on the great one moose, and they're gonna be rares, so... Most people will never even get to see a moose with the special fur types. That's a good four. That is a good looking moose. Unfortunately, did not get the vitals, so that's kind of sad. It is what it is, though. Uh, yeah, Nick, that's, that's perfectly fine. You've probably got the majority of them. There's definitely a few you're probably missing, but you definitely have most of them. It's okay, Tater. It's not really what I wanted with the uh, the uh, multi-mount, but it's okay. At least we have a moose multi-mount now. I just wish it would have been like two or three moose. That poor moose. He looks like he's had a rough day. I mean, I guess he probably has. We just shot him, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> Yeah, it's unfortunate, Levi. I just hope the odds aren't absurdly low for getting the special fur types. I hope it's like maybe one in five, maybe one in ten chance. That way we still have a good chance of getting them. Yeah, Donde, that's why I stopped doing New England. Like, uh, I tried it in the early access. I had a hundred zones. And uh, I buy premiums was up to 150 by the time early access ended. That right there just made me not want to grind New England. And that's why we're here on Medved now. Which I don't mind. I like Medved for grinding moose. Always had fun hunting moose on Medved in the past. Ever since they did the rework to make them uh, frequent the rivers more. Yeah, that'd be awesome, Robzilla. That would be super, super awesome. You found 109 on Medved. Okay, that's about normal, Donde. That's about what it was before the update. And to be honest, that's on the low end for Moose. Like, that's actually pretty good. So I think... It's definitely going to be the best. Medved's definitely going to be better than uh, New England. Primarily because there's less water to cover, right? New England is just... A, it's literally circled by a river with a river cutting through the middle. At least here on Medved, it's a bunch of lakes primarily. So 
So I think it will be better on Medved still. But it's not going to be an easy grind on any map. That's for sure. It's going to be tough no matter what. And I'm okay with that. As long as it's like a... Uh, Somewhat even between all the maps. That is a lot of moose right there. Couple good fours in there as well. Okay, he's going down for sure. Nice, we smoked him. Yeah, exactly, Casey. I love it. Also, how's it going, man? How's your grind going? We got a piebald uh, level 3 earlier. It was basically a level 2, though. It was so tiny. Hilariously tiny. We've already searched our entire map, though. For the most part, we're just missing these two lakes here and that lake. I haven't checked those, but I've checked everywhere else so far. I definitely missed some zones, though, just, to them, just due to them being late. But, uh, I'm liking it so far. I'm actually having fun on the moose grind. Still really disappointed about the fur types, though. Like, that kind of ruined my day, to be honest. Hearing about the fur types, just... Gosh, I just don't know what to say. And it seems like a lot of people are having whitetail move. Like, they're not resetting the populations, but the zones are moving out of nowhere. Just so many things that... I, I don't know how we didn't see any of this in early access, like... My whitetail were fine in early access. But I'm hearing so many reports of people's whitetail moving, but not resetting. It's so strange. 75 zones, 1 level 5 stack. No 5s yet for me. I don't know how many zones I have, I haven't been keeping track of it. I'm going to have to run through every place multiple times anyway, so I haven't counted yet, but I've got them at almost every body of water. I think the saving grace with Medved, besides the fact that you can run across all the ice, is the fact that there is slightly less water to cover than on Yukon and Rev on Thule and uh, New England. So I think that's going to be our saving grace with the uh, Medved grind. That's a moose. That's another moose. Okay, if I can get that guy, that'd be nice. Yeah, I'll be doing that to uh, Casey. I'll be reporting some of the stuff. Because I've been hearing a lot of uh, a lot of people having issues with red deer and whitetail moving, but not resetting. Like, there's a lot of people that have said, like, my uh, red deer, my red deer zones are gone. But I found all of my same red deer at different zones, which that's a really strange bug. Like, I've never heard of that happening. Like, a population not resetting, but moving? It's weird, to say the least. I hope it'll be easily fixed, but I don't think it will be. I feel like that's something that can't be reverted, because it has to do with, like, the actual save file. It's unfortunate. Like, I was really excited for this update. There was so much good in the update, and then, of course... As per usual, the bugs kind of overshadowed a lot of it. Uh, yeah, under 17 it is. A lot of cow-only zones and single-male zones, though, so probably actually under 100 zones. Oh, definitely. Uh, yeah, I'm shooting solo males. I mean, if I'm doing herd management, I gotta shoot solo males. I'm shooting anything that's level 3 or 4. So, yeah, I'm shooting all the single-male zones. If they're, if they're not a 2, they get shot. That guy's getting shot. Ah, I missed the heart, barely. Oh, he stopped turning. There we go. Uh, yeah, McLean, it is. Yeah, it's really strange, KC, and, like, it's not happening to everybody either. Like, I went on to my Leighton during early access and everything was fine. Like, my whitetail were in the same spots as always. So it's definitely weird. Yeah, it's looking like that, turkey. 
To be honest, out of all the things that have happened today, I think the biggest complaints I see is about the moose. Like the fact that the moose fur types are rares for the great one. Just... Why even show them off as if they were normal if they're going to be rares? I don't get it. And like, I don't understand like if they... Like, why wouldn't they tell us? What do they, what could they possibly lose from telling us, right? Just felt really weird for them to show them off as if they were the commons. Been shooting them too, but I'm concerned every time I do that a new zone's gonna pop up. Oh, it definitely will, Casey. You'll get new zones 100%. Uh, what I'm gonna be doing with my grind, and I definitely recommend that you try the same, um... I'm not really keeping track of my zones too much until I've gone through all of the areas multiple times. I'm just gonna go through every single area on the map, probably, until I see them turn to twos. And once it gets to a point where all the solos have become twos, that's when I'll start, uh... Straying off to different areas. Like, I'm not even worrying about the solo zones and, like, marking my zones until I've got all of them turned to level twos. Because, like, uh, there's so many solo zones on uh, Medved. And a lot of times you'll find zones with three solos in them using the same drink zone. So it looks like it's a herd, but it's actually three solos. And so I'm not even worrying about my zones right now. I'm just checking every inch of water, every run. It's going to be a tough grind, but I'm all for it. Tyler, thank you for the super chat, dude. What's the best map for grinding whitetail for a great one? It's going to come down to personal opinion, but... I would say Leighton and Revon Tuli are the top two grinding maps, and it's going to depend on your play style, which one you want to choose. Uh, Leighton's more brushy, but there's less zones to choose from. Like, there's much less of the map that you have to look at to find all your zones. Revon Tuli, they are more spread out, but there's less brush, so it comes down to personal preference, really. Yeah, definitely, KC. However, one thing that's going to make this a little bit easier is I'm starting to get good at hard shots. I'm starting to get good at the moose hard shots. I'm learning where the uh, where the heart is located, so that's going to make the grind a little easier. Uh, yes, Blitz. So all of the special fur types they showed off in the streams, those are apparently the rare fur types for the Great One Moose. And most Great One Moose will be common. So, little bit disappointing, but I guess at least it gives us some long-term goals. I'm kind of disappointed in it, though, because they showed it off as if it was going to be the commons. Like, if I'm being honest, I would not be mad with them being rares if they had told us that from the beginning. If they had told us, hey, these are the uh, very rare fur types that you could encounter, I'd have no problem with it. But it's the fact that they s didn't disclose that it was going to be rares. That's what really annoys me. Because, like, for a month now, I've been excited to try and get some of those fur types. And now it's like, well, I'd be lucky to even get one of them. Let alone the fur type I want. I'd just be lucky to get any of the fur types. So that's the thing that really rubs me the wrong way. Uh, yeah, Duxton, we're using herd management. I'm shooting threes and fours for the moose. Yeah, it's really crazy, Blitz. It's crazy to see that. I think for the moose, it'll probably be different. I imagine that it's separate. Because as we've seen in the past, Blitz, like, um, for example, Melanistic Red Deer were bugged for a long time. I think rare whitetail great ones are probably bugged, but as you obviously can see, all the other great ones, or not great ones, but all the other rares in the game spawn perfectly fine. So I imagine moose will spawn fine. It's just, it's going to be so rare in the first place that most people won't even get a chance to see one of the cool fur types. Really hoping that they'll change it 
I mean, with the amount of complaints that they're going to be getting, probably, I could see them doing that. I really hope they will. Because it is kind of like a... It's like a slap in the face to everybody that was expecting to be able to get the cool fur types. Um, I'm very against it, Destiny. Anybody that does that doesn't deserve to be playing Call of the Wild. First moose you spot was a five medium. Nice, Hunter boy. That's awesome, man. I have yet to see a five, but we did get a piebald, so at least something is showing up for us. Uh, yeah, mud dilute is a rare. Uh, no, Blitz. From what I've seen, nobody has killed one. I've been keeping a close eye on, like, the Discord and the official Discord, and nothing has shown up so far. I keep checking it, but nothing's popping up. Uh, just remodeled, Connor, but some people are having uh, issues with Whitetail moving. Like, they're not actually resetting, but they're moving zones out of nowhere. So that's a problem that a few people have ran into. Think they're bugged because as soon as they did the fur type fix with lodges, that's when LC's great one turned to common from albino. We haven't seen a single great one rare since. It's hard to say, Blitz. To be honest, though, I don't think that has anything to do with it because um, when that when that fix happened after Rancho, all of my diamonds that I had got during that time turned to rares. Same thing happened for everybody that had shot a diamond whitetail. Any whitetail that you taxidermized during that time flipped uh, fur types, so it's not like it was an exclusive thing to the great one. Like, it wasn't just LC's great one that switched fur types. It was everybody's uh, rares they switched fur types, so I don't think that has anything to do with it. Everybody's uh, rares changed to a different rare or a common when that update hit. I think of it as like because the fur types were bugged when Rancho released, they essentially just flipped the fur type to the opposite of what that fur would be, right? And so there was lots of situations where it flipped. Yeah, that's a decent four. Gotta take him down. That's a three, what? How is that a three and that's a two? They look the same. Oh my gosh. Giant. Absolute giant. Oh, missed the heart. Hey, stop stopping. Well, we're not gonna get him to die anytime soon. Feels bad. Nice, Justin. That's awesome, man. Well, yeah, Blitz. But what I'm saying is if they mess up the rares for one thing, that doesn't mean it's messed up for the rest, right? That's all I'm saying. Another zone. Hunter. Dude. Come on! What are you doing? Missed the heart again. Feels bad. We're losing our touch already, guys. We're already losing our touch. We're missing the heart shots. What's happening? Pro can't aim. Confirmed. Oh, what's up there? Females. That's what's up there. Perfect. Oh, they definitely are, KC. Like, I kind of like the challenge, though. It's causing me to rethink everything. And this is kind of always what I, um, 
This is kind of always what I've said. Like, the reason I always was so interested in the super hardcore herd management great one grinding is I love the problem solving with a grind like this, right? Like, with uh, the latent herd management, I was always so much into trying to find the best way to be the most efficient. And honestly, with the moose being hard like this, it's really making me think about things. And it's making me try to find the best ways that I can counteract all of the inconveniences that show up. To be honest, I, I love it. I've started to adapt to the, uh, the changes already. I find it quite fun to try and like uh, overcome all of the changes like the spook distance and how quick the moose dart off after you shoot. Um, yeah, Justin, they did. Ty, thank you for the 10 months, dude. That's crazy. That is awesome, man. 10 months. Welcome back, dude. Oh, definitely, Casey. Definitely. I think, uh, I think a lot of people misunderstand. Like, a lot of us that do use herd management and love it, I think a lot of people misunderstand, like, why we like it or why we don't like certain things either. Like, I'm all for a difficult grind. I don't mind difficult grinds as long as they're not annoying, like 150 zones on New England. Like, that's just absurd. But I'm okay with a difficult moose grind. It's just going to make it more satisfying when I finally get my my herds to the point that I want them. I'm 100% fine with it being difficult. Because it's just going to make it more satisfying when we get everything managed the way we want it to be. Okay, don't see too much there. Uh, we should probably go back through a lot of these zones here. Maybe even these. Maybe even these north coast zones. You know what, let's go to the big lake. I kind of want to go back there and see what the respawns are. Uh, you could, uh, Carby. I don't know if it's going to be as easy, but it could still be done. That's a good four. Two fours, actually. Random links, okay. How's it going, little links? How you doing, buddy? Definitely feel like I'm not going to claim a lot of moose. I don't blame you, Levi. I don't blame you, man. To be honest, when you're first getting your herd management set up, not claiming is not really too big of a deal. It's when you're actually like set up and you're trying to like push for that great one. That's when it's really beneficial to pick everything up because it seems like not picking them up definitely halts the spawns of great ones. But I'd say when you're getting your initial setup done, you know, do whatever you feel like doing. Uh, no, Northern. To be honest, I'm convinced that they're not a thing anymore. I haven't seen anybody get an initial spawn great one for so long. It has been ages since I've seen one posted. Not to mention um some uh some cheaters, some cheating people in the community have tried to get one and failed, so I'm convinced that they don't exist anymore. 
242, not bad. Got initial spawn black bear before? Yeah, I've had a couple initial spawns before as well, but that was a couple, well, not a couple years ago, but like a year and a half ago. I'm convinced that they don't exist anymore. I haven't seen them in so long. Yeah, same, Brandon. I got one off of uh, Leighton Lakes when Rancho released. Same, Blaze. Same. I despise the cheaters in the community. They make everybody else look bad. Got a couple nice fours over there. Another four. That's a new zone. Holy. That's a pretty big four, too. I don't know if we hit him. Definitely didn't get that guy as good as I thought we did. Yep, I don't know if we got that good. That's the one we need. Come on, ma'am. Move, please. That'd be great. Ah. Really? Dude. Please, just, just move. Dude, are you kidding me? She's right in front of him. Okay, that's better. Now turn for me. Turn for me, please. Just just look at me. Sir, look at me, please. Oh gosh. These moose, dude, they're just being they're being terrible. Are you kidding me? How is this guy not turned? Oh, there he is. Come on, stop scratching your face. And all that to miss a hard shot. Well, we got him. We're good. I know, Bandles. Like, I couldn't get him to do what I wanted him to. Oh, my gosh. Sometimes these moose are just the most stubborn creatures in the world. Okay, gotcha, Ebron. I'll check it out, man. Okay, got you. All right, Ebron. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll show Hollow. 
Um, one thing to keep in mind though is it's gonna be a super small thing because it's an emote, so the image will have to be somewhat big for it to be visible, so probably won't be able to do the full body of a deer. But we could definitely do like maybe like a deer head with uh the text saying whiff over top of it. And then the uh, hit markers around it. Nice, Hunter Boy. Nice, nice. Uh, yeah, Luke, they did. What have you missed? Uh, not too much, Spectre. We got a piebald moose. That's been about the only good trophy. The piebald was a super small level three as well. There we go. Show me the way, Hunter. Show me the way. <laughs> I'm sorry, Hunter. I had to. I had to block you, buddy. Nice, Hunter boy. That's awesome, dude. Thank you, Call of the Wild. I'm glad you enjoy it. Um, Red Deer moved, but they didn't reset, Jacob. So, like, uh, your, your Red Deer will be the same as before, but they moved to different zones, it seems. Kind of a weird thing, but it seems like that is what happened. Yeah, Tyler, but it's part of the New England Mountains, uh... It's part of New England Mountains, so you have to buy New England in order to get the muzzle loader. Oh, we gotta reset the time. Nice, Landon. That's awesome. Congrats on that. Uh, no, Tall Socks. It's just the mountain lines that got changed. Black Bear did not. Definitely, Caleb. It definitely is. New England's got too many zones. There's like 150 drink zones on New England. Uh, Medved has more like 100 to 110, somewhere in that range. So New England is definitely better. All of the moose uh, fur types they showed off in the EW stream, uh, Mr. Pleb. All of the special fur types for the Great One. Those are all rares, apparently, and most of our Great Ones will be common. So, yeah. Unfortunate. Very sad. Not ideal at all. It 
It definitely will, Connor. It's going to be a tough grind. I think I'm up for it, though. Look at that little feller. Adorable. Two. And a two. Okay. Okay, that zone we no longer have to hunt. Beautiful. That's a two as well. That's a two as well. Okay, so getting a lot of twos to show up. Beautiful. Squirrel Killer, thank you for the super chat, dude. Really appreciate it. Hope you're doing great. Hope everything is going well for you. That is a bunch of wolves. Hello, you silly wolves. Get out of here. Yeah, we need to boop him. There we go. Uh, we already killed some wolves during the stream. I'm focused on uh, moose right now, so... Not gonna shoot the stuff that we don't have to, to avoid hunting pressure. We already killed two packs of wolves that attacked us. That will be uh, in a YouTube short at some point. How do you herd manage? Just uh, shooting threes and fours only for the uh, moose grind. Leave all twos and below. Stack the fives to make more twos and below spawn. Let's check this spot again. Uh, they're somewhat rare, Lucas. Definitely are somewhat rare. Let's try to get them uh, into their zones. There we go. We got three level threes there that we can blast. There's a two. And another three. A greater kudu are not being added, Tyler. That was a uh, misspeak on Jaxie's part. Apparently, they were never being added. This is Rancho music? It is. It's very Rancho-esque. 
Uh, the layout's not gonna help you at all, Parker. Everybody's map is different. You're gonna need to place your tents differently than I do based on where your zones are because everybody's zones are in slightly different locations. Uh, no two people's setups are gonna be the same. So showing you my setup isn't gonna help you at all. Uh, no, Tyler. Blacktail are not added to Silver Ridge Peaks. People complained about it, so they removed it. Unfortunately. 300? Oh, you get the 300 from Yukon. No, Squirrel, I don't use calls. It takes too much time to use a call. I'm all about being as efficient as I can, and if I have to wait for a moose to come into a call, then that's just wasted time I could have been blasting. Hey, these were females, if I remember right, so we don't need to go there. Nice, Justin, that's awesome, dude. Congrats, that is an awesome diamond to get. Love the Capricallis. Capricallis are super cool. I'm not sure what to tell you, Tyler. You'd have to, uh... I, I don't know what you're looking at, so, like, I can't really help you out too much there, because I don't know what's going on with it. That's a big four. That's a three. Okay, we definitely need to double-check every zone, because we have not, uh... We have not seen this zone before. I think we definitely need to go over all our zones again. Just to be sure that we got everything. Because this is a lot of uh, moose that were unaccounted for previously. Gosh, stop zigzagging. Okay, we got him. <laughs> How many great ones do I have? 20 between whitetail and red deer. Don't have any black bear, sadly. Where should you grind moose? I mean, it depends on what you enjoy more. I mean, really, any map can be about the same for moose. Um, I'd say the two best, though, are probably Medved and Layton. So whichever one you like the most out of the two is probably the best option. Uh, no, Justin, I don't really watch TV. I don't really have time to watch TV, sadly. Typically, uh, busy making content or hanging out with my family. All right, where did this guy go? Yeah, I'm not sure, Levi. I think I think Yukon's got like such a big river system that it, it kind of pushes me away from wanting to grind there. But it might be okay. My wife is grinding on Yukon, so I guess we'll see. Uh, I guess I'll see how it works for her. Uh, she's doing good, Nicholas. She's doing good.
Long time viewer of the Hunter Call of the Wild just now when you showed wolves blew my mind been playing Hunter since I started never knew they had wolves in Medved Taiga They just added it just in they just added it with this update So it's not been in the game for very long only about a day So that would be why you've uh, never seen it before They just added them recently, and I think it's a cool addition. I definitely think they fit the map nicely. I'll be right back guys need to real quickly uh, hit up the restroom and then I'll be back to the grind Jacoby, thank you so much for the super chat. Uh, they're pretty rare. They are definitely rare. Thank you so much though, dude. We are always partying? Yes, we are. It's always a party here. Killed a guaranteed troll moose only scored 260. Ooh, that's unfortunate, man. That's a pretty rough troll. Not gonna lie, that's a bad troll. That 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 is a bad troll. A scare moose party? <laughs> Yeah, that scary moose party, I tell you what. Oh yeah, Scooby, I haven't got a chance to go to a Yukon and check them out yet. Are they uh, super plentiful or what? Oh, 
Um, I don't know, Sea Docs. I'm not sure which one you're referring to. Not quite sure what you mean by the 50-50 moose rack. What lakes am I hunting? Uh, right now, every single body of water on the map, Parker. I'm trying to herd manage the map, so I need to hunt everything. So right now, we're literally going to every place we possibly can. Uh, yeah, Kelly, it does. Nice, Fritz, that's awesome, man. Congrats on that diamond. Uh, Mr. Viper, thank you for the super chat. Dude, really appreciate it. Got warned by Nightbot for all caps. My apologies. Hey, no worries, man. Just remember, the, uh, Nightbot typically only does stuff if it's, like, against the rules, but it, it will be the first couple times it's, like, a very small timeout. It's, like, five seconds or something, so it is what it is, you know, just as long as, as long as you know, uh, what the rules are, then that's fine. Thank you once again, though. You absolute legend. Round of applause for Mr. Viper. A few more hours, probably, Hunter. I'm really into this moose grind. Like, I, I gotta get all my zones found and stuff like that. Because I know for a fact we had to have missed some. Nothing, Liam. Nothing was added to Rev on Thule. Also, what is up with the, like, 50% caps going on there? That is, that is some strange, uh, caps distribution. Uh, no, Cultures, they didn't, but some people have reported that their herds moved. So they didn't reset them, but some of their herds moved to different areas. Best gun for moose? Ah, uh, probably the 300 Magnum. It's what I use and it's a beast. That's a little three we need to get rid of. How many zones are on Layton? I'm not 100% sure, man. Not 100% sure. Ooh, that's new. Like I was saying, always finding new zones, man. Always finding new zones. Three males there. Jeez. Ah, eh, they'll all go down. How many zones on Layton? Yeah, I don't know, Cultures. I don't know how many moose zones are on Layton. I know Medved has about 100 to 110. Uh, New England has between 140 and 150, it seems, depending on the map. Not sure about uh, Layton or Rev, though. I would imagine they're probably close to the same. Another zone! Oh my gosh, this is a hot spot and a half, man. I need to put up a tripod. I need a tripod somewhere over here so that I can get all these zones. I just found a very large amount of my moose just in this area alone. 
That's crazy, man. Do we have the tents on us? Yes, we do. Okay, we gotta clean these, then go set up our tent. In fact, I'll just grab this one, then go back and set up the tent. Insane, dude. Cannot believe the uh, layout of these zones. This is like a very large cluster. Yes, it is 100% confirmed, Aaron. They they revealed that on the stream today. Most moose, great ones that we find, will be commons. And uh, all the other fur types are the rares, apparently. They confirmed that earlier today. It's really uh, sad to hear, to be honest. Got me pretty disappointed, not gonna lie. We need to back up our tent about to 200, 250, somewhere in there. Unfortunate, drawn, unfortunate. Yeah, we don't have any initial spawn moose from what I can tell. Uh, we've been shooting a lot of moose and have yet to see any type of great one or anything crazy, really. We got a piebald, but that's about it. Boop. Wait, what secret lakes, uh, Matt? I'm not familiar with them. I'm not familiar with the uh, secret lakes on Medved. Where would you say they are? Uh, Lucas, thank you for the one month, dude. Really appreciate it. Welcome back, my dude. Yeah, I'm not familiar with the secret lakes. I don't know where they're located. All right, perfect. We got it. Oh, really, Ben? That's hilarious. That's amazing. Bottom right area. Okay. Is this one? This looks like one. Is, is that one of them blitz? That's got to be it. Uh, yeah, Caitlin, a, a pick would be amazing. One in the south, northeast. One in the south, one in the northeast, okay. Northeast, let's see. Yeah, I don't know about northeast. Now, one that I just pointed out, though, that kind of looks like it could be one. Little higher. Oh, right there. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Right there. Perfect. Beautiful. Oh, and this one. This this is one, definitely. That's got to be one. Okay. Got it. Got it. I think we're good. I think I figured out which ones it is. Okay, awesome. Yeah, I thought that might have been it. I, th I thought that had to be it, man. It looked like it. There's that big four.
One more. I missed the northern one. Is this? That looks like an indentation, but I don't think it is. I feel like that's got to be one. Skull Mountain? Where's Skull Mountain? I'm not familiar with the names of Medved stuff, so yeah. Southeast, just uh, north of the bigger lake. Oh, is this it? Yeah, that looks like it. Is that it? Along the river, kind of, you said? Huh. On the right side. DM do? Okay, Caitlin, I'll check it out. Let's see. Oh, yes, yeah, so that is the one that I just looked at. Yeah, yeah, that's the one that I just marked. Okay, we're good. Perfect. All right. I will remember those. Thank you all so much. Killed a diamond moose on Yukon Valley. Nice, Fritz. Nice. There's another one we killed. Oh, is this the one that we just dropped with the hard shot? It must be. Yeah, that one is. Okay. Wow, we still got a good amount of the coast to cover. Uh, yes, Parker, they are. <laughs> I think I'm good, bro, bro. I think I'm good. How you doing, though? Hope you doing good, bro, bro. All right, I'm going to auto walk real quick and then I'm going to go grab a drink, guys. I need to refill my water and grab another uh, grab another beer and then we'll be good to go.
All right, we're back. Got a little bit more of the coast to check and then we'll be good. No, Hunter 3, it won't. I already told you that earlier. It will not get rid of them. Wait, what? How is that leaving the reserve? Explain. Explain to me. Levi, I saw your first message saying to trick me. Y'all really think I'm that stupid? I can see every message you put in chat. I can see them all. You guys are. Liar. Come on, man. You really think I'm gonna fall for that? Uh, maybe, Fritz, provided your friends know what to do, right? I passed the border a long time ago. True. You're not wrong. The borders are so weird on this map. You hate that sound? Good. Perfect. Amazing. Well, here you go, Ben. Here you go, Caitlin. There you go. That was for you, too. Bro, bro, don't tell me that you stole my trophies while I was gone. I know you, man. I took a couple seconds to uh, go get a drink, and I bet you came onto my map and took all of my great ones, right? I bet you did it. Calling it now. You are the great one snatching bandit. We all know this. Nothing here. Okay, okay. For now, at least we'll see. Sounds like you already know the answer to that. I knew it, man. I knew you did it. I knew you took all my great ones. That's why I don't see a great one of this lake, huh? Because you took it and knew it. Has anybody seen a great one get posted in any of the discords yet? Because I haven't seen anything yet. Feels bad, man. Uh, not too long, Ty, but I've got really good internet, so it wasn't too big of a uh, update for me, or too long of an update, I should say. All right, Clay Drew, for sure, man. Yeah, I've yet to see anything. Hoping somebody will get one soon. I hope they're not bugged or something crazy like that. That'd be unfortunate.
Think my moose don't get reset in medbed. They they definitely did, uh, Felipe. They definitely did. Most likely what you're seeing is like your zones are still there because they didn't really change zones, but your population will be different. So you can get a population reset without it actually removing all of your drink zones. Yeah, where, Aussie kid? Where was it posted? Because I'd love to see the picture of it. Alright, later, ghost. Yeah, Johnny, definitely possible. Definitely possible. There's a lot to this update, so... It's definitely possible that there's just less people going for moose. <gasps> oh! oh my gosh! Why? Oh my gosh! Ah! <laughs> what, dude? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Do you guys know what that is? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Dude. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm shaking. That's a guaranteed diamond melanistic. That's a guaranteed diamond melanistic. Hold on, I got. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Dude, there's no way. There's no way. Oh my gosh. I think I just killed my voice. Hold on. Oh my gosh. That's a guaranteed diamond melanistic, guys. I don't even care if we get a great one now. I don't even care if we get a great one. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's no way. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful, man. Oh my gosh, literally the last lake we checked as well. Actually, not the last, there's two right here. I've checked almost every place. Oh my gosh. Wow. I normally I'd stack every five we get at the beginning, but I gotta kill this. I can't I can't stack it. We gotta kill it. Oh my gosh, guys. Hold on, I gotta I gotta recover my voice. That was that was bad. Jeez. I know Caitlin. Definitely not stacking it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's no way. The second I saw its back and saw that there was no brown on the back, I immediately knew that was a rare. And then when it was a five, oh my <laughs> gosh, dude. Viper, thank you so much for the super chat, dude. Kill it in my name. We're going to kill it, man. We're going to kill it. Thank you for the super chat. Wow. I don't know how to... I don't even know how to comprehend this. This is the craziest thing I've ever had. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, my poor voice. What did I do? I don't know if I'm going to be able to stream much longer now. I just killed my voice completely. Oh my gosh. It's so beautiful. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. What a gorgeous moose. I'm not taking any risks with this guy. Oh my gosh, look at how beautiful he is. Oh my gosh. Wow. I gotta tell everybody in the Discord about this. Oh my gosh.
That is absurd. That is absolutely absurd. I'm blown away. I am blown away at this insane trophy. Look at this gorgeous deer. Or deer. Moose. Oh my gosh, I'm so flustered. <laughs> my gosh. Wow, he's beautiful. 80 meters away. I think we got this. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait for everybody to get in here. I want everybody to see us take this down. I can't believe that we have been grinding for like six hours and then one of the last zones that we check is this beauty right here. Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong, Diffusion. Technically, it is a deer species. Technically, it is. Whew. I know, KC. I can't believe it, man. This might be the best trophy I've ever got. This outdoes any great one. This outdoes any other super rare I've ever had. This might be my favorite trophy of all time. This is the best thing I've ever found in Call of the Wild. Oh my gosh. I just, I don't know how to react to this. This is insane. He's so beautiful. I want to get closer. I want to get closer and take more pictures. I have to. Necron, thank you for the super chat. Oh my bloody goodness, I am flap- am very flabbergasted. Me too. I am blown away. Definitely, KC. And it wasn't even herd managed. That's the thing. Even a herd management super rare. This was before we even got our herd management going. So that makes it even better. This is just insanity. This is true insanity. Uh oh, stream dropped. Stream dropped. What's going on? Stream labs? Be good. Okay. Okay, okay. Stream, we're, we're good. We're good. Oh my gosh. Yeah, guys, I saw the like. Uh, Tyler, thank you for the super chat. In the famous words of Troy Landry, shoot him. We're going to shoot him, man. And Tony, thank you for the super chat as well. 300 plus, maybe, dude. It might be. Thank you both for the super chat. <laughs> guys, just so you know, the lag was because I saved the, uh, it was because I saved the replay. For some reason with Streamlabs, whenever I save the replay, it does a quick stutter. I don't know why it does it, but we should be good now. Let's get rid of the waypoint. Oh my gosh. Wow, it's so... There's such a big difference between that and the normal ones. My gosh. That's insane. I don't know how good of a shot we're going to get. Yeah, I don't think it's 300 plus, Johnny. I don't think it's 300 plus. I think it's probably like 290 maybe? I'm going to guess 290. Oh my gosh. I still can't believe it though. I know, Dusky. It's because I tried to save the replay. For some reason, the replay buffer causes the stream to drop for like a split second sometimes. I don't know what the cause of it is, but it's unfortunately something that happens. Look at that beauty back there. Wow. Wait for the outline to go away. There we go. Oh my gosh. 285? It definitely could be 285 because that is the bottom of the estimate. Game keeps crashing for you, so I'm done for the day. I'm sorry to hear that, Easy Loot. Thank you for the super chat, dude. I'm so sorry to hear that. So sorry to hear that. I'm going to wait for the uh, alert to go through and then we'll shoot this thing. Oh my gosh. Whew. 400? I wish. That'd be crazy. Gotta wait for the alert to go through so it doesn't pop up while we're shooting it. Not gonna lie, I'm super, uh, I'm super nervous, so I might botch the hard shot. I'm, I'm tempted to not even go for the hard shot, because I'm really nervous. KC, thank you for the super chat, dude. 285, we're all buy you lunch. That's a deal, man. That's a deal. Thank you so much for the super chat, you absolute legend. Really appreciate it. 
Let's wait for the alerts to pop up and then we will take this down. Shoot it with the new gun? I would, but I don't have the new gun on me. I don't want to spook him. He's giving us a really good angle. Yeah, I'm not going to risk it, uh, Blitz. I'm going to go for Lung for sure. To be honest, if I miss the heart, I think we'll still hit Lung. If I move to the side, I think we will. Oh, he's facing us now. He moved! Oh, we got him! Oh my gosh! Oh, that scared me! Oh my gosh, that scared me! We're good! We're good! We're good! We're good! Hey! Hey, you! No, stop it! Bad! Bad! Oh my gosh, that scared me so bad. That scared me so bad. I thought we messed up the shot. It moved as I shot, but we're okay. We're okay, and that's all that matters. Hey, Pro XCK, how's it going, dude? Man, you made it just in time. Oh my gosh. Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? There he is, there he is. Okay, let's go claim him. Quick, quick, quick. Oh my gosh, 285 Melanistic Diamond. Tax quick. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that. Oh my gosh, that's insane. That's my greatest trophy ever. My greatest trophy ever killed is right here. Oh my gosh. That is insane. That is the best thing I've ever killed. Oh my gosh, I freaked out so bad when he moved. I thought we might have lost him, but luckily we still got the lung. We still got a lung. Wow. That's crazy, guys. We just got the best trophy I've ever killed in my life. Oh my gosh. That is insane. Shot info? Yeah, let's take a look at it. Look at that. Just barely got the right lung. Oh, that was scary. I thought we screwed it up. I thought we screwed it up for a second there. But we got him. Oh my gosh. 285 is a good diamond as well. What's the true score looking like? 109 overall spread, 26 times. We got 45 on the width of palm and 104 on the palm length. This is insane. This is absolutely insane. It did, Johnny. I freaked out so bad when it moved. Oh my gosh. That freaked me out so bad. My poor voice is dead. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do now. Jeez. Thank you guys for, uh, for being here. I can't believe that we just killed this. This is the best trophy we've ever killed in Call of the Wild. And that's after 4,600 hours. This is my best trophy. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe that we got it before even getting herd management going as well. Like we hadn't even got herd management going. And we got this beauty. This is by far the most exciting trophy I've ever killed. I, I just can't even explain what I'm feeling right now. Oh my gosh, let me catch up. Harley, thank you for the super chat. Let's go, Crow. Yeah, man, let's go. And Jet, thank you for the super chat as well. You both are amazing. Thank you all so much. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Well, I hope I didn't permanently hurt my voice. Like, I hope I didn't ruin it for the next few days. Because we're going to be streaming a lot, so... Wow. Um... Okay, we need to find a male quail. We need to find a male quail to uh, to put with this guy. We need to. I, I that <laughs> that has to happen now. I don't have any male quails. We've got to go get a male one at some point to put with this guy in a multi mount. I uh, know, Fritz. He was saying that it would be two eighty five, and it did make two eighty five. 
Mason, thank you for the super chat, dude. You absolute legend. Oh my gosh, that's insanity, dude. Thank you so much. Before Fabled, I know I can't believe that. We got it before the great one. That is just like, the, the odds of that happening, for those of you that aren't familiar, the odds of getting a super rare with no herd management is approximately like 1 in 20,000 or 1 in 15,000. The fact that we just got that before getting a great one is the most mind-blowing thing I've ever seen. Like, my gosh. Harley, thank you for the super chat. He moved! He did! Oh my gosh, I freaked out. I can't believe that he moved right as I shot. That was the scariest thing I've ever had happen. And I mean, I've hip-fired two great ones before, and this was more scary than that. That's crazy. That is, that is like super crazy. Like a whole new level of crazy. I, if I'm being honest guys, I don't care if we get the great one. I really don't care if we get the great one now. This has, this is like even more insane. Definitely Ethan, this is better than a great one for sure. I've officially like got the greatest trophy of my entire Call of the Wild career. And we can finally up the moose diamond counter. One. There we go. It is a celebration, guys. Let's go to the lodge. I, I gotta go to the lodge. I gotta go to the trophy lodge. It definitely is, KC. I'm just, I'm so blown away. Oh, man. Yeah, don't worry, Caitlin. I, I, I recorded the whole thing and then I clipped it as well with the uh, replay system on Streamlabs. So we're good. We're good. I got it all saved. Oh, my gosh. Hey, Mr. Miner or Master Miner, how's it going? Let's look at this gorgeous beast. Where am I going to put him? What do I possibly replace? Oh, I know what I'm going to replace. I'll replace the small melanistic. We've got a small melanistic in here. I was hoping we could upgrade this guy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it just looks so insane. Wow. That's crazy. That's so crazy. What a gorgeous trophy. Next emote, he moved. Dude, Fellblade, that's a fantastic idea, actually. I like that idea for an emote. We'll do a he moved emote. That is great. I think I can actually design that myself as well. So we'll do that for sure. Put it on a floor mount. I will once we get a bob white quail. We need to get a bob white quail first to do the multi mount. For now, this guy's gonna go on the wall of moose. This is the wall of like all my best rare moose. We got the 243 pie ball, the 177 albino, this beautiful diamond mela now, and then we have a 251 pie ball as well. Travis, thank you for the super chat, dude. That's mela moose is a beauty. Dude, it's so nice. I'm blown away. I can't believe that we got such a good moose trophy. I can't believe it. That is the most mind-blowing thing I've ever had happen. Just crazy. Will, thank you for becoming a member, dude. Really appreciate it. Enjoy all of the content that comes with that, including the extra videos on the channel, access to private Discord channels, and extra, like, emotes and stuff to use. Thank you so much, Will. Thank you to all of you. Hold on. Yeah, I gotta I gotta go tell my wife. She she loves the moose. She's been trying to get nice rare moose. I gotta show her this. I'll be right back, guys.
Oh my gosh, guys. We're, I'm back. I'm back. So, what I just realized that is actually kind of hilarious. My wife got the super rare I wanted, and I got the super rare she wanted. She wanted a melanistic moose super rare. I wanted a melanistic white tail. And she got the white tail. I got the moose. So we literally got the, the super rare that each other wanted. That is hilarious. Oh my gosh. Let's get back to Medved though. Now that we've looked at that guy for a while. Wow. Whew. All right, I think I'm finally uh, calming down. Check mod chat. Okay, Claydra, I will check it right now. Oh, wow, dude. That's crazy. Somebody got the Great One Moose. Nice. Okay, so somebody finally killed one. Jeez. All right, let's get back to the grind. Let's get back to it. All right, well, I, I don't even remember what was at this zone. I don't remember what else was here. Where was the, uh, where was, what was the other male that was there? I don't remember. I don't remember at all. I, I don't even care. I don't, I don't even care. Let's just go check the other two lakes. <laughs> yeah, it's unfortunate, Casey. I wish they weren't commons, man. I mean, Dalton, to be fair, there's thousands of people looking for the Great One Moose. So yeah, finally somebody got one. When you think about it, thousands of people looking, only one person's got it. That's pretty rare. That's pretty rare. The only reason that Great Ones used to be super difficult to get was because they were bugged. They used to be really bugged and so nobody ever saw them. Ever since they fixed them, it's been more common. We should probably reset the, uh, reset the time. Welcome back, Rex. We just got a super rare, man. We just got a super rare. Um, yeah, T2. Let me pull it up real quick. I gotta save the image. Let me pull the image up. There. This right here is the moose that was just found. Let me fit to screen. This is the great one moose that somebody just found. Right there. Not exactly like my favorite rack, but you know, it is what it is. And yeah, it's a common fur type. This is the very first Great One Moose that we know of that's been killed. But that's cool that somebody got one. Yeah, thank you, Dalton. I appreciate that, dude. I can't believe we got one. There we go, though. The butterfly rack. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that rack personally, but I know a lot of people do like it. But yeah, it is unfortunate that they don't have the special fur types. I'm still so bummed about that. Like, I can't get over it. It really does, KC. Like, part of what made us so excited about the moose was the fur types. I don't know why they made them, like, rares. Like, why? 
Uh, yeah, Fellblade. When we shot the super, he moved. Lady says she's jealous of the Mela. I bet, because she was looking for one, wasn't she? She did get a pretty nice one still, though. Like, she did get a good-looking level for Mela. Mela is more rare than a great one. It definitely is, Samuel. Like, that's way more rare than a great one. I'm overly excited about this. I, like I said earlier, I don't even care if I get a great one now. We already got, like, the best trophy we could have ever asked for. It doesn't even matter if I get a great one at this point. To be honest, that Mel is going to look better than it anyway, since we'll probably get a common fur type with the uh, great one. For sure, Zevin. That'd be so good. It'd be amazing. Um, did you like you did you react with the appropriate emote nuketown? That's how you get the rolls, right? You have to react with the emote that it shows for each roll. And uh that's how you get given the rolls. Oh yeah, bro, but you definitely did. So all of these special fur types that they showed off in the EW streams, those are rares. All of the great one moose are gonna be common for the most part. Definitely, Casey. Definitely. Like, I'm... I can't be happier. I've only had a few super rares without herd management, right? Like, I think I've had five through herd management, and this would be my sixth without it. But those six took so long to get. I had the three white tail from the... Or two white tail from the Rancho grind. One was an initial spawn on Revlon Thule. I had a Leucistic Diamond Mallard back at the be at the very beginning of the white tail grind. When the Great One was first released, and then I had a Caribou back when, um, back when Yukon released. This is the, this by far is better than any of them. Definitely a lot more special than the Red Deer Supers I have, because those were all herd management. Same with my most recent Whitetail one. It was herd management as well. This is so much more special. You could probably tell by how I reacted to it. <laughs> uh, no, it's just for the Great One Moose, Brobra. So all those fur types they showed off are just for the Great One Moose. But they're rares. They're rares for the Great One Moose. So it's very likely that only like one in a hundred of those will be that fur type or something crazy like that. It's kind of disappointing when they showed off those fur types as if they were normal. Level two. Okay, okay. Don't need to kill him. Colby, thank you for the super chat, dude. Much appreciated. Uh, you can use the link. You can use that link that's above your uh, last message. That link will take you to the join uh, page. Yeah, Casey. Like, I've had two... Okay, so I had never found a melanistic moose. Until Revon Tulia's release, I did a 60 minute trophy challenge and got two Melas in multiplayer, but they were both super small. And since then, I had never seen another Mela. So the fact that we got this blows my mind. Like, I've killed, I think I've officially killed my voice. Like, it, it actually physically hurts to speak right now. Trying to stay hydrated, but, uh. Oh, man. It's gonna be tough to recover from that. Exactly, Raymond. That's the way I see it, too. I'm okay with uh, common great ones being a thing as well. But I feel like if they're going to make commons the main thing for this great one, Moose, they need to make the fur types like a one in five chance or something reasonable like that, you know? I mean, they haven't really elaborated on it too much, but I'm assuming they're not going to be one in five. I'm assuming they're going to be much more rare. Just based off the way that it was said and the fact that the first one is a common. I can't help but think it's going to be a piebald uh, or a fabled piebald situation, right? 
Uh, yeah, Brober, pretty much. And to be honest, like, I, I kind of get what you're saying. Maybe they are just trying to give, like, more trophies for the herd management people to grind for, but uh, to be honest, I, I think they should make them just as, like, I feel like it should be relatively easy to get the special fur types. Because, just look at it from, like, how is somebody who casually grinds going to get one? Like, how is anybody that does a casual grind going to feasibly have a chance of getting those special fur types? Like, that's the thing that I'm thinking about. And also, the fact that... The fact that they, uh... Portrayed it as, like, the normal fur types. That's what gets me the most. Like, they, they made it seem... They made it seem like they were just going to be normal fur types that we could get for the Great One Moose. And then it turns out that those are rares when they didn't tell us it was rares until release. It just feels like an error on their part, right? Like, they should have told us that they were going to be rares, but they didn't. And that's what really makes me mad. That's the part that annoys me, is they didn't tell us it was going to be rare for them. They acted as if those were the normal spawns, right? That's the only problem I have with it. If they had from the beginning said, yeah, these are some super rare fur types that you guys can try to get if you're lucky, then I would have been fine with it. But it's the fact that they never said that. Uh, Moose time's the same, Harley. Exactly, Blitz. Exactly, like... It's already hard enough for, like, people that have full-time jobs and school and stuff like that to get a great one, but... Now, if they really want one of those special fur types, it's going to be even more difficult for them, and I just don't like that. I feel like it should be somewhat possible for somebody who gets lucky enough to get one of the great ones to have that fur type, like... Oh, I'm sure they see it, Garden Chair. They for sure see the feedback. People are complaining about it everywhere. There's no way that they could possibly miss it. Me making a video on it wouldn't change anything. I can just give them direct feedback instead, which I've already done. I've already told them that this is not a good thing. So that's the only, uh, that's really the only feedback that they need, right? They get all of your guys' feedback. V making a video on it's not going to help. Yeah, for real, Raymond. At, at this point, they definitely will. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad idea either, Zevin. Like, make each of them, like, a different rarity. Like, like maybe the most basic of the special fur types is the easiest, and the most beautiful is the hardest to get. I could maybe see that being kind of cool. I know that's not quite what you said, but I think that would be cool. Yes, that's understandable, Ben, but I'm not talking about Jaxie. Like, Jaxie's not the problem here, right? Like, Jaxie had no, had no clue about it. But the fact that the dev team didn't tell us this, that didn't tell him until recently, that's the problem. Like, they should have told him from the beginning that those were rares that he was going to be showing off. Jaxie is in no way at fault when it comes to this. He's just doing exactly what he was like. He's just giving away the information that he was given, right? He had no way of knowing it was going to be like this because they didn't tell him. I don't know, Casey. I I don't know. It's hard to say. They don't really tell us much, so like I can't really make a full judgment. I feel like it was intended to be like Fabled Piebald for the White Tail. That's my guess, is that they wanted it to be like Fabled Piebald. Maybe the Fabled Piebalds are bugged instead. But I definitely don't like it. That's for sure. I hope they change it. I hope they make it easier to get them. But it's really hard to say, like, they've never really given us too info- too much info about, like, great ones and rare fur type probabilities and the special fur types and stuff like that, and because of that, we really have a hard time figuring out what's going on. Missed it. That guy will die.
Wait, what do you mean, uh, Casey? Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe, Casey. I don't know. I just... At this point, I'm... They've done so many things that were, like, unexpected in the past that I just don't know what to believe anymore. I don't know what is truth and what is, like, just cover-up at this point. There's definitely been a very large amount of things that have happened with EW where it's like, did they intend that? I don't know. It's just so hard to tell. And I don't know, I'm afraid to like make an assumption and have it be false, so. Hey, you be quiet over there. Silly cow moose. Yeah, this update was not as good as we thought it would be, Johnny. Not gonna lie. This might be the first update that I've ever been genuinely disappointed for. I try to be as honest as I can with you guys. Like, I know in the past I've caught criticism for being positive about updates that everybody else disliked, but I genuinely did like them. And I like a lot of the stuff in this update, but some of the problems that arose with it are just so significant that it's hard not to be upset. Um, okay, so Riley, they did do something to the Red Deer, right? But they didn't actually get rid of your Red Deer herds. Um, this is something that's been happening. They've been moving around. So, your Red Deer are still the same on your map, but they've moved. So, your grind will technically not be ruined. They've just moved the herds around for some odd reason that nobody can seem to figure out. Yeah, maybe, Caitlin. I don't know. Like I said, I try not to jump to conclusions until we get, like, some type of official announcement on everything, and... Right now, we don't really have much. Oh, there's quite a few problems, Will. Um... People's red deer and whitetail zones are disappearing, and the deer are not resetting, but they're moving to different places on the map, so... Like... People's whitetail and red deer aren't uh, any different from before, but they've changed zones somehow. Uh, some people aren't able to access the customization to the weapons on console until they download the free DLC for it. Um, there's some hit registration issues with the moose. I've had a few bullets just go completely through them. There is issues with crashing on Rancho. My brother can't even play the game because every time he opens it, because he's at an outpost that's crashing, it just crashes the second he loads the game. There is, um... They basically just didn't tell us that the rare, that the uh, special fur types for the Great One Moose are rares. Like, there's a lot of stuff that just wasn't like they said it would be. And it really sucks because I was so excited about this update and like, there's still a lot about it that I love, but the the glaring issues are really holding back my enjoyment to like the max that it could have been. No, G-Man, uh, from what I've heard, he just found out during today's stream, so... It seems like uh, they just didn't tell him that they were rares. Like, how is it- how could this possibly be the best and worst update in the same update, right? Like. It's got so much good stuff, but there's so much bad that happened as well, bug-wise. It's leaving me with such mixed feelings. Like, I want to be happy about the update. I love so much that they did. Like, the skin system, the backfilling. New England's a gorgeous map with a lot of fun hunting. The moose great one being added to the game, but then there's the small things that make it just... Hard to focus on the good. Yeah, exactly, Casey. It's all speculation. I wish they would be more transparent with stuff that happens, like... I feel like they have nothing but positive things to gain from being transparent with a lot of stuff. Yeah, Brobra, definitely. I disabled that because I, I just don't like the pop-up, but... 
It is nice that for people that uh, may forget that it is a good reminder for sure. Yeah, that too, Jordan. The fact that they sold New England as a grinder's paradise and it's not a grinder's paradise. That was another thing that I really was not happy about. Like, I I, um, I gave some feedback about that because I was like, man, it was claimed that this would be a great grinding map and it's not. It sucks for grinding because they're so spread out. It's a great map for multiplayer hopping. It's a great casual hunting map. It's great for small game. It's great for birds, but it's not a good great one grinding map. Like, New England is not good for great ones. Maybe Whitetail will be decent, but Bear and Moose, no. That's a Brober special kind of feature. It definitely is, Brober. It'll help you out for sure. It'll save you from losing some of them trophies, I tell you. Me too, KC. Like, Jaxie does so much for the community. It's unfortunate that all of the backlash goes on him because people see him talking about it. When in reality, he's just relaying information that he's been given. It is very unfortunate. I hope that... I hope this doesn't fall back on him too much because nothing's his fault. I really hope everything goes over smoothly for Jaxie. Because Jax, he's an awesome dude. I've talked to him a decent bit and, like, that man is nothing but positivity. How many great ones do I have? 20 in total, Allison. 14 white tail, 6 red deer. Hey, Ace Point, you missed a super rare. We got a diamond melanistic moose. And uh, my voice died because of it. I might sound a little bit weird the rest of the stream because of that uh, encounter. <laughs> exactly, Ty. Exactly. And I feel like some people do forget that. I feel like there's definitely some people that forget that Jaxie's just the messenger. He's not where the information comes from. He's just relaying the information to us. And it's not his fault if he's given, like... Um unsubstantial information or like uh, less information than what is needed. It's not his fault. I feel you, King Charles. That's understandable, man. I'm still grinding them because I, I want to get a great one regardless. Now, if I get that butterfly rack, I'll be kind of disappointed because it's not really going to look that special. But if I get any of the other racks with a common fur type, I'll be, I'll be happy with it, I guess. It's just not going to be as exciting. Yeah, Ace Point, I, I'm sorry you had to miss it, man. It was crazy. I There's definitely going to be a video on it, though. That's uh, that's the greatest kill of my entire Call of the Wild career, man. Like, I've never killed anything crazier. And, I mean, I've, I've done a lot of grinding for great ones and stuff, and I've never got something that crazy. Jonathan, thank you for the super chat. I feel like they knew people would be frustrated by another American map, so they way oversold it to the community. It's possible, Jonathan. It's possible. I definitely think that could be it. Yes, Ivan, somebody did get a great one. It's unfortunately a common with that butterfly rack, so not a fan of that. Kind of doesn't look like a great one, if I'm being honest. I, I, I think I would be pretty disappointed if I got that as my great one. That would be like getting a, getting a great one whitetail, right? But it's got a diamond rack. Oh, that's a new uh, moose. See, this is what's going to happen a lot. These solo zones are going to move constantly. What are you? A three. Hey, get back here. <laughs> what am I watching? This almost feels cruel. That kind of feels cruel. What's going on? 
Collective World, thank you for becoming a member, dude. Really appreciate it. Enjoy all the perks that come with that, including the uh, special emotes, access to private Discord channels, and some scrap content on the channel. Much appreciated, man. Welcome to the Scarecrew. And uh, I can't remember if I said thank you, but thank you, Jonathan, for the super chat. I think I read it off, but I didn't say thank you. So thank you. Thank you to the both of you. Um, the skin pack should work, uh, Kiara. It should work. You just gotta go to your, uh, storage. Once you go to the storage, go to, like, your, uh, your owned items. And then hover over the weapon you want to customize. It'll show you the button to press at the bottom of the screen. It should work. You're rewatching the super rare reaction? Be prepared. It was quite the scream. Never, never, uh... I don't think I've ever had a reaction like that before. And I mean, if I've acted pretty ridiculously for some of our great ones, but... I don't think I've been that excited before. That moose was the most exciting thing I've ever seen in my life. Not gonna lie, I wouldn't be surprised if the neighbors heard me. <laughs> uh, yeah, Kim, I will once I kind of get this grind a little bit more underway. The thing about Medved is it's actually pretty easy to make a guide. Check every body of water, and that's the guide because they can be everywhere. Moose can be literally all over the map. We have checked everything during this stream. Every single lake has been checked at least once. Every single one of them had moose except for like two. Yeah, probably, Blakester. I didn't think of that. They did show the very first tease of the moose as a common. That's a good point. Why didn't we, why didn't I think of that before? Collective World, thank you for the super chat. Hopefully the devs will take all this feedback in and remove common fur type for the great one. Also, congrats man on the super rare. We are also proud of you. Thank you, dude. I really appreciate it. I hope they do. Well, if I'm being honest, I don't, I don't think they should remove the common. I just think they should make the other fur types just as easy to get as the common, right? Like, I think that it should be just as easy to get the other variations. I'm okay with common being one of them, as long as it's not like too substantially more difficult to get all the other stuff. I know, me too, Kyle. That was that was scary, man. I I was scared so bad when he moved. Also, open everything in devs. It has so much hope to be a great game. Just sucks that devs don't really have any one good run to s the system. I don't know if it's really that, Michigan. I think part of it is the fact that this game has, uh, it's got very, like, messed up coding, right? Like, um, the game is very old and it's had pretty messed up coding since the beginning. I think a lot of it is just unavoidable bugs that are going to happen, but I do think there is a bit of like, I do think there is a little bit of like not understanding what the community really wants. But to be fair, I guess us that do the great one grinding and watch the streams and YouTube are not the majority of the community. There's a lot of people that don't watch YouTube that play the game and play differently. So I get that they have to cater to those people as well. But the way I see it is in many cases, The stuff that gets tweaked to like make grinding more enjoyable, it's not going to affect the casual players. Like if somebody wants to play casually, they don't want to grind. Um, adjusting things to make it less annoying for grinders isn't going to make those people have any less fun. If anything, it's going to make it better for them as well because they'll see more animals, right? Well, I think I missed a message that I was going to read. No, it's not about the sample size, Zyphon. It's based off of the stuff that was said on the EW stream. It seems like the way they phrased it was that these are rare fur types for the Great One. Rare fur types. Rare fur types typically mean that we're not going to see too many of them. 
And they advertised those fur types as being the normal ones for weeks. That's the problem that a lot of people have with it. Sure, we've only seen a couple or really only one great one get found, but it's the fact of like what they've said. They've said that they're rare fur types. And rare fur types typically means we're not going to see too many of people too many people getting them, right? That's the issue. Well, obviously, Zyphon, but we're talking about what the developers have said. What was told to us on the stream. You can think about it however you want, but that doesn't change that they advertise them as being the normal fur types. And then just recently told us that those are rare fur types. And what, what else are people going to think? Rares have always meant super difficult to get, like 1 in 100, 1 in 50, like something crazy like that, right? So chances are we won't really see anybody getting those fur types for the great one. Not anytime soon, at least. Tyler, thank you for the super chat. Good night, Crow. Gonna check out my update and go to bed. Good job, brother. Have a good evening. Thank you, dude. Really appreciate it. Hope you enjoy the stream. Thank you so much for the super chat. It's hard to say, JN. I don't know. I'm just going off of what they said on the EW stream. And, like, what the information that's been relayed to me by everybody. It seems like they're going to be very difficult to get. And it's not even about the rarity. It's about the fact that they made it sound like they were going to be normal fur types. That is the thing that people have got so upset about. It's the fact that they showed them off as if it was the normal fur types for the great one. And then on release day, they're like, oh, by the way, it's rare. And it's like, okay, well, would have been nice to know, so I wouldn't have got my hopes up to get, like, a specific a fur type combined with a specific rack. Like, that's the thing that people are so upset about, is the fact that they made it out to be just the normal fur types that we would be able to get whenever we get a Great One Moose. Yeah, but they didn't say that they were rares either, Zyphon, did they? Like, they didn't tell us they were rares. If I remember right, their exact words were, these are the fur types that you can get on the Great One Moose. And that really makes it seem like those are the normal fur types, right? It's all about how you phrase it. It's all about how you portray it. You got to give your viewer, your viewer base and your fan base and the players a good idea of what they can expect, right? That's the problem. Like I said, if they had told us they were rares from the beginning, I wouldn't have cared. It would have been like, okay, we got some cool stuff to grind for, but it's the false advertising that annoys me. No, he wasn't told, Vine. He wasn't. And like I said, it's not Jaxie's fault. The team didn't tell him. But that's the problem. Yeah, exactly, Blitz. They said, like, these are the different variations for the Great One Moose. They never once said that you could get a common during the upcoming, like, the first few streams. I think at one point when Jaxi spawn went in and it had a common fur, he was like, they aren't supposed to have the common. These are the fur types you can expect. I think it was just a major miscommunication between the team and him. I think they just didn't give him the info that he needed. And like I said, it's not Jaxie's fault. He did all that he could. He can't control, like, the information that he's given. Couple more moose here. Can we get these without deleting it? We can get one. That one's giving us a better shot, so... Boop that guy real quick. Uh, no, some kid. There's not a, uh, a full black skin for the guns, unfortunately. Uh, what are you talking about, Blitz? Are you talking about backing out of the harvest screen? I've talked about, like, all the stuff to do with the harvest screen, I think. I don't think there's anything I missed. Like, you can do this, you can do that... I've already covered everything in the live streams. I just didn't cover it in like a video. Actually, no, I did cover it in a video. 
I'm almost positive I covered it in a video. Exactly, Vine. Like, I I always feel so bad for Jaxie because so many people that aren't, that don't really like, that don't really go to the streams of like creators much, they don't understand that Jaxie's not the person that like, he's not the one that's giving out the information. He's just the messenger. He's just telling us what he's been told. And I feel bad for him because like he really can't uh, There's nothing he can do to like change the information he's given He just has to go in it expecting it to be true, right? He's just doing his job so nobody can really blame him What time was the super rare at? I don't remember uh, God's gift. I think it was about an hour ago, maybe a little bit more than an hour. I'm honestly a big fan of the harvest screen, uh, Kyle. That's one of my favorite parts of the update. As a content creator, the new features with the harvest screen is a lifesaver. Being able to inspect and take screenshots of different angles with a good background. It's huge. Like that part I love. Later, Will, thanks for dropping by, dude. Yeah, Harley, they did. They added the turkeys to Layton. Uh, yeah, delete. We got ourselves a super rare, man. We got a super rare melanistic moose. My greatest trophy of all time. Man, we are nailing the heart shots right now. That is awesome. Oh no, Ty, that's not good. That's not good, dude. Fifty-four minutes ago? Okay, perfect. So it is about an hour. I guess I timed it pretty much right. My guess was close. Nice, Xavier. Nice, dude. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, what do you mean, Call of the Wild page? What's super rare? Uh, we got a diamond melanistic moose. In literally, like, one of the last lakes we checked. We went through every single lake on our map today, and literally the third to last one had a super rare moose. Just absolutely insane. Alright, let's go through here again. JD, thank you for the super chat. Really appreciate it. Are the ducks in Mississippi? Yes, they are. Green wing teal are in Mississippi right now. It's going to be cool to hunt them there as well. I'm excited for that. Thank you for the super chat though, dude. Holy moose. Okay, that's a lot of shootable moose. That is really good. I see one running. There we go. Think we got them good. Oh my gosh, that'd be insane, Squirrel. Like, that's my dream great one. That is my dream moose great one. I hope I get it, but 
I just I don't I don't see us getting a special fur type with our great one. I just don't see us being that lucky. Though I mean, I guess the melanistic moose is like the most insane luck in the world, so maybe we will get lucky enough to get one of the good looking great ones. We will have to see, I guess. There we go. Uh, did we? Yeah, we got a good shot. Okay, perfect. How rare are albino red deer? They're pretty rare, man. They're not easy to find. I've had trouble finding them on our last uh, great one grind. When was the super rare? About an hour ago, Sunday. About an hour ago. All right, let's just run back over here. That's a moose. Honestly, we could go here. Why not? Jeez, Caden, that's a long update, dude. That's a long update. Took you 8,000 kills for an albino red deer. Yeah, they're not easy to get. Definitely very rare. Oh, missed it. Oh, he stopped. Oh, you silly moose. He's 100% spooked. <laughs> I definitely did use up my luck, Casey. I don't think I'm going to get anything good. I think whenever I do get a great one, it's going to be a common fur type and it's going to be the uh it's going to be the butterfly rack that I don't like. That is just that's just going to be how my luck's going to go now. I already got the best trophy I could have asked for off of this grind. Like I can't even possibly imagine getting anything better. Honestly, Casey, I hope you get an albino super rare. I hope that that's your first big trophy you get because that would be such a gorgeous thing to see. Can you just imagine like an albino moose in Medved? My gosh, that'd be so good looking. I really hope that's what you end up getting. Later, Ebron. Thank you for dropping by, dude. Much appreciated. Thank you so much, man. All right, let's see. How far away would we be from these zones? 260 to 80. Yeah, we need to go clear out here. I want to get far enough away to where we're not going to be spooking them. Oh yeah, toxicity. I remember Flinter's albino diamond moose. Those things look so good. Yeah, anything. We've been streaming a long time. I'm going super hard on this moose grind. Like, I, I gotta get this uh, great one as quick as we can. And I'm really having a lot of fun, too. Like, I wouldn't be streaming this long if I wasn't having fun. And, man, I'm, I'm enjoying it so much. It's been fun regardless of all the issues that have popped up with the update. Regardless of all the issues, like, for real, I've had a lot of fun. All right, there we go. To be honest, I think we can remove this tent over here. We're probably just going to walk this coastline. Excuse me. Yeah, simple choices. We're getting all set up, man. We, we found ourselves a super rare moose while we were setting up as well. This has already been like an insane day. 
it's been like seven hours of setting up and to get that on top of it just is insanity definitely KC definitely like a, an albi a giant albino on medved is like it's one of my dream moose trophies to find here on medved the only albino that I've ever killed was on um now that I think of it, what map was it on? I think it was Layton. I think it was Layton Lakes or possibly Yukon. I've never been able to get one on Medved. The only rares I've got were the two that I got today. What trophy is my favorite that I already got this grind? Oh, we got a Melanistic Diamond, uh, Militant. We got a Melanistic Diamond like an hour ago in the stream. We got a Melanistic Diamond at like the last lake we checked. We had literally spent like five or six hours searching every lake. There was three lakes left. These two down here and this one right here. And we checked this one and boom, super rare. <laughs> uh, it's just unbelievable. That's about, about 300 away, I think. 340, okay. Unfortunately, a lot of this grind is going to be, uh, it's just going to be like running the rivers. And stuff like that. I'm going to try and get tents and tripods set up wherever I can. But we're going to be running around a lot for the first couple days of this grind. Just trying to turn these zones into twos. There we go. Uh, we're grinding and setting up Sullivan. So I grind at the same time that I'm setting up. I know some people try to find all their zones first, but I've never done that. I've always felt like it's a waste of time because any second that I'm not hunting, I feel like I'm just wasting time where I could be getting trophies. So I don't know why I put those away. We need these. So I grind as I'm searching everything, as I'm setting up. And then I just move around my setup more and more as we hunt. I think somebody already told her, Parker. Somebody was telling me that she's jealous of the trophy. So I think she already knows about it. Oh, it's 18 to 21, Johnny. No wonder I couldn't find them last time. What all rares have I got today? We got a piebald level 3 that was just barely a level 3. And then we got the super rare Mela. Um, that happened with some of them sub. I don't think it happens anymore, but that used to happen all the time with certain trophies. Um, it's like specific animals that do it. It's not everything from what I've seen. But it is pretty uh, uncommon for sure. Uh, yeah, Keeks, for sure. Once we get done with the moose grind, we will pick up the bear grind. Oh, no, none. You got an algebra test? Ooh, I do not envy you, man. I hated algebra so much. Yeah, I kind of figured, Clayjo. I was going to say, I've seen a couple people say that they that she already knows, so I'm, I'm pretty sure she does. I'm pretty sure she knows. Because that's just kind of how the Call of the Wild community works, right? Somebody gets a rare trophy, everybody else ends up finding out about it. I remember back when uh, Lady Legend got the uh, Great One Black Bear, I, I, my entire chat was just flooded with people telling me, did you see Lady's Great One? Did you see Lady's Great One? The same thing when Kill Clinton got his uh, Red Deer Great One. It was like, did you see Kale Clinton got the Red Deer Great One? That's just kind of how things are. Everybody tells uh, everybody about all the trophies. 
So most of the time I've typically heard about everything and I'm sure Lady probably hears about all the trophies that everybody else gets as well. What was the score on that diamond? It was 285, Chef. It was 285. It was a really nice diamond. Oh, no worries, Ty. Thank you so much for being here, dude. Also, tell KC hello and tell him I hope he gets some good great ones. Is there a new animal on SRP? Sadly, no, Texas. There isn't. There was going to be, but people were complaining about the, uh, about Blacktail, so they decided not to add anything. Literally me and KC's DMs? Exactly, bro, bro. See, exactly what I'm saying, man. That's what I'm saying. It's the Brobras of the world that make sure everybody knows. Uh, what do you mean, Milk? What do you mean, man? Not quite sure I understand what you're trying to say there. Okay, this spot is two females. That's right. These are both females. Okay, we can move this tent. Now that we've kind of got a good idea of all of our zones, we can move our tents around a bit. Uh, they start drinking at 18, Levi. 18. Nice, Lando. Nice, man. Maybe, Lunar. To be honest, that's, uh... If you've got a ton of twos, that's a great start to herd management. Like, that is the dream. Getting a map that's loaded with a bunch of twos from the start. Unfortunately, my map was not loaded with twos. I have a ton of threes, ton of fours, and then that one lone five. If you got it, Mason, be sure to post it in the Discord. Whitetail were not reset Hoper, they were just moved around, so it seems like there's a bug where a lot of the uh, Whitetail zones moved. They did not reset them though, a lot of people have been searching for them and they found their same herds just in different places, so they're not reset. There just seems to be a bug that was causing them to move, unfortunately. Not sure why it happened, but uh, your, your stuff's not reset, thankfully. Gosh, I hate that we have to collapse all these tabs now. It used to save the ones that I had collapsed, but now it doesn't. I have to collapse them every time. There we go. I had to put different camos on the guns. So you go to your locker, right? Actually, I can show you soon once we go to another tent. Uh, but essentially, you just go to your weapon locker or your storage or whatever you want to call it. You go to the stuff that you already own. You can hover over the weapon and press the C key. 
Or if you're on console, it'll tell you what to press. That's a two. Nice, Viper. Be sure to join it, man, for sure. That's a three right there. We need to get that three down. And down he goes. Smoked him. I'm 24, Alex. Big four, a three. What? Oh, that's further than I realized. Holy, they're almost 400 away. Wait, what? Wait, what? I compensated so much on that shot and it didn't hit. That was like a full foot above where the heart was and it missed. That's crazy. Well, we got one more zone to check here. What level animals do you need to shoot for stacking? Um, threes and fours. Leave the twos and below, leave the fives if you want to, uh, if you want to get more level twos and below. Yeah, I don't know what was going up with that shot. I hit the guy in the back with the le in the leg, oh my gosh. Yeah, I feel like there's more drop than there used to be on some shots. Either that or I'm going right through the moose. I've definitely seen some hit reg issues. Especially with that one where we were like 100 away, aimed at the head, and it shot like five or six inches above the head. That was good. But that was like 319, so that, that was expected to be good. Yeah, it's unfortunate, Savitz. I haven't really used it too much here on uh, PC. Uh, yes, the new update is out. Uh, yeah, Milk, I do. Yeah, I saw that somebody posted one, Alex. It's unfortunate. Unfortunate that it's the basic fur type. I was really hoping that, uh... The special fur types wouldn't be absurdly hard to find. Right now, it's kind of looking like they are. Nice, Nick. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. They really have, Johnny. There's been some weird stuff going on with the guns. Jeez, Justin, that's wild, man. Couldn't have been any closer. All right, just hit the end of drink time. What fur type am I going after? I'd like to get a uh, fabled birch, but hard to say if that'll happen.
Oh, I forgot to claim one. Well, let's go grab it. How much longer am I going for? Not sure anything outdoors. Until I can't go anymore, pretty much. Because I want to do most of my grinding live and, uh... I'm still wanting to get more done today, so we're going to still be live. Will it flash it from a 300 kilo moose? Yes, it will. It will indeed kill it. How many great ones have been found? So far, just one from what I know, Jackson. No, why? If they're not going to get rid of herd management, it's it's literally like part of the core respawn system of the game. In order to do that, they would completely have to revamp the entire system. That would be super expensive. It would probably take over a year to do. I don't think they will do it anytime soon, if they ever do at all. Yeah, pretty much, Hammer. Pretty much. Hey, these ones are not at their zone yet. Okay, for those of you that are not familiar with the skin system, you go to your cache right here. Go to storage. Hover over a gun, you'll see in the bottom right. Well, you can't see it because of my overlay. Let me, uh, let me pull the overlay down. Okay, you'll see bottom right of the screen right here. It says C, C for customize. Just press the corresponding button that it says and it'll open up the customization. Just like that. And then boom, you can customize it. Just like that. Alright guys, that will be right back. Just give me two seconds. I'm going to head to the restroom again. Uh, been chugging water after killing my voice. So yeah, we're going to take another like five minute break.
Bro's back, everybody. We're back. No need to clap. We're good. All right. Back to the grind we go. Ooh, that looks big. Ah, it's a big four. Sorry, guys. I would have been back sooner, but I went to go get the mail as well. Up oh, too low. Dude, these moose are so unpredictable now. They move so spastically when they run away. Crazy. I know, Mystic. I can't believe it either, man. I, I, I literally broke my voice. Thank you, TTK. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for as long as I can, man. We're gonna grind as much as we can. Try to push to get that gray one. Yeah, we screwed up that shot pretty bad. Okay, that's twos now. Beautiful. Love to see it. Well, and I need to uh, take some screenshots so I can make a map later. I need to make a map of all my zones at some point. Um, can I turn off the... Gosh, it still shows the names, though. There. All right, now I can make a map later. So I'm gonna need to make a map to keep up with everything that I've shot down to twos, everything that I've got a uh, good, good shootable moose in. Screwed up the shot again. Man. Honestly, that seven hours of streaming is not treating me well. I'm missing my shots now. Bro went from hitting all the shots to missing all the shots. Uh, what do you mean, Tyler? It should. We don't know, Giga. We don't know. They showed off four of them, but I don't know if that's all of them. Hold on, guys. I gotta go check something once again. It says that a package was left at my door, but I didn't see it out there. I gotta go check it again. I gotta make sure they didn't deliver it to the wrong house. Give me like two more seconds. I promise it won't be too long. I promise.
Right. Sorry about that, guys. Seems like a good old postal service delivered my package to the wrong person. Says it was delivered at my door. It's not at my door. So that's fantastic. You gotta love it. You gotta love it, man. The postal service at their finest. Gotta love it, man. Yay, HD, how about you go cry about it? How about that? Bet y'all have more fun doing that. Uh, yeah, Musa, it is out. The update is out. Probably they delivered it to Flinter, probably. <laughs> Imagine they're like, gosh, uh, I mean, this package says Oregon, but I got this insanely overwhelming urge to deliver it to Pennsylvania. Well, might as well. Nice, Snipper. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. That is awesome. Oh, that's that's not good, Faded. I don't I don't know. Is it possible on Xbox? I don't know if it is. I think it should be, but I'm not 100% familiar with it. Yeah, me too, Mosa. I'm going to be grinding super hard, man. Going to be going crazy with this grind trying to get it. Uh, yeah, Blaze. Uh, I don't know if you saw it. We got a super rare. We got a diamond melanistic, man. No, 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 it's not about that, Chunkle. It's not about the fact that they're rares. It's the fact that they told us they weren't. That's the problem. It, and people aren't mad that they're rares. People are mad that EW made it out like they were going to be normal fur types. That's what people are mad about. It's not the fact that they're rares. If they had told us from the beginning, yeah, these are rare fur types, nobody would be mad. It's the fact that they didn't tell us that they were going to be rare fur types until the update dropped, and they're like, oh, by the way, these are rare fur types. That's what people are mad about. It's just the miscommunications that people are upset about. Not the actual... Not the actual fact that they are rares. It's the fact that they didn't tell us they were rares and they made it out like they were going to be the normal fur types. Getting everybody's hopes up for a possibility of being able to get one of those. And then the update drops and they're like, yeah, these are rares, by the way. That's what people are really upset about. It's not the fact that they're rares, it's the fact that they didn't tell us they were rares. They made it seem like they were commons. Oh, sounds about right, Jake. Gosh, I hate it when they do that. I hate it when they leave it at the wrong, the wrong porch, and then they send you the picture, and it's like, Are, that's not my porch. Are you kidding me? <laughs> had that happen once, and of course, the people that had it there, by the time I found where it was left, they took it. Because, of course, of course they would.
What uh, weapon skin is my favorite? I don't know. I've got a lot that I like. I don't know if I have a favorite. Uh, yeah, Dusky it was. Yeah, exactly, Johnny. Especially when we were promised that they were going to be so much more. We did, Cash. We did. Nice, Columbia. That's awesome. That is awesome. Uh, yeah, Jaden, we got a Diamond Melanistic. You missed a super rare moose. So yeah, again, just to be clear, the people that are mad about the fur types are not mad that the fur types are rares. They're mad about the whole principle of it, right? I'm mad about the fact that they made it out like those were commons. And so everybody got really excited to be able to get one of them. And then they told us that they're rares. That's what people are mad about. People aren't mad about the fact that they're rares. They're mad about the fact that we were practically lied to. Or at least not necessarily lied to, but they withheld the fact that they were rares to kind of make us... More excited for it, it feels. It just feels like we've been betrayed, kind of. Okay, we gotta go this way. Yeah, quit bike. I kind of agree. Like, if they were. If they, since they're rares, like, they shouldn't have shown them off the way they did. Or at least told us that they were rares, like. I would have had no problem with it. If they would have just told us from the start that they're rares, I wouldn't have had an issue. Uh, yeah, Havoc, you definitely could. Let's a Lynxy right there. What rares are we talking about? So essentially all of the great one fur types they showed in the streams are rares. That's what we're talking about. Apparently they're not actually the commons. Those are the rare fur types. So 90% of people that grind a great one will never even get to see one probably. Uh, we're not going to kill him yet, Tyler. Maybe one day, but not anytime uh, soon. Yeah, like I said, quit bike. I'm not mad that they're rare. I'm just mad that they didn't tell us until it was already released. Like it just felt it just feels dishonest to go like a month with telling us about all these cool fur types and then not telling us till last second. It it just doesn't feel right. I'm okay with them being rare. I just wish they would have told us sooner. Cuz they they made a lot of people mad with this. I have seen like an absurd amount of complaints throughout all the channels about it. And it sucks to see everybody like so upset. All right, nothing through here.
Yeah, exactly, Johnny. It does, Fellblade, it does. I feel like this really could have been... This really could have been EW's chance to, like, regain the trust of people that have stopped uh, playing the game. And I feel like they just dropped the ball. It, it could have been so good. The update was set up to be one of the best updates ever released for Call of the Wild. Uh, not sure, Mr. Sabbats. Uh, did you change anything? I've seen a few people talking about it. Sounds like it might be a bug, so I definitely would recommend reporting it. Be sure to always report any bugs that you can to their, uh, support. Because that's the only way stuff gets fixed. It did, TDK. This could have been the best update ever. It's still a good update. Well, it's not the smallest issues, Chunkle. It's more than just that. People are losing their uh, their zones for Whitetail and Red Deer. Some people can't even play the game because there's major crashing. It's a whole myriad of issues that are combining to make people upset. Like, my brother can't even access the game because there's an outpost in Rancho that is causing him to crash, and since he's at that outpost, every time he loads the game, it just crashes. It's a ton of things. Not to mention, they didn't tell us that the uh, skins would be paid skins until a few days before the update. It's just a lot of places where they could have been more transparent that they weren't. Yeah, Chunkle, it's not it's not like it's just one issue. It's it's more of like that's just the most glaring issue because it feels like we were lied to. It's a co it's a combination of a lot of things. Like, don't get me wrong, I love this update. I love a lot of the stuff they did, but it, it's just hard to overlook the issues this time. And I'm one of the more positive people in the community about Call of the Wild, as you probably know. I. I've always been very positive about everything because I always feel like positivity is better than negativity in many cases. And I always try to look at the bright side of everything, but this is the first update in a while where I feel like there was a lot of things where they really could have done better. A lot of things they could have told us, a lot of bugs that should have been found, like... It's just unfortunate. Yeah, man, like, it, it's not just over the furs. The furs were just, like, the biggest thing because they didn't tell us till today. But there was a lot of other things that happened as well. Like, some of the weirdest bugs I've ever seen. People are losing their whitetail and red deer zones, but not the actual herds that are tied to them. Like, they're just up and moving to random places. It's very strange, like, some of the stuff that's happening. Uh, what do you mean, Luke? Are you talking about, like, an hour and a half ago? If you're talking about an hour and a half ago, it's because we almost messed up a super rare. It moved as I shot, and, uh, we freaked out a little bit. I don't think there's any other thing that we would have been saying oh no for. No, Hoper, my whitetail were not reset. Um, everybody that I've talked to, their whitetail were not reset. They were just moved around. 
Uh, there's quite a few people that have had their red deer do the same thing where um, somebody that watches the channel had a a super rare red deer on the map that they were stacking, right? And it got moved to a new zone along with a bunch of others. I don't think your pops reset. I think it is just moved around. That's a four. No, Brayden, they're not invisible. I've just got a lot of chats to go through. Oh, no, Hammer, that's not good, man. How long ago was the diamond? Like an hour and a half, hour, 45 minutes, somewhere in that range, Dylan. I don't remember exactly. It's been an exciting and wild night. It's been pretty crazy. Hey, Kathy, how's it going? Uh, we got a super rare. We got a diamond melanistic moose earlier. Oh, uh, we're still doing herd management, uh, Lick. Still doing herd management. Trying to get it going. It's taken a, long, a lot longer than normal with moose. They are much more difficult to manage than uh, white tail or red deer. So we're probably going to be at this for a few days trying to get them managed, and then we'll be able to really, like, uh, start going crazy with our zones. Yeah, cool, I did. I shot it when uh, Tiawaroa first came out. Okay, got a three and a four. I can really only kill one of them, though. Good enough, though. All right, Kathy, no worries, no worries. Uh, no, Chunkle, they're not. It's only on the Great One Moose. It's only on the Great One Moose for those fur types. Regular Moose, it's still just uh, Melanistic Albino and Piebald. That's a two. Okay, that herd's done. Beautiful. Okay, we're seeing a few herds turn to twos. That's awesome. A couple of these herds is only our second time. Go Ooh, that one's got some, though. Okay, we're going to need to put a stand here. Like, there's so much to shoot. Ooh, yeah, I don't think I can shoot this yet. I'm going to have to be super careful with this. I don't want to delete these zones. We'll drop a tripod there. But I'm not going to shoot any more here yet. Hey, hello. We probably got about 100. To be honest, I don't know the exact amount. We've been going for quite a while. Let me see. Where's our latest harvest? Let's see. 
How much are we killing per, like, hour? So that's 20 in about an hour, but I did take like 20 minutes to look for my package, so I'm going to say we're getting about 25 per hour. If we're getting about 25 per hour, that would be, gosh, how long have we been streaming? Eight hours? Yeah, we've been streaming eight hours. So we probably killed about 200, give or take a few, obviously. Gonna be hard to get an accurate uh, count. How hard is it to get aggressive moose? Um, it's decently hard. I've had four go aggressives so far. Um, three in early access, one since we started grinding today. They're decently rare when trying to get them to go aggressive. It's very cool when they do go aggressive, though. It is very cool when they do. Yeah, James, I didn't expect it either. I actually really hurt my voice too when we spotted it. I get really excited whenever I see like amazing trophies and like I don't think I've ever reacted like that to a great one before. My poor voice just is, it's not doing good after spotting that thing. Do we have anything over here? Grey Wolf? Hey, don't you dare come over here. I'm looking for moose, man. Oh, you did, Sweaty? Feels bad, man. Um, we don't know, Vine. It's starting to feel like it might not be a thing anymore. Yes, exactly, Nathan, exactly. And, uh, I honestly don't mind that they're rare. I just wish they would have told us a long time ago. That's the, that's the problem a lot of people have with it. It's not the fact that they're rare. It's the fact that we were kind of given the impression that they were the normal fur types. And so it feels almost like a slap in the face to like, it's like they showed us all this to tease us and then took it away last second. That's kind of what it feels like. That's why a lot of people are mad. How many zones are here again? Three for Moose. Okay, we definitely need to go back there. Uh, most of them Classic Hunter. There's definitely some I'm missing, but we've got a lot of them. Can you get a great one in under 100 kills? Definitely, man, you can. I've had a great one white tail that took 80 kills before. So it's definitely possible. It's totally possible. Hold on, did I miss a super chat and a membership? I think I did. I must have got one while I was out uh, looking for my package. Well, I can't see it in the chat, but thank you, JD Williamson. Really appreciate it. If you're still in chat, be sure to let me know if you said anything in your uh, super chat. Thank you so much, though. Really appreciate it, dude. Sorry that I was gone when you sent those.
Yeah, Zachary, we're going crazy with the grinding, man. Like eight hours into it at this point. What great one should be next? I want Blacktail or Mule Deer next. 30 kills, Vine? Jeez. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, it's a slow grind, Blitz. It's really slow when you first start. It will pick up as we go, but it definitely starts off very slow because the, uh, the moose are very spread out on every map. Pretty much no matter which map you pick, they're going to be pretty spread out, so it is a very slow start. Uh, Tice, thank you so much for the super chat. Much appreciated, dude. How you doing? Hope you're doing great. Oh, missed the heart there. Whoa, Capper Cali. Woo, let's get him. Hey, well, he got away. <laughs> um, you could use tree stands, Remington. That's totally fine. That's totally something you can use. Grasshopper. <laughs> Better not be a grasshopper. Uh, ma'am, what are you doing? Hello? Uh, no, Shed Hunter. You have to go to your storage. Go to your storage and then hover over the weapon and then you press a specific button over it. And then that will open up the customization. Uh, Och, thank you so much for the super chat. Really appreciate it. Hopefully I said your name right. Rebel and Tuli got mess map got messed up. Only grinding seven zones for white tail. The rest disappeared or are already shot down to one. Should I grind on another map? Um, from what I understand, man, what happened is the zones didn't actually delete. They moved. So it seems like a lot of people's zones moved around, but you should still have the same animals on your map. If you want to, you could try to figure out where they went to. Or if you really wanted to, you could restart. That's really up to you, but your uh, zones should still be on the map. They seem to have just moved. Where is that hidden lake again? I'm trying to remember. You guys showed it to me, but I don't remember it. We went to the one up here already. This one. Is it this one? I think that's it. I think that's it. Uh, no, Matthew. Red Deer is not restarted. But there is a bug that seems to have made some of them move around. All right, later, Hammer.
How do you get the low level males to spawn in specific zones for the grind? It's just a matter of continuing to shoot those zones down until they are low levels. And then if you get a, uh, if you get a diamond in your favorite zone, stack it. If you get a diamond in a zone you don't want it in, shoot it. Same with like uh, the low levels. If a low level shows up in a favorite zone, kill it. If a low level shows up in a zone that you don't want them or that you want them to be in, leave it, you know? Southeast. Let me try to remember it. Southeast, okay. There it is, okay. Found it, we're good. <laughs> we found it, guys. How long left in the stream? Uh, probably, I don't know, to be honest, man. I've been going for over eight hours. I, I don't know how much longer is left in the stream. As much as I'd love to give you an answer, I, I really don't know. I'm just going to go till I can't go anymore. Hey, there we go. Good four. Nice. Got him. Later, TTK. Thank you for dropping by. Yeah, I know, Kathy. It's pretty sad. I'm liking it so far, Kathy. It's a tough grind, but I kind of like the challenge. Yeah, Aiden, I couldn't believe it either, man. Like, that might be the only time that I've genuinely, like, lost my voice from seeing a trophy. <laughs> like, uh, I'm still feeling the effects from that. But I, I'm more than happy. Like, I can't believe we got it. It is like an overwhelmingly insane trophy. Ah, uh, probably, Kathy. We've been going for about eight hours now, and I think we've covered every bit of water at least twice. <laughs> yeah, probably fell. What's my main gun? 300 Magnum, Blake. He moved! I know, right, Sage? That was <laughs> I I could not believe that he moved. I'm so happy we didn't mess him up. I really thought we were going to mess him up. Like, for real. That scared me so bad. 
Uh, just one, Mason. Just one. A couple hours ago, Jackson. I don't remember exactly. It's been a while. Uh, yeah, Duke, I've got two episodes already recorded. It's just a matter of finding the time to post them with all the hype with the moose grind and uh, New England releasing and stuff like that. I will get more videos out on the beginner series, I promise. Just gonna take a little bit of time with all this other stuff going on. Oh, wow. There's a bunch of moose at this uh, hidden lake. Are they all female, though? Looks like it's all female. If that's the case, we don't really have to go here anymore. Uh, another female? Hey man, chill out. Stop running around me. Okay, so it is all females. Good. So I don't ever have to come back to Hidden Lake. That Hidden Lake, at least. Where have we not gone in a while? Uh, all of these lakes. We need to check these again. Yeah, definitely Sage, definitely me too. Also, sorry guys if I'm not talking as much. It's it's getting pretty uh, far into this stream, so. My voice ain't, it ain't doing as good as it was. And also, I'm reading through some feedback about the update and stuff. It's going good, sweaty. It's going good. Nice, Gunner. I hear wolves again. Don't y'all be messing things up for me, okay? I got moose to shoot and great ones to find. I ain't got time for you, you wolves. Yeah, quit bike. <laughs> Definitely. Actually, it's been more than eight now. It's been about eight and a half. I've been going a while, man. That's a two. You get to live, sir. Gosh, I hope that uh, we can get our map to twos fast. I would be so happy if uh, herd management kicked in quickly. Oh, no worries, Mason. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Hope you have a good night. That's a three. Oh, definitely been some wolf stuff going on, huh? Looks like it.
Come on. Really? Come on. Yes, silly moosesis. These moose, man. They're being stubborn. Wait, are they coming back? They are. What are you guys doing? Oh my. Yeah, Tomahawk, I remember you. You were just in here uh, yesterday, yeah? And the last few days. Yeah, Nathan, I think one has been killed, maybe more now, but I've seen one person get one. Um, nothing did, Ace. Unfortunately, they didn't have enough time to add anything to SRP. Yeah, same vine. I've only seen one. Later, Johnny. Thank you for being here as always. Uh, true, Giga. True. You're not wrong. Crater Kudu to SRP. Definitely. De definitely diffusion. Definitely. I, I agree. While we're at it, can I get a white tail on Verhonga, please? And uh, can we possibly, just possibly, get a, uh, get a uh, black tail deer on uh Tiawaroa, you know? <laughs> That's a three. Oh, there's another. Well, we got one, maybe two. Yeah, definitely, Salvatore. I'm glad that they did finally bring them to Leighton. It is cool. It is cool to see. Thank you, Clubber. Appreciate it, man. We're going hard with the grind. Gotta stay strong and push through it. Gotta check all these zones, shoot down these threes to twos. Once we can check some of these uh, lakes off of our list of stuff we need to check, it'll be great. Yeah, me too, Nathan. It is pretty cool. I think they do fit pretty well with it. Yeah, the update is out on all platforms. 
It's out on all platforms, uh, Nitrox. Later, Gunner. Thank you for watching, dude. Thank you, Flapjack. Um, on PC, it's R. Quentin. I don't know what it is on Xbox. No, sweaty hands, I don't. Out of breath. Ah. Oh no, Tomahawk, that's that's not good, dude. Sorry to hear that. Uh, it's a DLC map, uh, Quentin. What two guns am I using? Uh, 300 and 300. Just using two 300s. Alright, later, Viper. Thank you for being here. Yeah, no worries, Viper. Thank you for being here, dude. No worries. I get it. It's late. It's definitely, uh, definitely late in a lot of places. It's getting late here, too. It's like 830. Definitely not sure how much longer we'll go. A part of me still wants to keep going because I really want to make as much progress as we can, but then I also feel like I should get some sleep and get a little bit of break from looking at a monitor all day. Yeah, Kyra, we did. We did. Uh, a couple hours ago, we got it. Uh, we need to check the crater again. Have not checked that in a while. Um, I don't really talk about what part of Oregon I'm from, Matthew. Just the western half of it, really. That's really all I ever say. I know, me too, Rag. I want to get one so bad. Even if it doesn't have, like, the fur types I wanted it to, like... I do still just want to get one.
Nice, Derek. I hope you're enjoying the game. As some of the better DLCs, I'd say, if you're looking for... Well, it depends if you're on... If you're on PC, then you'll need to get the tent DLC and the um, ATV DLC. If you're on console, those come with the game. I'd say some of the better DLCs is the Modern Rifles Pack. The Tripod DLC is very useful because it reduces hunting pressure, which is a... Uh, it's very handy to help not delete need zones whenever you're hunting over them. Um, some other DLCs that are pretty good is... What's it called? Sorry, I've been streaming for a while. My brain's like... My mind's going blank right now. If you're looking for a DLC map, uh... Silver Ridge Peaks is really good. Revlon Tuli is pretty good. The new, new New England map is pretty good as well. Weapon Pack 1 is also a really good one because it comes with the 22 Virant, which is uh, this rifle here. Best uh, rifle you could get for like rabbits and, you know, small game like that. It also is just very useful to have. There's a couple we can take down. Nice, Randon. Oregon's a beautiful place. Later, VC. What's my actual name? Flinter. Has anyone got a great one yet? Yeah, one person has, but I don't think anybody else has. I think it's just one so far. How many kills do I think it will take? Uh, I'm going to guess to 1,500 or 2,000, somewhere in that range. That's my guess. It could be longer, though. It's hard to say. We don't really have too much to go off of at the moment. Hard to predict how long it's going to take. Random musk deer. I would definitely recommend it, Giga. Um, moose are very spread out on every map, so herd management will help you a lot by getting rid of so many of the zones that you have to grind. Like, I would recommend trying to get all of the single males to go to level twos, like all the single zone males. That'll make your grind, like, super, super good. Uh, Oregon is in the United States, Aussie. Uh-oh. 
Okay, I can't exactly fight you guys. I, I, I'm gonna delete the zone if I do. Uh, they do spook faster, Quentin. They spook from more, like, from further away as well. Uh, 300 meter spook distance, and they do react slightly faster as well. Alright, guys. As much as I want to keep going, I don't think I can. We've been going for about 8 hours and 45 minutes, so... Let's, uh, we're gonna end it right there. One diamond today, and it just happened to be a super rare. I can't believe that. Absolutely crazy. But we will, uh, we will be back tomorrow with more grinding. Not sure what time, but we will be back tomorrow. So, uh, thank you all for being here once again. I appreciate you all being a part of this grind. It's, uh, crazy to think that we stream for almost nine hours. But anyway, thank you all for being here. We'll be back tomorrow, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.